who I see.
see. Toot toot, get on board the bus. This is my exciting opening. Toot toot, it's bus time. Hello everybody! Wow, look at look at the look at me, I'm old now. Well soon. Well, yeah. <laughs> Lovely drink of I think that's piss. Um <laughs> Hello everybody, today uh, we are going to be playing, oh my microphone is apparently peaking like a motherfucker, is that better? Wait, hang on, that's better, la 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 la, yeah that's what it should be, stupid fucking microphone. Um, hello everybody, so, uh, <laughs> desert bus. Uh, tomorrow is my birthday. Two days ago, the YouTube channel turned 13 years old, and I figured, what's a better way of celebrating <laughs> entering the 14th year of my channel, where it's now legal to drink in the southeast where I grew up, than playing Desert Bus. Uh, all the way through. Eight godless fucking hours of Desert Bus. So that's what we're going to be doing today! <laughs> um, however, we will not be doing the old Desert Bus. A slight change in the schedule. We're going to be doing Desert Bus VR in non-VR mode, which is a thing. I could not get the Sega CD to work. At all, it's old, it's dusty, it's gross. It couldn't, it just didn't go. So I'm gonna eat a sweet now, Sarah. Chat. It's crazy that this channel is over half my life. It says JJ three five seven eight. Oh, hey Rebecca. Hello. You look lovely today. Oh, thank you. Um, this channel started before Skyrim came out. That's how old. <laughs> That's how old. You could do an actual hard way. Yeah, I was trying to. Got, I got burnt the CD and I tried to do everything properly, but because it's only prototypes, so it doesn't actually exist. But yeah, yeah, Skyrim came out uh, eight months after I started my channel. She's pretty fucking redonkulous. Um, also, I don't think I can click off the game when I start, so I need to catch up with all the twiddlies first, and then we'll read twiddlies as we go. But if we get. Uh, uh, like, gift twiddly, so I won't be able to read out the names or anything. I'll just have to keep up. And also, yes, there will be a webcam on. Of sorts. <laughs> Remind me when the bus gets... When we get in the bus to, to start the webcam up. Anyway, <clears throat> no man job this time. No, I've decided to have a nice time. Um, but literally, for the next eight hours, I am entirely reliant on you. I need to talk to you. Uh, you have to talk to me. This is just going to be us. Uh, I, it is going to be... Ho oh, ho. Oh dear. <laughs> I need you, please. Please, please talk to me. <laughs> if everyone goes quiet, I'm just going to go, Oh no. Anyway, let's read some Twiddly. Cyberwolf has resubscribed. Finally got comfortable enough with money to subscribe to Patreon. Whee! Um, my drive to work will be made much better by the podcasts. Only 100 left to catch up on. Uh, they get kind of miserable as we go on, but it's fine. Um, Dan, excited for Moffy coming back on episode. Oh, he's gonna. Oh, ooh, I, I knew he was coming back. Uh, <laughs> Anna Raptor has resubscribed, as is the Button King and Giraffes 19 of the Northern Beast, an untitled noodle. Growly fan 42 and Bob Stick 84 months. What? Um, yeah. Uh, sorry, Dan, you're doomed, says the Amorphous Gamer. None of us are interesting. No, some of you are interesting, right? 
Maybe. Oh, over on the YouTubes, Winter Hex is a new member. That apparently happened before the stream started, so hello. Hello, Winter Hex. Uh, and Ernest Bowden with £1.99 Aroni says, Happy birthday, old man. Thank you. I like this. It's like I get money in my cards, but the cards are chats. This is the podcast of Reverse Order is an interesting experience. Yeah, start, that's, it's the only way I can swerve to the right. <laughs> it's listen to them in reverse order. Oh, he's getting slightly more right wing. Hang on, I'm going to have a bite of a hot cross bun. How are you going to react to Doctor Who trailer racing today? I'm going to watch it on my phone, so you've got to tell me when it goes live. <laughs> it's... I think that's going to be like 10 hours of, uh, you know, stuff. Oh, a really solid bit in that across bond. Oh, it's a dead fly. No. <laughs> anyway, Mr. Zagreus with 50 twiddlies. Thank you so much. Ace is high, 54 with 10 twiddlies. Mr. Zinge, Blue Panda 396, Raybird Raven, Sabri, Sabre. I got it right that time. 651, Zebra's Legend, Sarabaum, uh, Kieran Tyndall, and Emma Pusheen have all subscribed or re subscribed. Emma Pusheen says, Happy birthday, Dan. Happy 13th anniversary. No cube, yes. I stand now. I'm in my 14th year. 13th year went all right for a bit at the end there. Uh, yeah, it was. Yeah, mm hmm. You can actually make this time. We're actually going to do it. I've never beat this game. I'm just, all these big streams are just beating games that I could never beat before. You know? That's the secret. Um, I've been watching you for 11 years, and I've loved every second. Words cannot describe what you mean to everyone. Oh, bless you. Thanks for making me smile and laugh. Keep being amazing. Love you, Rebecca, and the animals of the Nokia family. Oh, there's some of the animals are in here. Anna, Rebecca. Hello, Lilith. I've got a great video of Lilith. <laughs> <laughs> you should really get it. It's on the Discord, on the Patreon Discord. I think it's the best video Lilith we've ever done. Um, oh, Lightning Wing Dragon with five dollar roos over on. Oh, you can like super chats now. I didn't know that. Uh, over on the YouTube's and Skillful Skarmory, not Skamory as I've always been calling it, with ten dollar roos. Happy birthday, Dan! Enjoy the next eight hours of suffering to celebrate. I will. <laughs> I will. Wait, didn't beat this in your one million subscriber special? I beat the original Desert Boss, but I had to break the video up every two hours. So I never did it in one go. And then when we did it in VR, I crashed halfway through and then spent four hours coming back. And now... It's now! And we're going to do the whole thing. Yeah. Third Desert Boss. And the third one's always the best one. Everyone knows that. Like Toy Story 3! The Godfather 3! Matrix 3! It's been insane! It's resubscribed! Oh dear lord, happy birthday, Daniel! And also, almost a month! Almost a month! 85 months is almost a month now! Oh, I've been calculating the dates completely wrong. Uh, Mr. Zagreus, can't watch this now, but I'll catch the replay. Just bought a house and can't afford to be fired from this. <laughs> from this. But please do not crash this time. Don't listen to five hours of alarm sounds again. No, that will not happen. Unless it does, who knows. Uh, Bleebot5 with 100 trillion. Happy birthday, Dan. Got migraine today. This might just make it worse. I don't, but I have taken painkillers just to be on the safe side. Um, and, you know, some beta blockers to counteract the heart. Uh, uh, it's fine. You just take a lot of medicine. It's good. Let's quickly with $2 says, Hey, Dan, happy birth. I haven't slept. Fuck, it's 5 a.m. <laughs> well, go slap. I'll be here when you wake up. So don't you worry. Don't you worry. Uh, yeah, Mr. Valen, uh happy 84th birthday, Dan. Thank you. Ninja 0 first. Has resubscribed, as has Finch the Nurse, Visible Alarm, the Jackal of Nar, Leather Cap, Sonicu, uh, Definite. Whoa, what the fuck? Oh, Definite Lion Zero. I thought it said like defamation. I was like, oh god, I'm being arrested. No, that's not what defamation is. It doesn't matter. Uh, Frizzed with 245 trillion says, Happy birthday to you and your channel. Thanks for all the memories. Have fun designating a busing for 13 more years. Yes, I will get my bussy on. Wait, that's not a. Yeah, you allowed to say that on Twitch? I don't know. What's the word you can't say on Twitch? Let's say them all. Uh, JJ3570 has resubscribed. This is going to be a sleep aid for the next few nights. Lovely chubbly. Uh, Michael the Bye Guy TI100 has resubscribed. Uh, finally log back in. Uh, not just YouTube anymore. Yay! I'm going to be able to watch for an hour or so before I go to work. Okay, I'll get started. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. 
Oh, Ferris the Rainbow Cat says, good luck. That's a good luck about you with 10 pound of roadies. Thank you, Ferris the Rainbow Cat. On the YouTubes, because I am on YouTubes. Also, yeah, propeller is my anti-anxiety meds. Oh, I, I stack anti-anxiety meds. Don't worry. Um, it's fun. It keeps me going. Jack, 1095. Happy birthday, Daniel. Congratulations on hitting your 30s. Yeah, I'm calling it early 30s. Maybe 35, late early 30s. I think we'll go for. It's fine. It's fine. Is that what the special webcam is? What? The, oh, bossy. Yeah, 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 it is. Um, <laughs> do you know if this game is eight hours long or the map is big enough that it takes eight hours? The map is big enough that it takes eight hours. Also, it's not really a map. <laughs> You'll see. It's not really driving. Uh, Zyther has resubscribed as is Link Zero at Railroad 890. Boo Boo Lou has resubscribed. I've got a Twitch show to roll. I watch you back when you first released the Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 playthrough. Why have you got me having birthdays? It's making me feel old. I'm sorry. Techno Eevee with five pounds says, I hope there's sand in this game. Unfortunately, it's not. I've said something wrong. I'm actually playing Dessert Bus. We just drive through ice cream the whole time. Just ice cream. Yeah. Simpleton is banned. <laughs> one of the banned words. Yeah, one of them. One half of that is. Uh, Sabre 651. This is for your neurotal therapy after the stream. <laughs> Joke's on you. My therapy was yesterday. Uh, Tumble One, <laughs> 300 twiddlies. <laughs> I'm Holly Nerd. Hi, Dan. I have all my remaining twiddlies because I broke. Uh, I'm going for private surgery, which is next week. Oh, exciting. But I made brownies yesterday, so I feel less nervous. Enjoy your brownies. Is it to bribe people doing the surgery? Like, do a good job and there's brownies in it for you. That's a fucking genius idea. I bet they'd work even harder. Anyway. Uh, watching you while playing House Number 2. Thank you for the new addiction. I haven't played this since the stream. I want to. But I have played nothing this week. Bit of time. Bit of time. Constant Connect of Conscious with Thousand Twiddlies just says beep, 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 beep. And that's all the beeps we'll be hearing on this stream. Um, <laughs> I was like, that has resubscribed. 55 months, that's obviously a year. It's obviously a year. Lucius Dragon has resubscribed. And a day, uh, what's that? A gaydio, a gaydio, a godio. Uh, yeah, something like that. Has already subscribed. Hello, welcome. Yes. Mr. Valen says, can confirm. Bribing nurses with treats is a good idea. No, I'm paying £4,000 for the surgery. That should be incentive enough. That's a... Fuck me. That's a lot of money. Good. Then keep the brownies here if I can sell. Okay. So. That's what I'm saying about the launch desert bus. It's time. Quark. Just got my crippling fear of shitty buses and small rocks. Anyway, what are you playing today? Oh no! <laughs> this is the worst possible game for you. Okay. Uh, JJ3570. Last message before I have to go to Stupid Uni. My birthday. It's been a crazy 30 years. Going from a couple 10,000 subs to 2.5 mil. Maybe 2 mil in a year. <laughs> All right. Rub it in. Jesus. Okay. 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 The game is on in the background. Which I will now tab to with the power of this button here. It's not working. Why is it not working? Jesus, sweet, merciful, fuck Christ. Why is it not working? Oh, there's the audio. Yeah! Rock! Okay. Okay. Oh, Holly Robin with $5. Oh, by the way, I'm just going to say this now. There will not be a highlights video for this. There will be no highlights. Uh, I've been watching since I was eight. And now I'm almost 21. Um... <laughs> I have turned into a girl somewhere along the way. I don't know if it's related. I think it is in this chat, yeah. Are you playing the new desert bus? Yeah, I couldn't get the old one to work. Uh, Todd McLeod for the eight hours of suffering before I go do eight hours behind a bar. That doesn't sound like suffering. Oh, I'm doing the suffering. Yeah, that makes sense. Thank you for the five pounds and enjoy your eight hours behind a bar at 12 in the noon. Yeah, anyway. Oh no, this is Desert Bus VR. Yes, but... I'm not playing it in VR. Also, why am I playing with the thingy? Actually, I'm playing with the mouse. I need to put my name in. My name is Nerd Cubed. Well, it's Phil, but people call me that. And I've clicked off of the game somehow. So, we need to get into our bus. We're three minutes in. Oh, shit. We're only three minutes in. Uh, oh, as I, as I said. Uh, Cyprio with five. Give subs. They went to Orange Flare, Shivering Fire, Smelly Tubby, 444, uh, Glean You, and X Gears. Oh, yeah. Uh, Tremor Monkey with 100 trillion says, Happy Birthday! Uh, uh, Ali Kitty Cat has resubscribed, and Sir Icy Dragon has subscribed. 
as a spooky fooky. Hey, how's it fussy? What a way to spend a Friday night. Happy birthday, Dan. Thank you. Right, I'm going to click everything off and I've gone... Right, I'm up to date now. If I miss anything from now, it's because I can't click off the game because in the last game, the bus would stop if you stop. So, great. Face cam down when I get in the bus. Okay, we are, we are in. That's really well timed, that is. Yeah, I need to immediately turn off this. Shut up. Nobody cares. Okay. So, we are in. <laughs> I hate this fucking game so much. We are in Desert Bus. I need to now tab. Does that pause the game, actually? Like, completely? Or is it just muted it? Because if it pauses it, that would be really useful. I don't know how to tell. Nothing moves in this fucking world. <laughs> okay. Pause it there. It's now time to unleash. Are you ready for this? Oh, wait, hang on. Uh, Clonochrome has subscribed! I see Dragon with 10 Twiddlies! Happy birthday! It's putting in the only way I can, because uh, pregnancy wage sucks! Woo! Uh, thanks for the good times of the years. Uh, reminded me to take my meds today, lol. Yes, take your meds. Thank you. Uh, Ethan J with 30 Australian 90 dollar roonies. Thanks for uh, everything. Uh, absolute best bloke. Oh, bless you. Helps. I, I, can you tell they're Australian because he said the word bloke? Uh, happened so many times uh, through good and bad. Oh, helped so many times through good and bad times. Uh, always so relatable while doing it. How me grow up and just, yeah, thanks for it all. Thank you so much, Ethan J. Bless you. Gracious Link 1530 says, are we nearly there yet? <sighs> okay, so. Are you ready? Dave's Ventura Studios at 250 Twillies. Thank you very much. Are you ready? Boom. <laughs> I don't know if I'm in shot. Right, there we have me. Okay, so don't. I'm the driver. <laughs> I'm going to be watching y'all. <laughs> so it's such a stupid idea. This is going to be the webcam for the whole thing. Just, I'm the driver, innit? This is what you see is the... <laughs> So this is, the, this is going to be the thing. Um, yeah. <laughs> Don't make me tap the sign. <laughs> uh, all right, I'm going to zoom. It has actually brilliantly changed since I set it up this morning. So I will actually zoom out just a, just a little, just a touch. Uh, yeah, it's back. Why is it maximize zoom? There, that's all you're getting. Uh, actually, I can, I can, I can do it. Oh. Okay, okay. There we go. <laughs> so... <laughs> Len Mac, 300 twiddlies. Nick's claim he says, Dad, I'm late. I jumped through the bus window. I hope that's okay. Did it look okay? I have no idea if I'm in frame or anything, but <sighs> it's time. Are we ready? It's time to bus drive. Let's go. Desert bus. Eight godless hours begins now. Okay. Oh. Oh, I've got patience. So the bus veers, if you've never seen Desert Bus before, the bus just veers ever so slightly to the right and you can only jerk it around. So, yeah, it's this for the whole thing. So, yeah, I will try. Ooh, and there's things to see as we go past. I don't know what that was. Uh, we've been through it. So about eight hours and two minutes it should end. Before eight hours, three minutes, if I keep the button down, I have to hold the button. The face of the mirror is disturbing. Good. That's what I wanted it to be. But bus driver's paying attention. Alright, get comfy, guys. <laughs> uh, ah, Bazaar has resubscribed. Happy birthday. Almost a year? 24 months. That is almost a year. Um, the... <laughs> oh my god, the webcam's amazing. This was Rebecca's idea. Rebecca, Rebecca came up with this idea, and I was like, that's fucking genius. I absolutely will do that. Um, <laughs> why do you want to do this? It's my birthday, anyway. Uh, Tor Gorigonel with five Australian dollaroos. Uh, it's 10.57 here. Won't make it through all eight hours, but I'll give my all. Happy birthday. Thank you very much. Uh, Lightning Wing Dragon says, no, wait for me. They've been left behind. Two dollaroos, it wasn't enough. Wasn't enough. Um, but yeah, the, this is Desert Bus VR. You can just play it in non-VR mode. And it's free. You can experience this with me right now, if you're insane. really hard to check. <laughs> um, uh, Andrew Smiley has resubscribed. Thank you for my brilliant cameo over Christmas. You're very welcome. I like doing my little cameos. Uh, Abazar, happy birthday. Oh, yeah, I read that one. Cosmic Gynecologist says, are we there yet? Are we there yet? Uh, off the bus. Off the bus. Time to make me tap the sign. 
Uh, can we go, Paul? Asking if you'll make it. I'm gonna make it. Look, this is just—I just gotta do this for ages. Just my hands. I just don't wanna. Wait, can we join you on the bus? Oh yeah, this game's got that kind of connectivity. I suppose you might be able to. The only thing is, I—I I, I can't look around. <laughs> Wait, I can look around. It'd just be weird if I have that thing there. A uh, fade shop with one dollar. This is my thumb up. Can you see? There it is. <laughs> That's my mouth. Um. Yeah, maybe you'd be able to join in, I don't know. Eyes on the road, uh, road down, nine times. Look, this is me, eyes on the thing, eyes on the eyes. On the road, hang on, what if I like that? Yeah, full headshot! <laughs> maybe I'll have to do that. He's driving, can you turn the AC? It's rather warm in the back. No, shut up! Or maybe he's out the sign. Uh, okay, got to give him two of these. Oh, Tokido has three subscribed. Happy birthday, Daniel! So much you when I was 13, I'll be 25 in under two months. Oh god. Oh god. Uh, boo boo law! Oh, you are the person who asked, can we join you? Potent potentially. I don't actually know. Uh, Mr. Lane! Hey, Dad, I don't want to know since you're torturing yourself. You ever heard of uh, Vale Fisk? He tortures his friends in video games, making videos on YouTube that I think you enjoy. I've seen a lot of people who do stuff like that. There's one guy who makes, like, board games that are dreadful. Who's that person? I like that person. Small one was on there the other day. This will actually be the first Desert Bus vid that he's done live. That's true, actually. And this is Desert... I should change that thing to say Desert Bus for no hope. Uh, the Watch of Life with Fight Power! Top of the Dan! You're the only reason I would go to YouTube in high school. Oh. High school! Uh, thanks for the laughs and for my sense of humour. Drive safe! <laughs> you better say for me my ability to drive safe. I was like, oh, Jesus. So, you may notice this bus just goes left and right. There is no, like... You're not actually driving a bus. It's like one of those old LCD screen games you used to get that was driving. It was just left and right. Uh, Clementine with four ninety nine dollar rooms. Uh, no regular up there, Patriot Bucks. Uh, glad to make it to the this desert bus stream. Missed the first one we did ages ago. Watched the photo a few years ago. Happy birthday, Dan. Uh, Aaron Penny, Dan, it's eleven thirty. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> I'm paying attention. Dan, it's ah, it's eleven thirty p.m. here. I have to wake up early tomorrow. Why are you doing this to me? Because I love you, Aaron Perry. And thank you for the uh, 10 Australian dealery dodgery doos. Dodgery doos. That one is Vale Fisk. Ah, okay. Yeah, cool. Yes, no, I've seen, I've seen the, uh, I think, maybe. I don't know. There's loads of them. Uh, I never remember people's names. I've heard names. <laughs> That's what Jeez, I can make the air from. Ooh, it smells like a burning forest. Wow. Uh, right, read that one. Uh, Indios Robot with 500 twiddlies. Goodness gracious. Hi, Dan. First time catching a stream. As a Jubeck and played uh, Unrail together. Oh, happy birthday. Thank you very much. Uh, and speaking of 100 twiddlies, may you have a satisfactory anniversary of your date of manufacture. Not a robot. Not a fucking robot. Uh, thank you for the birthday message. Go for the Ah, you are very welcome. Uh, I appreciate that you know me enough to sit down for them. Yes. If, I, if you're from Twitch, I tend to get lazy and sit down midway through my uh, cameos. Yeah. Uh, topically, it says, Oh, Christ, for this day I'll have wing mirror phobia. It's not a wing mirror. It's a rear view mirror. I can see your ears. If a car comes to the other way, I will crash into it and die, by the way. Um, I don't think that's a thing. <laughs> Uh, Jack Production has resubscribed for 61 months and says, Happy birthday. Thank you very much. Uh, and that's it. I'm caught up. I'm caught up. Yes. I can talk to real people. Oh, fuck. Paying attention. I've made it vibrate my controller, and that is so useful. Oh, look at that. We're eight hours in already. God, the time has flown. Oh, that's minutes. Suddenly getting quite regretful about doing this, I'll be perfectly honest. Um... <laughs> Uh, I wonder if we can actually get the bug this time. Oh yeah, there might be a bug in this game. Like the splats of the windshield, because it was in the original Desert Bus. Uh, 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 mind the road edge, I will. Uh, Matril Delirus. Because I am I'm barely paying attention to the road, I'll be perfectly honest at this bit. Oh, I should change my um, control sensitivity down so I don't have to press it as hard. That's more useful. Um, how does it feel complete the first 160th? It's like, what's 60th? Piece of piss, that 60 more times? Yeah, that's not gonna take too long at all, is it? I feel a bit sick, can we stop for a minute? No, life hacker, we're gonna swerve. <laughs> that's so stupid. 
Uh, the official wiggers are you sit. It does, Alice Bolden. I'm getting the smell from it. If you want some in the back, I'll give you a waft. Anyway, can I actually? <gasps> There's people in my car. Hello, everybody. I don't know who you are. <laughs> so if you get, okay. oh yeah, there you are. Oh, that's horrifying. So people can actually, if you download the game, I'm guessing you can just join in. <laughs> just join in. You can just be there. That's fucking horrifying. It's just, yeah, well, at least some people have got the bus of me. I'm not alone. Nice. Yeah, first for hours is fine. Hours five to seven, you go insane. Hours eight is with across the finish line. That is exactly how it tends to go. Yeah, that is, yeah. 2% of the way there. This is like a normal loading bar. I'm, I'm, I'm having a good time. Uh, a Foxy has resubscribed. Have a birthday, Dan. Have a wonderful day. Thank you very much. So nice and kind. <laughs> You're so fucking lovely. Anyway. Uh, ship part two, when? Uh, it's gonna happen. One of these people is a murderer. Yeah, it's that one. <laughs> Already bored. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, this is the ADHD bus. Uh, we're going to some sort of special conference. <laughs> uh, Palsy on Twitch has Penelope Pit Stop, no more fictional. No, no more job gloves. Come on. Oh, fuck. Uh, <laughs> ADHD bus. Anyone get Terry looks right away stiff the air freshener? I've got another one over there, you can't see it. Yeah, that one's the one you're all smiling with this. That's my secret one. I did try it, I was gonna flip it so it worked properly, but I couldn't work out doing that, so. How are the flying heads of passengers not the creepiest thing on the bus? Because yeah, I'm on the bus. Oh, I got eyes. Um, someone's pissed on the back seat. Oh god, there's another person! The piss has formed into a being! Oh, this is getting a little bit weird, actually. Oh, whoops, daddy. Anyway, smart idea of the mirror. Thank you. I, I wouldn't say smart, but I'd say, you know, it's, it's good. Dad, where do you get your license? You have something else experience with virtual driving. Yeah, but like... No. I wonder if this is like a real bus we could take. Now that people are trying to piss bus. Count it, 11 minutes in, as far as we got before people started trying the phrase piss bus at me. Oh. Hot cross bun, because it's fucking Easter. Although in this house, it's hot cross bun era all the time. Do you have legs? Me personally? No. Sold them. Wasn't using it. Um. This game has online PvP as a tag and save, so when the pass is going to start brawling. I think that one already is. <laughs> Oi! Settle down! Settle! Settle! Thank you. <laughs> Oi! <laughs> oh dear. You hear the hot cross buns in Iceland and now takes instead of crosses. What? What? <laughs> what? That's the real thing. Oh shit! I don't know how you join people's buses, but um, if you got a VR headset, you can just be in this ride with me. You can actually you can be in the bus. Jack says, you have beautiful eyes. These aren't mine. I stole them. Yeah. Is this on Steam or? Uh, it's on Steam, yeah. I think there was no other option. It was just in Steam or other things? I don't know. It's also free. Let's throw sweets to the driver, <laughs> says Tripod Scotch Chambi. Don't you fucking throw sweets at me. Hang on, wait. I can throw him back. Ow. Okay, so I thought, a quarter of an hour in. Done, basically, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Why do we sink the wheels on the bus? Oh, no. Yeah, for some reason, Iceland thinks crosses aren't okay anymore, and the shape they went for the race is, uh, is an anemic tick symbol for some reason. Is that real? What the fuck is wrong with people? What road is this? This is the road from, uh, uh, where the fuck are we? Tucson to Las Vegas. It's a real road. 360 miles we're going to be traveling today on this perfectly straight road with a car, a uh, bus that, as you can see, just ever so slightly veers to the right at all times. This is content, apparently. Um, and if I try and just gently tweak the, the cut, really, if I, yeah, if I hold the, 
<clears throat> the analog stick becomes digital, so if I push and hold left, even the tiniest bit, full left swerve, so I can't just correct it. <laughs> perfectly straight. In this community, it's the only thing in this community that is perfectly straight. Um, Tuxon, if you want to pronounce it the John Way, why would I want to? Why would I want to pronounce it the, the John Way? Um, Jack with five pounds, been watching you for over ten years. You helped me through some of the toughest times. Thank you, Dan. Is driving under the influence legal in America? That's a question for you people in chat. How many people in the bus? We've got four people in the bus decided to look at each other, which is a bit frightening to be perfect. <laughs> Oh dear. Uh, Frazzo, the five dollars. Australian dollar rules. Hey, Dan, watching for 10 years. Anyways, any more Rollercoaster Tycoon videos? There was one like a few weeks ago. Influence of what? Drink? Okay, wait, hang on. <coughs> it sounds like it's fine. Got to do this one handed. There it is. <laughs> Strong stuff is going to get me through. <laughs> Is it too early to drink in America? Mmm. Ooh, that goes down smooth. <clears throat> Dead day. So if I go off the road at any point, the, the bus will crash and we will have to start again. Um, any drunk drivers in chat? Yeah, you know. What drink are you drunk? Everything. Uh... You're an influencer, so it feels like you got to drive under the influence. That makes perfect sense. Yes. Yes. Right. Good. Mm -hmm. It's your birthday, so no. Can't be America. Where's your gun? Uh, I, let, I let the person in the front seat hold it for me. It's <laughs> a really smart idea. <laughs> why, why do I get the feeling that all that's going through their head right now is the SpongeBob theme? <laughs> okay. 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 Uh, oh, my controller's vibrating as well. Oh, Ezra, you on board? Whoops, 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 <laughs> whoops. Oh, dear. Okay. Who lives in a pineapple under the pineapple under the pineapple under the pineapple under the pineapple <laughs> I'm okay. My well, YouTubing life just flashed before my eyes. God, oh, those fogs were awkward. Anyway. <coughs> Colin! Colin? Columns is in the chat. No, Colin Malcolm. Happy birthday to one of my favorite YouTubers. Is that me? Ah, uh, been watching you for 10 years. It's about the times of Minecraft and Star Trek Elite Force. Good shit. Uh, bought your book, full thing. I have a book. I have two, in fact. One's nearly done, one is done. Oh, I've got it on my desk. Hang on, wait. Wait. <laughs> well, I could, we can read my book together. Should we read my book together? Wow. I could just pan it up and down <laughs> like this. You know, just have a read as we go. 17 minutes. Okay, I will admit I felt that one. That felt... Oh, sorry. <clears throat> By the way, I felt like um, that was a... Uh, that was a long time. That didn't feel like a time. That was like quarter past, and then it was like still quarter past. And I'm like, oh, I didn't like that. A uh, Quan in the YouTube's uh, with 50 Australian digital dollar dues. Uh, I've been watching since 2012. My favorite videos from back then were the Armor 2, Your Trek Simulator 2 road trips. Ah, uh, uh, Dan, help! I feel actively nostalgic when I hear your voice. Much love from a fellow South Island Sea victim. I'm so sorry. Wait, you're in Australia. Why are you give me Australian bucks? Wait. Well, hey. <laughs> That's, mm hmm yeah. Um, I mean, you escape from Southend, that's absolutely a thing. Uh, Loki19 says, the webcam's up to you despite. Absolutely not my idea. It's Rebecca's idea. Wasn't it? Hello. Yep. <laughs> that's the second driver I've got in case I need to whittle. Panel scan book reading. We could totally do that. Yeah. They really went third time to charm. I mean, I did it the first time, sort of, I suppose. There, there's a graphic sex minigame. Who are you talking to? What has a graphic sex minigame? I want to play. I got warning on this game, it contains sexual content. Yeah, it's the one in the front. <laughs> what do you think they're doing? <laughs> oh, oh, the back has gone as well. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Okay, gotta stop looking at them. Gotta stop looking at them. 
Will you be live at midnight? I hope not. I fucking hope not. Sunny Jim! I escaped South End, but it drew me back. Didn't escape me, did you? Didn't escape. Uh, we've got Maddington and Tim Tam have resubscribed. It's out here. Good luck with going insane for the next eight hours. Oh, yeah. Eight hours I gotta do this for. Uh, it's the vibration. Any update on Paradox? No, Oslak Natus. No, I have, I've done my bit. Uh, almost, I mean... I submitted it to the publisher... Almost exactly six months ago. 26th of September, I submitted my draft. By February, I was done with the... Sort of like the... the structure edits. And I hope shit back since. Matt, if you're watching... <laughs> Email Unbound and be like, uh, what's the state of the copy edit? Maybe some royalty free tunes to groove you. I'll just sing any song. Give me a song, I'll sing it. It's a desert bus stream. We have to make our own fun. Uh -huh. mm -mm -mm. Oh, Zebra Legends is the one in the back of the bus. Hey, Zebra Legends. Hey. 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 Hi. Oh, fuck you there. <laughs> Some fucking shifty eyes. <clears throat> Not singing the wheels on the bus. <laughs> no. Oh, Jeeves! With 300 twiddlies! So much ago, 10 years ago, when I um, was but a child. Uh, no, I'm a whole ass adult. Mm, whole ass. Uh, and you've been one of the most positive influences on my life. I'm a hero. <laughs> my friends regret the effect you've had on my sense of humor. Legitimately so sorry. Um, Barber Stig says, Party bus, party bus, party bus, party bus, party bus, party bus, party bus. <laughs> Which way makes sense for me to go? I can't get out. Um, oh, 99 bottles of beer them raw. Okay, here we go. 99 bottles of beer on the wall 99 bottles of beer I do with skid they all fall off the song's over uh, BJ Hoggy has resubscribed as is Astip or a stip oh, a stip is a new subscriber hello welcome uh, Sabri651 says woo the vibrations are tickling my feet <laughs> Abby Speak says sings Rebecca's favourite song I don't want to It'll probably get me banned from Twitch. <laughs> probably get Rebecca banned from Twitch as well. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, Constant looking at a gynecologist. So, uh, he's trying to sing. But no, I'm not singing your wills of the thing. Oh, Roman. Roman Secundus says, hey, Dan, I'm singing at the front. Oh, <laughs> but the party is now at the back. Would you not behave? It's always one, isn't it? It's always one little shitty kid. This is why I had to stop being the bus driver. Picking up kids for school was a fucking nightmare. Mostly because they weren't kids and I wouldn't take them to school. Prison! Prison bus driver, that's what I was! Just kept dropping off at school for funny. <laughs> that's what the fuck I'm talking about. <clears throat> How much rap god you still know? Um, none of it. It's all gone. Why is that in the middle of the road? Lines. Uh, <laughs> boo boo loo loo! Do you ever need another game to spend eight straight hours on? Look for Peaks of Yore. The last mountain takes around that long with only one break really allowed. Ooh, Peaks of Yore. I don't like the sound of that. Statue 5, I've been watching for around 11 years now. Saying how far you've come. Uh, and how I'm not in year four anymore. What's your favorite kind of bird? Ooh, that's tricky. Chickens. <laughs> or budgies. Playing the home field right now. My babies. I've got to say they're my favourite tonight. I do like the chickies though. I love looking up my little chickens. They will not be on this. They're not allowed to be on buses. They had an incident. It's fine. They're all banned from buses. Uh, Kieran Tyndall with 300 to Lee's. Have a day down. Been watching for almost 12 years now. Can't say I'd probably be here without you, Vince. Oh, bless you. I'm never going to money before, but you deserve it. Have a good one. Thank you very much for the 300 to Lee's. Don't crash, you fucking idiot. 24 minutes. Okay. <clears throat> okay. I'm just getting... It's fine. 
Got your book and started reading it yesterday, says Crumbly. The story of Sim Dad was very tragic. That's the Sims, baby. Anything can happen. Uh, ah, Big Ashlar Sam has resubscribed. Uh, Prince and Luna! Or Princessin! Princess and Luna! Princess and Luna. Uh, how about the dad? I started watching you as a 9 year old boy, now I'm a 21 year old woman. You missed me a lot growing up and helped shape who I am today. A lot, so many people say that. I'm just like, you're all your genders are wrong! What is it about me that does that? I don't know. I just feel, I feel like it's more just a case of, I'm like, hey, here's a place where people can talk about this stuff. And we ban all the dickheads, and people go, Oh, that's what that thing is. I get it now. Yeah. They realized the no cube to transgender pipeline was so common. Oh, it is. Oh, Blue Bot 5, it is so common. To this day, down sea leg suits. Uh, fourth Doctor Energy. Oh, I don't have any jelly beans on me this time. I have jelly beans. I don't have jelly babies either. Arr. One twentieth of the way through. Easy. Just got to do that 20 more times. Donut. Oh, Ooh, fuck. <laughs> Steam with the donut. Ste oh, now I got donut hands. Fuck. Oh. Fuck. Fuck. Um, num, num. Fuck. Um, num, num. Fuck. <laughs> the tissue's under the plate. I'm having a problem. Oh, fuck. It's all going fine. Okay. <clears throat> It. Okay, it's fine. We're all good. Uh, Street Menace with ten pound erroneous on the YouTube's. I've been watching your videos since you played through Roller Coaster Tycoon Three. Appreciate your dedication through the years. I've never stopped, apart from that year where I stopped. But I'm back now with videos and stuff. There's a video today at nine. I think it's the, uh, the it's the house flipper video. Um. Dan is patient zero of the woke mind virus. Yeah. That will make you all woke. Don't turn on drive, kids. Yeah, don't turn on drive. It's, it's terrifying. Um. <laughs> uh, well, who, who, who else has done a... Who else has done a... Who else has done a... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Uh, the pastor has resubscribed. Uh, uh, singing songs about we. Trevor Peanut has resubscribed. Happy birthday. I've been watching since. I'm sorry. Happy birthday. I've been watching since the London 2012 video. Shout out generic twat. Forever in a heart. Uh, MLA, okay, has resubscribed. Uh, oh, subscribed. Hello. Uh, Deninja Buggy and War Money 42 have all resubscribed. Oh, yeah. Damn it, a queer bat. I'm not like. Gay Ozzy Osbourne. <laughs> I'm a little like Gay Ozzy Osbourne, actually, thinking about it. Um, uh, Bigger Shill said, started watching at age 11. Now I'm nearly 23 and just bought my first house. That is legitimately wild. Who buys houses at 23? <laughs> Debbie says, thanks for celebrating my birthday with a stream. It's my first time catching a stream as well. You're very welcome. It's nice to have you. Well, weather's changing. No, it's not. Hey, does this become night time at some point as well? I don't know. Getting about 20 FPS in this game. Yeah, it's all of this beautiful, realistic foliage. <laughs> hey, Dan, don't read this and keep your eyes on the road. I am! Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Flaster says I'm 23 and I just proudly brought some Lego. You can afford Lego?! Whoa, Captain Rich over here. <laughs> um, magnification that rearview mirror is even more than Dan's description. I thought it had to be like super zoomed in. It was, I thought it was funny that way. And then I zoomed out a bit and then I zoomed back in again because OBS is like, oh, you've kept sayings. You want me to save those? Tough. Uh, you have to kind of fight about it. It's good. Still remember you were about the bus habits way back when. Um, oh no, I do! Oh, I remember that video. I got rid of that video, I think. Because I didn't like it. Um, you know, if there's one I'm realistic thinking of this game, so the rumble strips aren't ear bleedingly loud. I have turned the volume quite far down, but everyone seems, it seems fine. 
It seems fine. Oh, fuck. Uh, Nerd of the North has resubscribed. Been watching since I was 15. I'm now 24 with a biotech office job. You kept me chuckling insane. You spelled sane wrong. Does that mean you're insane? <laughs> Wait, hang on, are you one of them? Oh, everyone's sitting quite calmly now. Oh, there we go, there we go. It's attention seeking, it's just attention seeking. This bus is a shower, I'm gonna use it, says Michael the Bye Guy. Enjoy. Enjoy. Yeah. Can you throw it away, cup? No. That's six hour mark, definitely. Um. <laughs> I won't, I'll try, no, I won't. Because it's me. People actually do sleep with this shit. And I sleep with fucking shit now, so. I like the, the dulcet tones of the uh, best old age pensioner movie reviewing home that there is. Red Letter Media. <laughs> Wait, are they real people? Yeah, if you download the game, you can join. I don't know how many people could join, but. It's like, yeah, it's a community bus play. That's what this is. Uh, Jack Brilliant Live! How about there, Dan? From a real American bus driver. You're doing a great job! You exude kindness and positivity. That is a valuable boast as the captain of a bus, an online community. I've learned a lot from you, thank you. Oh, bless, that's so kind! I'm on the wrong side of the row the entire time, but Jack, if you didn't spot that, it's fine. Anyway, Red Witch on the YouTube for five pounds! It's so weird, it's been 13 years. I've been watching since How Monster Sunk at Minecraft. Loving the recent videos. Rocker Stacker 3 and uh, FT. Oh, football, yeah, the football budget. 2024. Wait, wait, FT? Is it called that? Wait, what was FT? Must be football manager. Yeah, 2024. Yeah, probably. The next video is pretty... It's one of my favourites I think I've ever done. Because when I got back to YouTube, I was like, I have to go and do some good stuff now, but this next one, it's Saturday's video. Oh, it's Friday, it'll be up for Patreons. Oh, Patreons get two videos today, what the fuck? Oh no, because they got... They've already seen the highlight. Um... Dan's transition from Mission of a Partner to Real Boy inspired other people to go through their own transition stories. <laughs> I mean, that's what I like to do, you know? I mean, it helped Stephen Larson with their transition from Mission of a Boys to Wrestling Boys, so. <laughs> so the VR one I want to download, I mean, yeah. It's VR, but you can click, don't play in VR when you put it up. Uh, Gremlin04 with 20 pounds! Goodness, thank you. Happy birthday! I've been watching you since uh, GTA 4 mods. I was eight, maybe. Now I'm 19. You were eight watching my videos? That's my face. I'm going, oh no. <laughs> I taught you some bad words. That air just sounds lovely. Um, <laughs> seems like only four people could be on the bus. Uh, okay. Hello, four people. Well, two of them are dead. So <laughs> maybe you can join on. Um, right about with the hundred twenties. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! I was taking a train journey the other day and realised that actually went to the pose of pensive man from the old train to videos. Uh, definitely bogan with four four twiddlies. I have this many bits. Have them all. Why not? Thank you very much. Uh, right about says also I've been watching since before I was born and now I'm legally dead. Oh my god, I'm so old. Uh, Senor Mitz. Happy birthday, Dan! With ten pounds, thank you. It's like uh, money in what cards. I'm gonna spend it on Lego and hot toys. Been watching you since I was 11. I'm 23 now. Been a huge inspiration as someone who's going through the ADHD diagnosis process. Thanks for the years of fun. You're very welcome. Um, it's in comparison, we played GTA San Andreas as a kid. You were quite mild as far as bad language goes. Oh, Carrot Spy. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I wonder if I a swear because of you, Growlithe fan asks. Most, if not all. On the topic of Growlithe fan, the new Pokemon card should be here, but they're not. They haven't turned up yet. I should have got my new my new set. Um, because the Patreon started doing well again, we can go back to opening Pokemon cards on stream. So next week will be next Friday will be a big Pokemon card opening stream. It will be our biggest one yet. Which Rebecca is very excited for. Listen to this woo. Woo! Oh my God, that was actually a what the fuck? I'm really excited. Holy shit, are you in the bus? Oh, that one's falling asleep. Tell them about the One Piece cards. I'm not telling about the One Piece cards. <laughs> um, uh, what happened? Topically, uh, with five pounds, says, live, laugh, generic clown. And that's the, <laughs> that's the three most involved things. Uh, Eggman Cedar says, that was the loudest Rebecca has ever been. It was loud. 
Right about it says, that's the loudest Rebecca has ever been. Dan P says, that's the loudest I've ever heard Rebecca be. <laughs> Pop Keen says, who is that and what they've done with Rebecca? I don't know. Rebecca's into bug one. A little bit. Uh, Aka, shoo, shoo, shoo. As we subscribe, happy birthday. Catching you in the loud cafe for my lunch, so please shout. Hello, can we have one sandwich over here, please? One egg and cress sandwich. Hold the egg and the bread. I just want cress. Handful of cress. I demand it now. I really hope you're playing that loud, because if you are, you deserve to suddenly just be given a handful of cress. Uh, Floyd, <laughs> 999. Powderoni, seven birthday now. I've been watching you since I was nine. Ah, uh, hence the 999. Now I'm at university. Happy to see you have such a loving community. Yeah, they're all pretty good. All you fuckers are pretty good. Uh, 35 minutes in. Yeah, we're going to knock this out of the fucking park, innit? We're going to knock this out of the fucking park. I thought it was going to knock on and ask you to keep noise out. Actually, we, for today, were like, please. They've decided that the fence is wrong. For those of you following this, they will talk about it in a fucking Patreon podcast. They decided the fence that they built ages ago is wrong and they have to rebuild a chunk of it, which meant that my last week of time has been endless fucking hammers and nail guns. It's been great. Um, George Coplier with 200 sacks. Uh, been watching your videos since the overgrowth one, apparently 12 years back. Must be parasocial, but I appreciate all you've done. Appreciate all you've done. I just find appreciate what I've done. I appreciate the works of Tim Schafer. But I don't, um, bloody hell, the bus is going everywhere. Uh, you know, just just don't go to people's houses. That's how you keep from social being bad. <laughs> so totally on this bus, just piss out the window. It's fine. Plaster says, Dan, can you please tell Rebecca that I have, I blame them for my now crippling addiction to Balatro. Hey. <laughs> oh yeah. I like, yeah, it's good. It's good stuff. Um, I remember the Saints for Three Bobbleheads video. No, you don't. No one remembers that. I'm fine. I'm sane. I'm sane enough. I'm sane enough. Uh, Sky, Comet Zero, and Brock WS. And oh, 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 Ray Tail Pimp has resubscribed. Dan P says, I started watching you 20 years ago when I was seven. I'm now 56. My goodness. The Super ID and Trick Norris have resubscribed. Dan P. Peter, fuck, fuck, fuck. Uh, are you sure this building project is some ma money laundering scheme? Oh, no. I think it's Belarus. Happy birthday, Dad. Before you see your webcomic. Fuck, you've been around for even longer than 13 years. Uh, thanks for many, many years of loss. Uh, and craving beards. Get a new show for your birthday. Check this out, motherfuckers. Look at the color. What? Yeah, hang on. Shirt reveal. Shirt reveal. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at the colors. Look at the colors. Fuck you all. That's my uh, shirt reveal dance. Um... <laughs> I picked it out specially for chat. <laughs> uh, uh, prim, primby, one. Oh, did we get any prime? Oh, <laughs> Whenever we're in... <laughs> Whenever we're in a supermarket and I see prime, I very loudly go to Rebecca and go, Oh, do we need any prime? <laughs> Rebecca finds it hilarious. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, Nick Knack uh, 799 Australian dollar rules. Have some dollars for the Hate Your Neighbor Fund Also for Blame Rebecca for stuff They're the reason I started watching One Piece They're the reason I started watching One Piece We're just about to hit episode like 100 or some shit Dan, you have that wife's have Dalek I get asked that all the fucking time All the time and I find that really weird. Why would I get rid of a life-size Dalek? It's there. I can literally see it. It's looking at me. I'm looking at it. It's just over there. It's it's true and real. <laughs> Prime is no price energy drink in the UK. Yeah, it's like Logan Paul and KSI got together and had a baby that tastes like Barry's and piss. <laughs> it's true. Uh, Tough timer. Happy birthday, Dan. Glad to see you enjoy. Are you still enjoying being a YouTuber? I do. I really do. i um, been a fan of you for around a decade. Thank you. Watching them ducks. They're conspiring. Uh, no, the chickens are protecting me from the ducks. It's true. It's true. Um, just put it outside to freak out the neighbours. I mean, I don't think they're exciting enough to be scared by saying they don't understand. 
Uh, Stroll did a five-hour drive today. It's like at 5 a.m., 260 miles. Patrick Podcast kept me sane throughout. Can we go and see you doing this? Perfect timing. Yeah, I'm doing an eight-hour drive that's 360 miles. I don't have any podcasts to listen to. Unless I push that button. But we don't want to push that button. Anything can happen if we push that button. Well, I'll just turn the radio back up. Um, they sell private answer for £2, but people resell it for £10. Yeah, I, I had, this is a true story, a legitimate child come up to me and ask for, for £5 to buy a bottle of Prime. That legitimately happened to me. I'm not going to tell you what I did next. Uh... <laughs> Seven pieces, that's the shirt for radio. Thank you. Uh, Dan. What's that? McGeechy has subscribed. I butchered that name, I'm sorry. Uh, Zumigal has resubscribed. And JJolt42. I love staying watch, but I'm jet washing a patio, so I'll catch you at a halfway point. Happy birthday. Thank you. Your legitimate child asked you to buy them Prime. No. Can't sell I'm going to go to the gist. A child legitimately asked me to. I may have told the child what was actually in Prime. I said it was... <laughs> I, s <laughs> I told the child that... He did actually do this. <laughs> I told the child that he shouldn't drink Prime because there's been a government investigation and it turns out it's actually just blended squirrels <laughs> and the child looked terrified and I went it's not really a surprise because that's what KSI stands for kills squirrels indiscriminately I think I overplayed my hand on her indiscriminately but the kill squirrels part I think definitely I haven't seen that child since Anyway, um, it's fine. It's fine. Uh, <laughs> it's absolutely fine. Oh, uh, Kai... <clears throat> Kai Clue 74 with a 79.9 Australian dollar roost. Shit, it's gone off the thing. It's gone off the thing. Rebecca, find that comment. It was a good one. It's huge. It was big. Find the thing. On Twitch. On, no, on YouTube. Oh, not on YouTube. Go on YouTube. I need, to, I need it to be read. I missed it. It was too long. Everyone started saying that I... <laughs> Start laughing. Twitch is on, YouTube's on such a fucking delay. Elsie Chestonarian uh, and Neocar56 and Ali Jim have all resubscribed. Boo Boo Law says that shirt makes me uh, appreciate the current camera shot. Thank you. It's actually, it's blue and black. That's the colours on there. There's no white or gold in it at all. Um, oh, Rebecca's found it. Okay, good. Oh, well done. Uh, Mr. No Cubes, this is from uh, Kai Clue 74. Um, hang on, I'll have to do the old person thing. It was the uh, wonderful catch you live from the other side of the world. Uh, from the How Not to Suck at Micro videos to now, you mind you point to the UK YouTube scene. Ashens, Evan Blackery, Barry, Tom Scar, and Beyond. Merry Birthmas. Thank you so much. I had to get that one because that was 79.99 Australian Digiri Dollar Redoos. That's like 40p nowadays, isn't it? It's, it's about that. I think it's about that. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. The Australian Digital Juice. Buff Voice Root says, Are you American? Rebecca! Yeah. It's happening again! <laughs> yeah. Um. <laughs> Uh, Woodsy XD over on the Twitchies with 300 twiddly twiddly rules. Hi Dan, start watching you 30 years ago. My brother suggested I watch your first Minecraft building thing at the ripe old age of 8. I'm 21. Hang on, we've got to stay on the road. What the fuck's that? Oh, just a fall down thing. I'm 21 and starting my new job uh, as a Queensland paramedic next week. My first time interacting with the stream. And I'll say a massive thank you. You've influenced my life in more ways you can imagine. So, you're, are you paramedic because I played Surgeon Simulator? Did that like awaken something in you? Because I feel like so many people are like, I watched your truck driving videos and now I'm a truck driver. I'm like, why? What happened? What What happened? Um Ron about says, Ned Cube, traumatizing children since 2011. Oh, I've been traumatizing children for a lot longer than that. Tim Lay has resubscribed and says, Happy birthday, Dan, holding your stream in I can for the entire fucking thing. I want you to see the fatigue in my eyes. 
We'd rather move to Australia or have a boxing match with KSI. Rather move to Australia. <laughs> if I, I feel like if I start boxing, I enjoy it, like, because I do, um, I do, I, I follow the internet. I don't really. But I, I always see that the, um, the one of the poor, I think it's Jake Paul, and he does all that boxing with people who are either old and retired or not boxers. And he's like, oh, I'm the best. I'm going to fight Mike Tyson, a 56 year old man. You know what else fights Mike Tyson? Stairs. Right, let's be perfectly honest. <laughs> That's the... Uh, just go against the current champion. It'll turn into jam. It'll be fucking hilarious. Uh, Tom McLeod. Uh, for my last birthday, I got Tesco's logo hoodie, but it says, uh, Tory's very little help instead. I like that. That's not what I got for my birthday. Can I have my birthday presents yet? No, it's not your birthday yet. Right Rails says sausage! <laughs> Love you, Tana Rebecca. I have to say the word sausage like that. I still do that. Next up, Jake Paul versus Joe Biden. <laughs> uh, I think Dad fundamentally misunderstands the purpose of purpose of Rearview Mirror. No, no, you, that's what you're seeing looking in the Rearview Mirror. Just saying. Yeah. <laughs> Jake Paul versus a coughing baby. Uh, you can pretend fight though. Fucking Logan Paul's a fucking great wrestler as much as he's a twat. Um, <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Jake Paul versus poor Victorian chimney sweep. <laughs> uh, we're all singing Dad's lap. Yes. I'm still waiting on that Elon versus Zuck fight. You're not ever going to see that. Do you know why? Because Mark Zuckerberg would fucking melt. Elon Musk, he would obliterate him. Because Zuckerberg has got the bullied so much he went to karate vibe about him, right? There's definitely, like... Elon Musk has got the guy who thinks he can fight but can't fight. And is like, yeah, well, I'm not going to fight you now because reasons. He's got excuse vibes about him. That's my vibe. I feel there's a non-zero chance that Mike Tyson still has a terrifying monster inside him and Paul gets destroyed. I mean, that is the hope, isn't it? The funny, funny hope. Um. <laughs> uh, do you miss Pensive Man for Train Simulator? Well, I did a Train Simulator for a few days ago and ended up becoming the Train... Train Man. That's, that's not turned up. I think that turned up. <laughs> Musk has my mum said I can't find some very... My mum says it's dinner time and I can't come out and play. Um. <laughs> Cost of the gynecologist! Uh, oh god, oh god, things happened. What happened? Oh, it's just an Eric, the three subs! And kicked off a hype train! They went to Samogli, Dragon Nexus, and Lunar Pearl. Thank you very much. I'll suggest an area. Happy Birthmas to me. Um. The best description of Musk I heard is he looks like a handsome man who walked through Chernobyl. <laughs> Jesus. I mean, yeah. Uh, no malicious with 50 sex. Thank you for the early happy birthday last month. It's an uh, early happy birthday if you return. Oh, bless you. Love you all. Take care and stay safe. Thank you very much for the 50 sex. Uh, okay, I'll see scenario has just broken my phone. A hundred gift subs. Rebecca, give me a woo. Woo. That you gave a bigger woo for fucking Pokemon cards. I love Pokemon cards. <laughs> I can't read them. I literally have no way of clicking on it. Because I, I assume this is like the, the original Desert Bus, where if you stop, the, it breaks down and you have to go back. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much. Oh, Angus resubscribed as well. I saw that one. I rushed out with three gifty subs. 100 subs is fucking mind-blowing. Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, 12 cat. Uh, sorry, it's, it literally is now starting to glitch out. 12 cat with 100 twiddlies. Hi now, happy birthday! Not sure if cookies are inside, like, but um, to respond to your cameo, we have my IRL! My two before the end of the year. Also, my birthday cameo had the order a week after my birthday, so we're even. Also, why'd you have two review mirrors? This is so you can stare into my fucking soul. A hundred fucking gifts up! That's level nine hype train! You did it by yourself! You slowed it down the VR video and stopped then. I mean, I did crash in the VR video. <laughs> Dank, you're not press tab. I don't know, and I don't want to because I'm already 49 minutes in. I don't want to do 49 minutes. Should we type the names out for you? Just shout if you got one. <laughs> I should have chat on the screen thinking about it. Ah. 
Oh dear. Say Plato, which is my name, I don't know. Says, Anonymous Annoyed. It's the 18th birthday yesterday. Happy birthday to you. Uh, Tim Lace, it's Dan, it's Rebecca, your only passenger on your way to pick up Matt. I'm not gonna pick up Matt. Matt's in the engine, he's just, he's running around like a little hamster. <laughs> Uh, Stardify gifted a tier one sub to Parallel Universe. Oh my god, SLC just had a hundred subs. Fuck me. Can't believe it's sort of been 50 minutes. Yeah, 50 minutes already. It's going. Time goes. Thank you so much. Everyone say thank you to SLC and Arian. The hundred people. How many people are watching this shit? I don't know. I can't even see that. I don't have that number anywhere. I don't have that number anywhere. Oh well. Foxy Sucks is with a hundred street leaves. This is a great background um, to be definitely working and not cutting out. Shiny paper to decorate a scrapbook. Hang on, let me just see what Rebecca's currently doing. What are you currently doing? Making a tiny drink. Making a tiny drink. Okay, cool. <laughs> Red Rail! Oh no, I read that one. Is that I read that one? I think I did. They're saying it's a weird train I'm driving. I think I read that one. I'm sorry if I've missed some things in that it went to shit for a bit. It's back now. Seems to be working. <laughs> Hi everyone. Everyone on the bus behind us having a great time. No one's looking at me. <laughs> My eyes that scary. Maybe. Um, okay. Uh, oh, 617 on YouTube, 475 on Twitch. A thousand people watching me drive like this. My bus attire, I've got to be careful. Got to be careful. Try driving without your glasses. No. Because those four people on my bus will die. That's, uh, yeah. Are you or Rebecca going to play the new Princess Peach game? I'm pretty fucking sure Rebecca's not. Rebecca does not care for Nintendo platformers. I might. I might play it. I always want to worry about games like that. They're going to be like baby's first Nintendo game. And I don't have fun. Unless I'm being challenged because I'm broken inside. Uh, Gandalf Cheese with 100 trillion says, Happy birthday, stage safe. Mr. Oh, Rebecca's walked out of the room. That's how much Rebecca disliked that idea. <laughs> Mr. Random96 uh, has resubscribed and says, Bus, 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 bus! Did the webcam just get blurry when someone said drive without glasses? Yeah, it's got a lot of focus on. So you can't. It will go weird. Sometimes. <sighs> four rounds before we switch this go backwards. Actually, it should only be three, but you know. Uh, Bell School! 345 has resubscribed. J! No, TJHD has resubscribed. Happy birthday! I've been watching since the Spore Bully broadcast. Three completes! era nearly 12 years ago. Lilith, are you trying to eat popcorn? Wait, what? Since when I've had popcorn? That's new. Um, what the fuck was I reading? What the fuck was I reading? Oh yeah, uh, glad to stick around for all the amazing glasses, especially this game kiss! <laughs> Timberlake, like, how many totally for you to do a Thelma and Louise? What, drive off a cliff? If you see a cliff, I'll do it for free. Um, Jack Green Alive, Rufy Mirror is meant to keep an eye on the rally passengers, so it feels very realistic. I said Mr. Ram96 has resubscribed. Well, they have. And now I've said that. Abby's Mooks with 22 Lees. I've got to go and drive uh, to head. What? I've got to go and drive now to head and dog sit. Why are you. What's a head? Is that to a creature? To head to, drive to dog sitting. It says head and dog sit. Yeah. Oh, okay. I think that's what that was. Head out, probably. Head out and dog sit to love greyhounds. We'll check back in the street. Just trying to work it out. I wondered if there was like a new kind of animal called a head. Just a floating dog head. That was Rebecca. It wasn't. <laughs> uh, dog one eight one eight. Hey, Dan, I've been watching your content for like ten years. It never fails to make me laugh hysterically whenever I watch. Happy birthday! You're very welcome. I'm so excited for everybody to watch the next video. I really hope um, people enjoy it because you'll get you get to meet Apples, who is my new favorite person in the whole wide world. Apples is everything to me. You thought Jeff the Shark was a good character. You wait till you meet Apples. <sighs> Mixy Council! My fun doctors. Turns out that I did the right thing by asking for a sanity check on my antidepressants. Because I'm back to 50 milligrams certainly until off because it was clearly holding me stable. I had to do that as well. But I'm on 100 milligrams because they're like... You fucking insane. I'm like, I know. Oh, no. 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 Uh, <laughs> when's the next video out? 9 o'clock. Today, it's the live stream highlights from House Flipper 2. And then 9 o'clock tomorrow. 
uh, will be... Sorry, I sounded like what's-his-face from people just do nothing when I said tomorrow. Um, that'll be the video with apples. And the, yeah, it's a horse. It's a casino. It's a great game. Um, <laughs> Ozlorian has subscribed and resubscribed, which is insane. And that boy Ian has resubscribed. 58 months. Oh, I'm sitting back in my chair. Uh, wait, hang on. I'm going to turn the camera down a bit. Uh, uh, look at my lovely shirt, you fucks. Shut up. Damn it! <laughs> and it fix the camera. Wait, I'll go all the way back here. <laughs> hey, everyone. Oh, fine. Uh, I need to switch fingers because that finger started to go numb. Because I've just been holding down a button for the entire time. Oh, boy. What game has a horse named Apples that goes to a casino? Says Pumper Kane. Why is your chair sound like a catapult? Because I can just go back and I'm like, boom, and I'm gone. It's uh, <laughs> a good time. Uh, Gone Day says I started HRT this morning. I'm nervous, but excited. Hey, cheers. Fizzy drink. Mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> that is actually sat in a trippy shape. Yeah, at the end of this stream, I'll go this great stunt. I'm just going to cap on myself through the fucking screen. <laughs> oh, dear. Rufus the Hairy Cat Wrangler says, The way you're talking, it sounds like you blanked the horrors of your VR desert bus adventure from your mind. So to recap, John made Clank go out and buy a ukulele, Matt complained about everything, and four hours in, you lost the plot and crashed the bus, and then spent four, four hours being thrown back to the start. I remember some of that. I remember Matt throwing his, uh, his Vive controller. Um... <laughs> across the across the way that was good he just, he just throws it his hand just goes Poof. it's a good time it's a good time I get run zoned out on the bus let's wake him up <laughs> Serling gave me massive pains and told him something I says yeah it's Baker well fuck stop taking it I have uh, not had those things it seems to be alright those Vive controls are tougher than they look. Yeah, pretty sure. Uh, is it the realtor game that's game I played? Oh, well, Kieran, uh, Kieran Tyndall, I have stopped watching uh, Let's Game It Out because I uh, I was going, well, I can't play that because Let's Game It Out has done it and I've seen all their jokes, so I've had to stop watching them so I can do old shitty simulators and stuff like that again. <laughs> so they may have covered the game that I'm talking about, but they, uh, I have to stop watching that. Because it's good, and I'm like, nah, just, I'll just copy all that stuff. Um, just in my own fucking head. Just in my own fucking head. I missed the eight uh, hours of normal jockeys. I missed the eight hours of normal jockeys. We should do eight hours of normal jockeys! I'll start. Uh, Margaret Thatcher, no more people who are definitely in hell. Chat, it's up to you. I bet reading Twitch chat. It's time from Texas. Wrong! I'm here! I'm both! I'm reading both! Those who don't know to play no more jockeys. Tough. Oh, Okay. State agent simulator? Maybe. Eyebrows, I'm doing eyebrows things. <laughs> JK Rowling, no more people who are going to be in hell. JK Rowling is in hell because JK Rowling has to talk to people like Glitter and Putin, apparently. Um, anyway. <laughs> Time from Texas says, Shabby, yeah, called out! Bus driver eyes. We see everything. It's kind of weird because I am because my Twitch is over there. I didn't realize that I was spent most of this just looking away. Although actually, because of the angle of where you see a bus thing from, it does kind of look like you're looking from an angle. It's okay, well, it still works. It works enough. Have you played? What are your thoughts on Disco Elysium? Says HKYO9. Well, so me and Disco Elysium have a complicated relationship because I think it's an incredibly good game that I don't like. It's not, it's not my, it's wordy, but not my kind of wordy. 
You know, I like I like a game that is um What's the best way to put it? Um not as verbose. I don't need everything described in ridiculous fucking detail. My brain just goes, oh, oh god, I'm bored. And so I just for me to some people like that, I mean like Rebecca likes that, don't you? Best game. Best game. Rebecca likes all that kind of wordy shit, but for me I'm just like, eh. I don't need that. I'm more than happy for just things to explode. Hey, we've hit the first hour! One hour in! Dude, I'm not gonna have a voice by the end of this. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I like Pensive Man at the front there. Um, yes. Yeah, he says, yeah, literally as I was doing that. Fantastic web implementation. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, why is your book taking so long? Says Honest Tortilla. Ah, uh, although, sorry, you say, ah, that's why your book is taking so long, potentially. I mean, it's dumb, so. Um, you're more pornography than an erotic novel. Yeah, get in, get the job done, fuck off. You know, that's the... <laughs> that is the, yeah. Sounds like I've got a flat tire. <laughs> I should probably stop swerving as much. Um... But yeah, it's all just like, you go in, you like pick something up, and I want the game to go, it's a bandana, there's a bit of blood on it. And what it does is it goes, there's a bandana here, it reminds me of the following 73 events in my life, and then describes them in fucking four hours, and I'm like, ah, stop. Just do the thing. Anyway. Uh, oh, did I read that one? Yes, I read that one. Uh, JJB20 has subscribed, as has Taylor Hawthorne has resubscribed. Oh, yes. Um, it's so iconic that the game about ruination by special interest is in itself ruined by special interest. It's all part of the art. How old is Dan now, then? Uh, it's mid... early 30s? <laughs> mid early 30s. Mid early 30s is fine. Um... And I'm a nid. If you had a child, what would you name them? Well, considering I've had a vasectomy, I'd name them some sort of scientific miracle. Uh, <laughs> statistically unlikely. That's why I would name them. Ugh. Um. <laughs> oh yeah. So. That's what I would, uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you could name them Jesus. It would, it would be an immaculate conception, which would just be a fucking awkward one. I don't know, why name something you're just going to throw into a bin? Like, there's no, <laughs> I don't name a shit, do I? Anyway, um, <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> Policy on Twitch says, statistically unlucky Hardcastle, no more anomalous peoples. I mean, yeah. Jan shits in bins, lol. Jan shits in bins? Dan shit. I don't speak English very much when I stream. I should try to learn to enunciate and pronunciate my words correctly. Mm hmm. Yes. Ow. Um, XP Cookie says, I just reminded myself. People that said that Rebecca's woo was the loudest they've ever been clearly hasn't watched the Left for Dead video with John. Did you get the dumb? It's one of my favourite moments of you ever. You're so obsessed with that fucking little gnome. I love the gnome. <laughs> Why is that okay, John? It says, I'd love to see you play Helldivers 2. Don't know if you already have or not. It's been a while. Um, so, uh, Rebecca and I tried to play it a few times. Uh, and it's basically impossible for us to get into. We just couldn't get it to work. And I was like, eh, I can wait for this. I can wait for this. This is fine. I don't need to do that. Um, anyway. Is there a doll behind Dan? Maybe. I can't see what's going on behind me. Should we look what's behind me? Yeah. <laughs> There's something in front of me. I have a question. How many Sonic the Hedgehog figures do I have within uh, reaching range? So just on my desk, not even on my shelves that are above me. 
Sonic the Hedgehog action figures. <laughs> oh dear. Hey, Sophie the Bookworm! Rebecca has two volumes, barely audible and hearing loss. Uh, 12, mid-30s, nice. Uh, 14, 10, 412, all of them manufactured ever. Well, okay. To put it into more context... To put it into more, excuse me. To put it into more context... I have uh, a dedicated shelf for Sonic the Hedgehog action figures with, like, plastic display stands that they all go on. Um, the ones that are on my desk are basically, there's a few little ones and then, like, new purchases. So... Daniel is neglecting to mention the other bit of desk in the corner of the room is another Sonic display. Well, that's not really a display right now, but that's where I keep, like, my bigger figures and stuff, so I'm not counting those. You're not counting those. What about the ones in the bedroom? They're for special purposes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, Luddy Hammerstrom Fuck me that's a cool name Hammerstrom Holy shit it's been so many years We've listened to the originals when it came out Playing Overgrowth Hello there What's the biggest Sonic you have Of actual just regular Sonic It's probably just a normal Just a cuddly toy that I've had That cuddly toy That's a video of me as like an actual little kid That's the uh, Yeah it's probably the biggest Sonic I have. Oh fuck, steady. Steady. Alright, let's count them. Tails in uh, from Sonic Prime. Driving, driving, driving. Super Sonic! Classic. That wasn't one, that's fine. <laughs> Knuckles from Sonic Prime. Sonic from Sonic Prime. Oh, Christ. Oh, they're all falling over now. Ugh. Amy! Or Rusty Rose, as she's known, from Sonic Prime. Nephilophilophilophilophilies from, I think, Sonic 06, apparently, but I just thought that figure was cool. Uh, and then. This fucking weird little metal, metal steampunk Sonic, which is apparently from Sonic Prime, but I've not seen him in the show yet, but that's fucking badass. And that's all the ones that I... Actually, no, I've got uh, four more there, but they're further back. I've got some of the little ones of, like, Metalix and Mighty and Ray, because Mighty and Ray are my boys. So, four more after that as well. There's not a lot, you see? That's, oh, wait, no, and also this new one. <laughs> it's got a new little running Sonic. Yeah... What about the one that's downstairs that you haven't opened yet? Well, I haven't opened that yet, so it's not here. It's not within arm's range. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just didn't have a Shadow the Hedgehog, alright? I don't get a Shadow the Hedgehog! <laughs> First I've heard of Sonic Prime, I'm a fake fan. Well, okay, so Sonic Prime is a new animated um, TV show on a streaming surface. Streaming service. Would you like to guess which streaming service? Only the most intelligent people are going to get this. What streaming service is Sonic Prime on? Sonic Prime. What streaming service is Sonic Prime on? Three guesses. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying random shit. <laughs> yeah, no, it's on Netflix. It's on Netflix. Uh, Sonic Prime is on <laughs> Netflix. Why? Why is that a thing? Why that way around? I've only watched the first episode, and then I went out and bought all the figures because I'm having a really shit week. Um, and um, uh, I just, I genuinely, it's very good. That first episode is like legitimately good. And I was like, oh, that's actually real. There's lots of funny ideas, and yeah, I'm like, oh, I'm fucking into it. I'm into it. I'll have me some Sonic. Actually, yeah, no, it's legitimately on. Wait, it's literally, yeah, it, it literally is on Netflix. Is Sonic Prime also made up of blended squirrels? No, hedgehogs. Uh, you blend up all hedgehogs and you get Sonic Prime. That's the... Um, I will say, I thought it would be really funny if I... I was going to do a bit during this where I slagged off Logan Paul and then I got out, like, my drink was going to be Prime. <laughs> I was going to have a big swing of Prime. But, um... I, I, it's really expensive. <laughs> I didn't want to. <laughs> So 
So, yeah. Jeremy Sonic Utopia! Apparently the credit stack work was SEGA! The reason Frontier's mechanic was even somewhat okay. I do remember Sonic Utopia. I thought it was very good. I enjoyed Sonic Utopia. Don't go get a cup of tea. Do not crash. Okay, Karen Tindall. Um, Sonic X made me furry adjacent, I'm not gonna lie. Just say furry. I can shoo shoo shoo. You don't need to. Yeah. What's my prediction of you getting three in the last week uh, because of the fence? Correct. I've got two new ones. Only the little runny Sonic and um, uh, Shadow that I got downstairs. I was actually looking because there's another little robot Sonic. I was looking for that one for the Prime set, but I couldn't find it. So, Also, in the small range, I am desperate to get fucking Charmy B. I've been looking for fucking ever to get a little Charmy B, and I just cannot find it apart from fucking Evo. It's like 30 quid for like a six pound figure, which I'm not going to fucking spend. So, yeah. Your chin looks really good. Thanks, Stefan. I put a lot of work into it. It's very fat now. A little bit like Bam Majera, if you only see my chin. I have Bam Majera's chin. Uh, that's it. Um. <laughs> you sing out says Sonic's mum from Sonic Underground may be a lesbian. <laughs> oh dear. Uh, <laughs> I, I can see it. I can see it. Yeah. That's, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh dear. Good bit's not good bit. I can't grow a bit for my fucking life. This is the last time. Ugh, look at that. It's got gaps in it. Looks more like a fungal infection on the beard. Anyway, uh, a rebellion! With a oh, 10 to at least. Can't remember if I mentioned it before, but I'm moving to Germany in less than five weeks. It's very scary, uh, but exciting knowing that I'll still be here driving the bus. It's comforting. Oh, you'll still be here driving the bus. That's me, yeah. Thank you for being. Uh, part of my life for nearly 12 years. 19, nearly 20. Uh, I forgot to highlight. Uh, highlighting my chat isn't cheering. Uh, also, I know one word in German. House of Garbenheft. The worst word. Is Sonic BBC iPlayer on Amazon Prime? Uh, no, that's on HBO Max. And there's a lot of furry dick in it. It's great. I love it. It's really good. Down I put 3D print your arm. Oh, the collector in me. i got to get the real one. i got to get the real one. Dan, you talked about Project 06 before. Oh, the polishing of the turd that is Sonic 06. <laughs> yes, German homework. Yes, that is the German one for homework. It's the only word I remember from learning German for many years. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. If Dan likes Sonic so much, does that make Dan a furry? Big reveal. Well, no, Spartan 548. I just like the little hedgehog boy who made me happy when I was a child. <laughs> no, I do. I, I um, no, I never, uh, never been a thing. I did. I, I, I worked at uh, Sega World briefly. Well, technically, my, my friend's dad owned it. Um, and I, uh, <laughs> oh shit, hang on. Twillies have read. Jack Bray live at 250 Twillies says, I love Hell Eyes too. Bet you, man, John, Rebecca, will have a great time. It's got a lot more stable with updates. Yeah, I played it like a week ago and I could not get it. To connect to games. It was great. Uh, Y99 BSB has resubscribed as as YYNNEB. Uh, Drywindell or Drywindell. Uh, it's a stand catch with two twiddlies. Got him. Thank you. Uh, a rebellion. That was a German one. Yes. Uh, ooh. And not the Apex Legend has resubscribed for seven months. Yeah. Good stuff. You mean elevator world? I mean escalator world. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I, yeah, I, I tried on the, uh, the 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 costume. I was like, um, oh. I'm thinking like ten to twelve, maybe. And I tried on the actual like Sonic mascot costume, and I will never be a furry because of that moment. Because there is nothing warmer in the goddamn world than those things, and I don't like being warm. I, maybe, yeah, maybe the furry thing doesn't appeal to me because of my ADHD really likes me to uh, not wear as any clothes. <laughs> Light shirt, shorts, we're done. I don't need anything else, you know. Damn, remember the flesh colour feet for that one Sonic Games character creator? I remember not even notice it. You could be a furry with that fursuit, but that's like being a Catholic when I go to church, is it? It's, no, it's not really fun. You miss, I feel like you're missing the main point of it all. Oh, no, no, no. 
<laughs> anyway, um, what else are we? What was I run away? Oh, Arahanko! Oh shit! What is this? That stream isn't one I'm going to sleep for work. I have to wonder how close I am to a year now with this reset. Seventy-eight months. Oh my god! It's the first time it's happened. It's a year. Arahanko has subscribed for an entire year. Oh my goodness. Also, Dan, you're almost done. Wait, second longest paid sub here by only a month. That's not a year. Certainly nine months isn't a year. <laughs> uh, Luna J! Ooh, that's the eye. It was those eyes. Luna J! Uh, said, I'm finally reading uh, Russell T. Davis's The Writer's Tale. Oh my god, it's inspired me to start script writing. It's not putting you off, it's fucking horrifying. It's like, ah. Uh, a lot. Um, can I just get the half suit just ahead and pause? It's the head I, I couldn't. It was, <laughs> it was like just too much. Uh, Dr. Irvington says, Happy birthday! What's your favorite Sonic game? Ooh, definitely. Uh, Mania. Yeah, Mania. Sonic Mania, yeah, I think it's the best one. It's the good shit. Um, no head then. So. So just furry hands. I don't like gloves or things such as my hands though. I'm a bit weird about that. Rebecca, am I weird about that? He's weird about everything. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm weird about everything. There we go. Weird about fucking anything. <laughs> what about a tail? I don't like. I don't want it in my bum. And if it's just a belt, I don't wear belts. So like, it's just not. <laughs> None of it's really for me, I just feel like, you know. <laughs> just face paint. Oh, I don't like face paint. Oh, no, 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 no. Something tells me Dan's ADHD might be based in Tism, says Delta Firex. Oh, fuck. Everyone's saying that to me recently. You, my therapist, the person who's diagnosing me with autism. Oh. You're wrong. <laughs> um, just a feet part then. I never wear shoes. I'm the sort of person who goes out in bare feet all the fucking time. He's like, who gives a shit? No <laughs> <sighs> oh, fuck. Dan is a nudist is what we learned. The book tour was wild. It was, wasn't it? That trick where I was signing without using my hands? Yeah. What's the egg version for autism? It's several very neat eggs in a row that have been color coordinated and measured with calipers and then written down. <laughs> How many public duty charges do you have? None, I'm very slinky. I can slink into the night and then go downstairs, but then I have to stop. <laughs> um. That's why I'm so hairy. I'm just naturally a furry. Look at that. Ugh. Oh, like licking a carpet. Um. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. How's YouTube do? YouTube's just channeling one of us, which I think is a bit. Okay. Oh god, don't test the buzz again. I know, I know, I know, I know. What is this game? Says Mr. Meme Cat. Oh my god, this is Desert Bus. Some people don't know what Desert Bus is. So this is a, a, a technically a sequel to the original Desert Bus. Because Desert Bus is, um, it was a game in a collection of like silly joke games made for the Sega CD that never came out. And it was sort of designed by Penn and Teller, the magicians. And one of those was Desert Bus, uh, where your job was to drive down a, a, a straight road from Tucson to Las Vegas, which is 360 miles and it takes eight real hours. And that was, that kind of got the attention of streamers when that became a thing. Uh, Desert Bus for Hope, which is there on the uh, on the old windscreen, uh, is a big charity that does lots and lots and lots of Desert Bus uh, for charity and it's fucking mind numbing. Uh, so that's always a, uh, a delightful thing to do. But it kind of it got to be such a big thing that Penn & Teller made this Desert Bus VR, which is the sequel to it. 
uh, which is exactly the same thing. Also, you don't need to fight in VR. I'm playing on a controller. Um, but it is, it's the sequel, but it's it doesn't have any of the extra little bits and pieces that were in Smoke and Mirrors, because that was the original name of the game, was Smoke and Mirrors. Um, so yeah, we drive, straight line. Unfortunately, the bus slowly veers to the right, as you can see. That's not me doing that. That's all right, knows. Um, that's just the game. So you can't just push the button and go. You have to play all eight hours. You can't even move the analog stick slightly to the left because it will veer you off. So there is absolutely, yeah, none of that. Pen and Teller, since when were they into video games? Since the 2000, wait, 1985 was Smoke and Mirrors? Someone's gonna have to look that up for me. Was 1985 when it was the prototype that was found? Because there was a prototype found and that's what everybody played. I was trying to get that working, the original, but oh well. Um, Ali Jim says, Dan, can you do a shout out to my brother Josh for taking fuck your book to get signed by you while I've stuck at work? I can! Josh! Sorry I saw that message somewhere else. Well, I was going to talk about it, but it was another thing. Yeah. Josh, you wonderful person. Uh, yeah. How wide is the map? Uh, if you go slightly off the road, you crash and lose. And if you lose, like if you crash, uh, you'll be towed back in real time. So if you crash four hours in, you get towed back for four hours. Ah, it's a delight. It's a delight. Um. Anyway, anyway, anyway. This is better than the original slightly. I mean, yeah, you can look around a little bit. 995, oh, I was right, sweet. Uh, Harry is a new member over on the YouTubes. We have memberships on the YouTube, is that a thing? I don't know what that is. Is that like being subscribed on Twitch? Thank you, Harry. <laughs> You should crash at the 7 hour 59 minute mark. Uh, no, because then I'll be playing this shit my birthday without actually playing it. My hands started to wake already and I'm only an hour in. I keep having to swap fingers. It's good, it's good, it's good. Everything's good, everything's fine. Let's stay using my thumb for a bit. Relax the hand. Relax the hand. I'm just pushing against the table. How are the passengers doing? I think they've all gone. <laughs> and there's a lucky duck. Some lucky duck table. The luck. Spoilers for Bob's Burgers. Um, can you pause it? No. And if you stop the bus, it breaks down. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> um, 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 um. So. Dan, is it your birthday or the channel's birthday? Alex Yates, it's neither. <laughs> But it's between both. So, yes, no, two days ago on the 20th was the channel's birthday. The channel turned 13 years old. We've entered the 14th year of the channel. Um, and my birthday is tomorrow. So, and this is why I normally do uh, live streams. So I figured, why the fuck not? Let's do a double bill birthday bonanza. And I'm going to spend all of the money people give me on, um, you know, I really want to get, right? I've, I saw this yesterday and I'm desperate to get one. Have you seen a tread wall? <laughs> Have you, has anybody here know what a tread wall is? The stream says birthday accessories. I don't know, it is a thing. Have you, has anybody seen a tread wall? Because I legitimately want a tread wall. But they are like really fucking expensive. <laughs> What all percentage of my life I've watched you slightly veer right on a bus. Um, what's a tread wall? Okay, so, you know a treadmill where you run and it goes on forever? Well, a tread wall is the climbing wall equivalent. So as you climb, it starts to go down, and so you have to climb to keep up with the wall. So it's like a speed climbing. I'm assuming you can set, like, how slow it, you know, does its stuff. But it's basically a, uh, as an exercise machine, speed wall climbing. I desperately want to do that. <laughs> that sounds so much fun. The top Bruce says, I have Googled Treadwall. Now I also want a Treadwall. Are you fit enough to use that? Hell yeah, look at my muscles. Oh, they went on screen. Oh. Could you do a subathon to fund that? Yes! Okay, subathon starts now. Way! I don't know how it works. 
like you see on Gladiator's lot. Yeah, but instead of it just being like a big wall, it's a small one, so you can just actually fit it in your house. But because it goes round, you can climb up it forever. So, I just love the idea of just being able to climb instead of because I, I like to do the old stairmaster when I do uh, too big to be captured on screen. It was the whole screen. Yeah, I like the old the old big stairmastery good time boy time. Ugh, fuck. Was is when I'm at the gym. That's my boy, Rebecca. I go to the gym, right? He goes to the gym. I go to the fucking gym, bitches. Uh, I, I skip arm day. I don't give a fuck about that shit. But leg day, I'm all about leg day. So I just climb stairs because it's like the best, fittest thing you can do. So I like to, uh, yeah, just climb up massive amounts of flights of stairs. And I figured if I could then use my arms in that as well as my legs, I don't need to exercise in any other way. It's super fit and healthy. So yes, I'm saving up for a tread wall. Uh, you, I believe you can also move the handles around too to make it however you want. You literally can. Yeah, you can design your... Oh. It looks so good. You gym, really. Rebecca, they're the questioning my gymnast. He just got the gym. Legitimately. I have a gym membership. Confirm it. He has a gym membership. I mean, so do you. Yeah, me too. Yeah, we go together. Rebecca's like fucking insane at the gym. <laughs> Every time we go to the gym, Daniel looks like he is going to die. <laughs> Every time. All right. All Every right. Every single time. All right. Fuck me. Doesn't matter how many times we go consistently. It doesn't matter how long it is for. Every single time, he looks like he's dying on the first machine he gets up. I'm gonna get on one machine. I love it. <laughs> no, you talk to people. Not me. Yeah. What are you eating? Me. Oh, they're good. Yeah. With the new ones, aren't they? No. Oh. <laughs> oh well. Look how muscly I am. <laughs> oh, fuck. Can the toys channel become a workout channel? Yes, for just the low, low cost of buying a tread. What's it called? Treadwall. Treadwall! <sighs> Hello, everybody. <laughs> That's what we get for self improvement, Dan. Pretty cool. The moral here is clear: never try. No, I got, I got like my arm. I don't shit with my arms. My legs look like fucking. Oh, how muscly are my legs right now? Solid muscle. Solid muscle. Fourteenth anniversary idea: eight-hour treadwall marathon. Okay. <laughs> Jack says Dan's face at the gym with that, that. uh Binding of Isaac, crying face. Or is it just an emoji now? I can never tell. I'm too old for this shit. <laughs> too old for this shit. How long have we been going? It says on the screen, one hour, 27 minutes. Uh, <laughs> you can kick a hole through a small child. I can, and then I can fill it with lies. Dan, you should go to a climbing gym. It's like cheating, cheating exercise. There's none around me. Absolutely none anywhere around me. Or otherwise I'd be at them. I'd love to do that. Absolutely love to do that because that's just that just sounds fun. But yeah, get a treadmill. Oh, it'll be fun. Um, well, Mr. Ms. Awesome, Mr. Awesome. It's my birthday today. Happy birthday! So happy to catch you play. Be watching you since first episode of Overgrowth 12 years ago. Such a long time, and I still love your content. Thank you very much. Gym vlog went. I ah, see what I like to do um, is I don't like to film myself at the gym uh, because I'm not a twat. <laughs> uh, treadmill, or treadmill, the same room. Yeah, you got to run and then jump onto the thing. Um, what else we got? Hi, Smashing Five One Three. I've listened to you for years. Your voice was like a lighthouse during some rough seas in my life. I like to guide you home. And I like to blind you every now and then as well. That's the two things. That's the two speeds. Excuse me, I'm fine. Attach you to a generator. Free electricity. That's genius. We should do this. Everyone should have one in their wall. Um. <laughs> oh, dear. Yep, 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 yep. What else? 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 Chewy has resubscribed. As is Veggie Snake. Solid muscle. No skin, no bone, just smooth red muscle. I mean, essentially. I mean, essentially, it's just solid right there. 
Smashing513 has subscribed. Uh, I think I've caught up with all of the twiddly bits. Uh, I need to sit back because my back is already starting to go. I'm an old man. Can't really move in them. Just gonna change the lights a bit. What am I looking at? That's my. <laughs> it's fine. Everything's fine. What am I sitting here like this? I fucked it. 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 Rebecca. Yeah. Could you move the webcam for me? Because <laughs> I keep trying to just push it back a bit. Beep me. Just, just so you can get my eyes in it. Because I can't do both. Thank you. Well, it just goes back. We played that. I'm trying. We played that. What's oh this? Oh God! It just, just doesn't bend. It doesn't bend. <laughs> it doesn't bend. It doesn't bend at all. Wait, how do you tip? How do you tip it? It don't. I've been pushing it back and forwards. <laughs> oh, yay! Thank you. Aaron does stuff with fifty knock. Dan, here's a slightly random question. What's your preferred version of Milky Solid Two? Uh, I'm currently playing the version on my Steam Deck, and that's a fucking good time. That's a good fucking time. Uh, yeah, HD one with the the all the missions, all the VR missions. That's the good stuff. That's the good stuff. Metal Gear. Everyone's like talking about Peaks of Yore. I've never even heard of it. Hairline cam. Hairline cam. Oh god, I've suddenly got a hairline. I'm getting old. <sighs> It's just like frustrating this bus only does 45 kilometers an hour. Isn't it just the best? Isn't it just the great? Dan, are you drunk? You're all over the road. Um, yep, and both of those things, yep. <laughs> I have the original of subsistence version on my PS2. Me too! And I have subsistence, because I'm cool. Uh, Axiomonk has subscribed! <laughs> oh, fuck. Do you know how to blockade runner? I have absolutely no idea how to blockade runner. Or, um, uh, Crashtastic. Another game from early on that just sort of vanished. <laughs> Axiomar says, Happy birthday, thanks for going YouTube for the past 80 years. <laughs> Is the spy on the dashboard the time so far? Yes. Uh, we started, we headed off about two, the end of two minutes. So if we keep going and we keep accelerating evenly throughout the entire thing, we should get this done. Uh... Yeah, the eight hour, two minute mark. Oh, I've just realized I can sort of lock my controller on there if I do that. <gasps> oh, that's cool! By the way, that's what it was doing to my hand. I don't know if that's... Can you see the red mark? <laughs> Ow. Yeah, if I wedge the button, it might just... Um, just tell me if I stop accelerating. <laughs> oh, good, I don't have to accelerate anymore. Oh, that's a fucking relief. Ah, uh, ouchies. Oh, that's going to make this so much easier if I don't have to accelerate. just have to move the random stick every now and then. Life is good. Um, what else are we? What else are we? How does it feel to be a million years old? It feels alright! feels alright. Sad piece is you stop accelerating. Too early! I can see it. I'm checking it. No, because I've got the Xbox controller. You can swap between, like, the, the different pressures. Uh, and I thought, well, what if I, like, hold the button down and switch between those? If I push hard enough, can I technically break my controller, but also hold the button down? Yes, I can. <laughs> How about they, Dad? You and Dad Cube to the goats of YouTube. Uh, Dad's gone. He's, he's retired. Just me now, baby. Fair, everyone's retired. It's literally just me now. <sighs> Any questions about, you know, life and... He said, but mum, it reminded me of that South Park. Uh, it's available to watch completely free in Australia and probably other countries too. I fell, I fell asleep at South Park last night. That was my fall asleep thing. Advice for dissuading a teething puppy from reading my ankles. Let them do it, Farmer Beige. Uh, it's, their, it's their pride and joy, puppies. They love chewing. One thing I will say when it comes to puppies, uh, this is the point when you want to open their mouth and put your hands in their mouth and get them used to your hands being in their mouth. Just start doing that, right? Start going hands in the mouth and the mouth and the hands in the hands and the mouth and the hands. Because then, when they're older and they've got to take pills, they'll just open their, you just, if you've kept that consistent, they'll just open their jaw. And so with like Matilda, like Matilda takes a pill every day and so does Lilith, I just open their jaws, throw the pill in, close their jaws, they swallow it, life's good. 
with Reagan, I was afraid of losing limbs. Because we, <laughs> that was not trained to Reagan, was it, Miss Red? No, I didn't. Oh, I just didn't know. Didn't know. Didn't think about it. But yeah. Um, yeah. That's my little secret thing. Uh, the definition of sarcasm! What you for years when they realized uh, we shared a birthday? Happy, uh, cheers, mate! Happy birthday! And to you, the definition of sarcasm. What a great post! <laughs> See, it's sarcastic. I was doing an impression. Dad, you're driving on the wrong side of the road. This is set in the US. I'm very aware I'm driving on the wrong side of the road. But the reason I'm doing it is because I then go all the way over here, and then all the way over here, and then all the way over here. So I don't have to just do fucking this right now. Um. Anyway, uh, what else are we? What else are we? Who? Who else? What's th what's going on? How are we all? Where's, where's there's a video of Matilda as a puppy from ages ago on the channel. That is. Uh, <laughs> I don't give. If forty two is the answer to life, then what is the question? And why is it uh, six multiplied by nine? No, forty two. The uh, the question is, how many roads must a man walk down? He's exercising his freedom. It's true. I'm also doing that. This is America, goddammit. This is America, goddammit. Uh, Dan, will you watch the Australian Grand Prix and the V8 supercars? I'm going to tell you this now, Mr. Diamond365. I have absolutely no interest in cars. I really don't give a fuck. Uh, <laughs> I don't like watching them. I like watching them, like, crashing and shit in films. But, like, just going around in a loop. Blech. Blech. Oh, okay. I'd like to do it though. How long has it been since you showed off Lilith as a puppy on stream? About three years. When she was little. About three years ago. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, how are the chickens and the hamsters? Ah, uh, all the hamsters are gone. Because we never had any. Uh, chickens are doing okay. There's three of them left now. Lost one a few weeks ago. Which is. Uh, poo. But. You know, we gave her a good retirement, and it's better than just having your fucking face ripped off for uh, 18 months. I'm gonna have a thingy. Um, um, it's been three years. I mean, yeah. He's just passing the visible car in front of him, which is allowed to to those lane markings. That's what I'm doing. Look, there's another one. <laughs> Ooh. Oh fuck. How the guinea pigs doing? They're doing well. Robert is now a nice weight. He's settled in properly. It's all good. Um Any tips for an aspiring content creator? None whatsoever. I I thirteen years ago I was creating this is when I started creating shit. Totally different environment. This is such a totally different fucking environment that I literally cannot go Oh here's some advice. Because it's absolutely worthless advice. It's just that this has changed so fucking... I mean, you know... Like I was saying, I started before Skyrim was a thing. I think before Arkham... The Batman Arkham games were a thing. Like, I, I cannot go... Hey, I did these things. Because YouTube is such a wildly different fucking beast. Like, there's no... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'd love to. I think getting any advice from getting advice from people who have recently come up—that's what you want to get. Someone like me who came up when basically all I had to do was link to a mystery video at the end of every video, and then I'd be on the front page. The front page doesn't even exist anymore. Like, you know. So I, I, I think giving you advice would be bad. That would be by uh, a bad thing. But people make you know people come out of the, the, the sort of blue all the time. So yeah. Sort of see how those people did it. Just ignore me. <laughs> Any tips for the spine content creator with the time machine? Yeah, kill Hitler. He was an absolute cock end. Um, will you be getting more chickens? Yes, here, Azulu. We are. Uh, we're down to get a few more chickies at some point. Um, is it getting shot by an algorithm? I used to control the algorithm. I used to. I worked it out and I milked that fucking thing. It was delightful. It's truly really great. Ah. Dan, did you ever uh, move somewhere cold and liberal, or was that a lie? That was true. Cheer is on Steam now. No, it's not. I literally checked it like a few days ago. 
Only fear that if Hitler dies and the war never started, that you may have never started your YouTube channel. I swapped my YouTube channel for the lives of all the people lost during World War II. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I like it, but I don't like it that much. It released today? Ah, oh, fucking sweet! Wait, is it Steam Deck compatible? Because if Steam Deck compatible, I'm fucking replaying Chia. I'm going to celebrate by buying Chia tonight. I'm going to play Chia all day tomorrow. How much is it? Is it is it good? Is it Steam Decky? Um, Dan is like the map path gaming videos at this point. I don't know. <laughs> Playable, it says. Fucking brilliant. That'll do me. Uh, you never moved to Finland, right? I lived in Finland for two years. <laughs> 23 pounds! Oh, that's actually a fucking great place. I mean, that was my game of the year last year. He's the guy who gave the Pope Undertale. Yeah, but he stole that joke from me. He did. He did. I gave the Pope Shadow Colossus. It's in this book. <laughs> it's true. It's a legitimate bit of that book. Uh, uh, uh. Why would I need another game when Balatro exists? I'm nearly done with Balatro. I'm nearly done. I've got uh, a few, a little handful of challenges left, and then I'm considering myself done. Why do I keep entering the stream to the weirdest points? Because I'm always fucking weird. <laughs> Oh dear. Um, yeah. Now, why you do this? It's 1 a.m. Not for me! It is currently. What time is it? 3 p.m. Hang on, we'll be done with Balatro. I just feel like I've seen it all now. Like, you know, slopped it all up like I finished with Binding of Isaac. I'll go back at some point, but you know. Yeah. Um, oh, fuck, Frank Shear is also coming to Switch. Ooh, fun. Fun, 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 fun. You got me into Baltra. I've not won a single game in weeks. Oh my goodness, how? Baltra releasing iPhones. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> that is 2 p.m. No, I am. Um, the. There's not two chairs today. I know, Transcalabri. I'm so excited. Uh, I'm so excited. Oh my god. Um. Might finally be able to play Cheer now, says Tim Tab. I mean, I'm legitimately going to pick this up. I'll tell you what also, what also came out, and I haven't actually managed to buy it yet, because I forgot about it and I was going to buy it last night, but I did something really fucking stupid. Um, the <laughs> uh, Lucas Pope's next game is out. The person who made uh, Papers, Please and Return of the Obra Dinn. Two of the best games of all time. So, the next game is out. And I went to play it on the console it's exclusive to. And I hit a small problem. Tiny problem. Tiny, teeny, tiny problem. Because the game is called Mars After Midnight. Uh, and it is exclusive to the Playdate console. Which I have. And so last night when Rebecca went to bed, I was like, I'm going to do some Playdate. It has no backlight. I always forget that. It's got no... It's got a backlight. <laughs> so I sit there and went, ah, fuck. <laughs> so yeah. Um, yeah. You talk about the Playdate game they're making. Yes. The fuck is a Playdate console? What's a Playdate? Rebecca? Yeah. Could you get my Playdate? Yeah. <laughs> so Playdate is a console that came out last year, maybe the year before. The fuck is a Playdate? I'll show you. It's one of my favouritest games consoles. I absolutely love this little fucking thing. Actually, I hadn't played it for a while. I'm glad to be getting sort of back into it. Um, but yeah. Was that guy who made Gunpoint? No, that's Tom Francis, who then made Heat Signature and is making uh, a wizard, Game of Wizards in the title. That's quite a fun title. The turn-based wizards kicking people through Windows game. Tactical Breach Wizards. That's what he's making next. It's a backlight. Oh, Jesus Christ. Yay! So, this is a play date. I'm holding it by my head. This is the whole console. <laughs> Can you see this? This is the whole thing. It's currently in a little purple case. It's that yellow thing now, so I'm going to take it out of its case with one hand because I'm still trying to drive. Yep. yep. Oh, fuck. Oh, there it is. Steady on, steady on. Console off. 
Ta -da! This is the play date. Wow, it has a couple of little buttons. And the best thing, hang on, I'm going to take my hand off the steering wheel for a second. It's got a little crank! And the games use that crank and a couple of little buttons. Uh, and they're like, as you can see from that, the little low thing games. But it's a little black and white, low poly. Uh, just, it's, it's a fun little console. And the games can only be black and white, and they can only be on a small screen. Not got a huge amount of power, so there's a good amount of uh, uh, investment, uh, like, um, people making stuff for it. Also, the tools you need to make stuff for it are incredibly fucking uh, easy to access. Yeah. So, um, it's got official emulator. Oh, I didn't know that. It's also the best color. Yellow. Yes. That's the play date. It's tiny. It's absolutely fucking tiny. I got it, I got it um, at the same time that I got uh, the Steam Deck. <laughs> and they're very different consoles. I mean, this thing is nothing. But I love it. Um, so it's a place for, yeah, just kind of weird crap games. It's super indie. Like, if you're, like, really into games, I recommend it. But it is expensive as fuck, because it's a small little console. Uh, it's a, yeah, a tiny little thing. But it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, and, yeah, and it's sort of, the, the, when you buy it, you get a season of games. So you get given a game, and then after uh, a week, it, a little light flashes, and you're given another game. So when you buy it, you get your games, like, kind of spaced out. And that was season one, and I have not heard anything about season two. <laughs> and I love that approach, and I would buy every season. But now it looks like you can just buy the games by themselves, which is kind of less fun for me. You know? It's just, I want to have the, yeah. The backlight, time to buy my Game Boy Torch from the attic. I mean, yeah. But it's like, the amount of reviews that like, oh, it's as bad as a fucking Game Boy screen. It, no! It's fucking not! It's, as far as the screen with backlight goes, the best one I've ever fucking seen. I mean, you could see that on a fucking webcam. That's a gorgeous, bright screen. A Game Boy, you wouldn't be able to see shit right now. Anyway. You can really see the generational gap between Dan and everyone asking, but how do you play games on something so tiny? Rebecca? <laughs> <laughs> could you get the thing that's just there, please? How powerful is it? Not very powerful at all. That's the joy. Uh... <laughs> The little, the little, the, no, no, this, this side. People complaining I'm not playing on tiny things. There should be a little box there. No, not that box. Little box. No other box there. The little box. There should be a tiny little box. No, somebody might be holding it. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to reference. Adrian O'Brien is a new member on the YouTubes. Uh, thank you very much. Oh, I, the one that I also yeah, the one you also have. Do you use a Game Boy screen magnifier? No, I can actually see things. But yeah, so when I've got, I've got to pick up Miles Off Midnight, so I just recharge this. Let's play some fun. And I'm going to buy some other stuff that's on there, because there's some stuff on there I really fucking enjoyed. Yeah. Excuse you, Charge Ocean. It's as good. It's, as, it's better than a Game Boy screen. This one. That one, yeah. So when people are complaining that I, uh... <laughs> I don't know what yours is. It should be around there in its little box, but I guess it's not there. So this is my other games console that I like. Uh, this is... <laughs> is this... What, are we... Now is it too small for you people? Are we... Are we... Are we too small? Hang on, I'm just gonna... Do you have any battery left? Um, oh, I don't know. Oh, I don't think you do. My one's got battery left. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, sorry. Go give it a charge. I don't know what yours is. It should be a little... It's a tiny box. It's hard to find if you lose the fucking thing. And there is it. Oh, there it is! Yeah! It is in here! <laughs> I'm trying to keep the steering, but... It's in a little box. Holy shit, you can tell all that. Yep. Hang on, wait, 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 wait. Yeah. So, Rebecca got a green one, but I, of course, got the classic... Matt got us these. Uh, Aiden O'Brien! Thank you with 10 Australian dollar news. Thank you very much. Also, they're our new member. So I show off my teeny tiny little Game Boy. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, it's my run out of charge as well. Oh, no! I'm going to plug it in. <laughs> right, I'm going to try and plug this in. Because it's got like a proper... It's pro It works. It, it properly works. And you get a little... Uh, it just works with a normal... What is this? USB-C? 
No, it seems to be micro. Oh, it's plugged in. Yours is plugged in. Good, I don't have to find the cable for it then. But yeah, if you want a tiny tiny games console. It works, and it actually works, and you can play Tetris and stuff. <laughs> um, does it run Crisis? No. The USB port is bigger than the console. It's kind of bigger than the console, yeah. <laughs> um, all right. oh, is it? What's it called? I think it was like the Thumb Boy or something. I can't quite remember. Hang on. Oop, shit. No, I'm paying attention to the road. Thumby! The box. There it is. <laughs> My tiny, tiny mirror. Do you have a combined YouTube Twitch chat? I don't. I just have both. Actually, I do on the start screen, which is fucking weird. Um, I actually saw... This is true. I saw that somebody had remade Desert Bus for the play date. Uh, Loot Dude! He's been a member for one month! Oh my goodness! Oh, hang on, I'm moving my ass about a little bit. It's all gone berserk. as the guests. They're all dead. Oh, what's waving? Are you waving? Oh no. Oh no, that's something. Oh god. There's something just at the... What is that? It's moving around at the back. Someone's brought a hoover along. I'm gonna change your waving. Hello! <laughs> Uh, when are we getting a community let's play of the ship? Well, first we could do a community let's play of a bus, which is what we're doing now. Yep, 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 yep. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, Playday is apparently got a desert bus version, so someone's made, so that's fun. Uh, JJ says, I'm back from Stupid Judy. God, how long ago? Oh, it's two hours. Oh, the last hour flew by. Uh, glad to still be in the road. I'll be back playing Factorio for six hours. Ah, enjoy. Enjoy. Dan will ever do the ship at this point. I will, but I'm just going to save it for a silly thing. Dan, you can stream your play game games if you wanted to. Ah, I'm aware. I'm aware. You can mirror it to desktop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I know that shit. I will try and, like... I wanted to, like, cover some in, like, a 3 Falco game Friday sort of thing. Twitch chat plays Desert Bus. Left, 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 left. The Thumbby is made by a company called Tiny Circuits. Potato Sword Fighter 668. Oh, 666. I just wanted the word bums to be highlighted. Thank you. You're welcome. Bums. Bums to you all. Um. 27 Ricky has subscribed. Ooh, steady. That way to the watering hole. Could Twitch chat complete Desert Bus? I don't think. Well, I'll say that. I don't know. I'm going to eat some sweeties now while people chat. It's this for eight hours? Yes, that's what we're doing. This. Eight hours. <laughs> Have people seen the Beetle just Beetlejuice 2 trailer? There's a Beetlejuice 2 trailer? There's a Beetlejuice 2? Is it called Beetlejuice Beetlejuice? Because if it's not, it should be. Can't wait for the strip, <laughs> ship stream. Says Jack1098. Wonder I'm just going to do it. <laughs> yeah, he's actually called Beetlejuice Beetlejuice. Alright. Yeah, that's the best side. That's the best side that somebody actually gives a shit. <laughs> If it wasn't called that, I would, I would, I'd be like, nah, I'm not gonna bother to do that. <laughs> I was there for the entire 24-hour flight sim stream for the 10th anniversary. Ah, yeah, so this is easy. He's still eating the condom sweet. No, I'm not eating shooty gap with flavored condom sweets. Uh, I'm currently eating. These don't have like these. These aren't like root shapes or anything. Hang on, what shapes have we got? Ooh, fuck. Drive, drive. See, it's just normal shapes that you'd have for sweets like that. It's a normal sweet shape in it, just having a sort of a. I think it's supposed to be a lamp. Fuck! <laughs> um. <laughs> anyway. Um, it's a very normal shape, yeah. It's got a flared base. Yeah, so it stands up. That's what lamps have to do. 
Hands on the steering wheel, Dan. Hands on the steering wheel. Ten and two. Ten and two. Uh, vehicle ranks with one ninety-nine dollar roof. Says happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. How incredibly excited is Rebecca for the Frostpunk sequel? Oh god, Rebecca, come over here. <laughs> you talk. I'm not gonna eat a protein bar. <laughs> I know I'm not going to be needed in the next 10 minutes. So I'm looking forward to it, but I am concerned currently just because I I think Frostpunk is absolutely perfect. And so I'm a little bit nervous of the changes that they're making. And I think it might be veering away from what I really enjoy about Frostpunk. However, I'm obviously really excited to get my hands on it and see what it's like. That was my alarm. You're not dumb. I mean... <laughs> We could sit and go through the the most recent trailer section by section so we can look at every single bit of the screen that it shows us, which is what Daniel really enjoyed doing with me, didn't he, Daniel? Lovely. He loved every second of it so that we could zoom in on everything and then speculate about, you know, how's that going to play? What you know, what kind of impact is this going to be like? Um, and you had a wonderful time. What? You had a wonderful time. Lovely. And you'd like to do that again. Oh, fun. Yeah. So it was really good. I'm I'm really excited that it could be really good. I'm just I'm nervous. I'm nervous because it's just the best. It's, it's like, uh, how do you improve on perfection? Okay, I'll I'll stop there. Yeah. Come here. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Be on the webcam. Hey. Hey. Oh. oh. Okay. Is this weird? Should I kind of like it. Oh, should I just take it? Plus, it's two bus drivers. <laughs> this would be really weird if you looked to see what your bus driver looked like and it was just this. You could join twins. Aww. Aww. That'd be interesting. <laughs> Should dummy eyes. Here's Should I stuff. come and do them on the stream? My eyes? Yeah. No, thank you. I could put mascara on you on the stream. Hang on, we're shaking, we're shaking, we've got to sell it, we've got to sell it. Oh, you've fallen off. <laughs> Out the window, no, Rebecca! <laughs> oh, fuck. Hang away, it's not flipped. No, Rebecca! Oh, fuck. <laughs> I'll drive as far as hey, glasses, all right, bullies. <laughs> <laughs> Major Six says, "Hey, you guys should kiss." <laughs> screen, do our screen, do our screen. Do a smooch, do a smooch, quick smooch, quick smooch. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm married. Fuck you all. That's right. You can't get any of this, bussy. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty fucking married. Have you finished the Sting AW pay per view? I have. I watched Darby Allen kill himself off of a ladder through pane of glass. Bye, best friend. Bye. <laughs> that was fun. Um, realizing how much I've missed turning into your stream suddenly. You see, still hearted 44. It's always this sort of shit. <laughs> Only can play harmonica. No instruments today. No instruments. I just can talk. We can just chat, you know? Any New Year's cafe this year? Uh, we were at Rebecca's um, mum's for New Year, so. No. Grab <laughs> <laughs> yourself snacks. I'm hungry. I brought my snacks with me. I'll shout. Throw some behind me. Hit. Hit. Catch. What an exciting bus ride. Oh dear. Um, Dan, it looks bloody creepy just seeing you with that mirror. What's creepy about it? I'm just staring into your soul. The entire time. <laughs> oh dear. I think your passengers may or may not be the ghosts of your past mistakes. I need more than one fucking bus. <laughs> so once said, it's just comfy chaos and it's delightful, even if Daniel regularly says some cursed shit. I'm not gonna say, where have I ever said anything cursed? I haven't said anything cursed. Have you, uh, have you been asked to be in the new Ashens film yet? Yeah. <laughs> I was asked before it was announced. Has he got another one? No, he might have a new one. Um, what have we read on the Twiddlies? Foxy Soxies! I just checked the website for the uh, NFT console. The domain is up for sale. Ah, Really wonder if they tried to make a prototype at the end. No, they didn't. They didn't at all. 
Have you folks tried the Frostbolt board game? Says Consul Psychologist. We set it up. It took. Well, we, Rebecca's friend came around and set it up. And it took so long to set it up, we didn't have time to play it. <laughs> you told Charlie they were drinking Squirrel's Dad. I took some money away from Logan Paul, is all I'm hearing, right? Just saying. Just saying. Even if I do a restraining order now. Everyone, to gang has subscribed. Hello, hello. Three minutes ago, you're not getting any of this, Bussy. Look. You're not. You're going to have to come to terms with that. Dan, would you ever do a Pride Month charity stream or Rebecca or someone put you in drag? No. Also, Rebecca, how good would Dan look in drag? Oh, you look cute. I look cute. I wouldn't look successful. Also, you'd have to do Trixie Patel eye makeup, but, you know, I'd hate that. I don't want anything. I don't like things on my face. But what would your drag name be? My drag name yeah. would be Influenza. Wait, I need to swap fluence for something like cock. <laughs> Two hour mark! And my name will be Influenza in brackets if you know what I mean. Influencer? I hardly know her. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone have the sleep uh, plan fit in the passenger seat does? We might just quit. Yeah. What does it mean? Is something happening? Check my phone. It's my phone. It's white. There you go. I've run out, I've run out of shit. If I, if I got the drag, I would have to be uh, what's his face from Rocky Horror Picture Show, Tim Curry. I got my hair. So I do that. You know? Most names don't have brackets. Well, this one does. <laughs> Most names are puns, but in the world of drag queens, everything is allowed. Oh, is everyone mind if I sleep? I'm just going to have a quick lie down and then. If I feel the briarations, I can just turn the wheel. That's alright. This is quite cozy, actually. This becomes a really weird stream. Hey, right, fuck. Anyway. Um. Do a penny for every chat that just popped back in down woofing and have two pennies. I was woofing? God knows. Why does this top out at 45 miles an hour? Because it does! Because fuck you! This game is the fuck you! Uh, I was rewatching the GA4 tsunami my video. That game still holds up. The modding. So I can see does that hold up. Hey, no brand with 10 Australian Ditchery Dodgery Doos. School bus driver had a glass eye and he would whistle a single note as loud as possible repeatedly for hours. In comparison to this, I think he had it pretty well together. Oh, dear. My headcanon is that Dan has never got a haircut. Well, yeah. It just falls out slowly. Can you honk the horn? No. <laughs> Dad, you should pull the bus over whenever you read messages. No, SG Lou, because if I pull the bus over, the bus breaks down. I have to go back. Uh, I asked my question too late to be included in the Q&A stream, so ask it here, says Mr. Lynn. Uh, since you really enjoyed Baldur's Gate 3, uh, has that experience tempted you to play some more tabletop RPGs like D&D? No, it has not. I don't... That's the best way of putting this. I like watching D&D if it's being done by professionals. I am not a professional. I think D&D is a, a really good way of getting professional actors to... You know, if you get professional actors and people who like do it sort of professionally and they can do a really good job, that's enjoyable. Random people playing it, I got no interest in. Uh, I just don't, I don't have any interest in playing that. I think the game's fun, but all the sort of like, we're characters now, I just, I can't get my head, can't get into that. Yep. Yep, 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 Um, don't think any videos from you age poorly down, all your back catalogue is my comfort media. That's because I take things down. How's your eyesight doing? Still legally blind? Yep, watch. Baldur's Gate 3 DLC has been cancelled. Yeah, they're not doing a Baldur's Gate 4. You know, good. It starts, it middles, it ends. Stop it there. 
Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, yeah, I like. I, I, it's very like I try and watch some D and D stuff, and I end up. Uh, I really like um, ones hosted by I will remember his name, Dom from No Rolls Barred, uh, who was uh, he played Stalin in the uh, Communopoly. It, there's one they do which was like a, a Lovecraft one, a Call of Cthulhu. That's what it was. They did a Call of Cthulhu thing, and he just had such a just it really. It was beautiful. It was a really beautiful piece of work, and I really enjoyed the actual story being told. So I really enjoyed... It was funny, it was... Yeah, charming, but it, it managed to nail that sentimentality that I don't think would work in that sort of small group. I think it works as something you're performing. It's very weird. Um, but yeah. Um, anyway. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Any interest in a complete uh, series slash stream of Star Trek Resurgence, says Veggie Snake. Is that the Telltale and Spidey one? I would, I was going to get to that. It just it came out and it was like, there's no like, uh, it just needs a bit of like bugs and patches and stuff. Like the um, Star Trek Infinite or whatever it was, it needs some patches. I'm like, I'm just waiting for patches. I got so many fucking games these days. I'm just, um, I'm waiting for patches. I'm just waiting for patches for things. That's why I didn't pre-order Dragon's Dogma Two and why I have dodged a fucking bullet by the sound of it. Um, Dom from Noah's Spot is amazing. He, is a big master, absolutely. And cute as a button. What videos you deleted? I can't recall any that disappeared. A fair few. Um, I'd say about a hundred or so. Yeah. Maybe a few more than that. It's kind of weird. It's kind of weird. Um, anyway. Anyway. I'm waiting for patches on Star's Battlefront Classic after paying 30 quid for it. Oh, see, yeah, that's another one I waited on, and thank fuck I did. Anger buses on homosexuality is long gone. It is! All three of those things. Let's bring it back today! I'm gonna be angry! Which one are you's gay? <laughs> um, it is long gone, yes. Um, because I... While the sentiment of it's fucking despicable to have adverts that promote uh, bigotry on buses is positive. The attack on religion is something that I don't stand by anymore, so it's gone away. So this point about Battlefield Classic also, why the other they do to make it 50 gigabyte? Hello! Oh my god. Someone's going to pin that. What? It's oh. Christmas didn't pin that. Christmas, yeah. There was no one at the top. Oh, of course there wasn't. I couldn't see anybody at all. Dogs, in it? They just go insane. I don't know what that was about. <laughs> it's dogs. That's all you need to know. I asked Soup and Simon, and I swear to God, Soup just went, I don't know. <laughs> that chirp sounded like, I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> Battlefront. The remake of Battlefront is 57 gigs, I think it was. Not remake, just re-release. Because they've just AI upscaled textures and just gone, there you go. What I said that SG Lou is resubscribed? I can't remember. I have now! When you say you delete videos, do you mean delete them after years of being online? And delete videos you don't like before you post them? Oh, if I count videos I delete before I post them, I, it would be several, several hundred. Uh, but no, some videos that I've posted, I go like, oh, that I didn't handle that well or anything, so I'll get rid of it then. Just don't, I want to kind of be able to stand by my body of work, and if that means, I, I don't think we delete them, I think I just have a list of them, but I, if I just go, no, look, this is wrong, I'm just going to actually get rid of it. Um, they are doing a Sims movie, yeah, with Margot Robbie is what I've heard as well, but that's been going around for a long time, so, yeah. How much you feel you've changed as a person since you started YouTube? Well, I was like 20 when I started, or 21, and now I'm mid 30s so probably quite a lot <laughs> yeah I've probably changed a fair bit considering it's been you know a good chunk of my life <laughs> bit of vivid time um, Patreon exclusive the lost no I like to record special things for Patreon um, but yeah. But yeah, there's, um, 
I don't agree, but now I can't explain to people why I sing Swooshy K without something like a mass man. <laughs> yeah, that of my life, completely different person, I think. But yeah, I just like, you know, you sort of, you, you just don't, you just don't have the knowledge, and if you're going, I'm saying these things. I mean, I think I'm still going to keep doing that. There'll be stuff where I go, ooh, I said that, and that was not on the fucking deal. Um, some things I should get rid of though, still up, but we'll see. Uh, <laughs> um, yeah, I just don't listen. I don't think information should disappear. I, I don't mind. I, I think, I even and co. I quite like things existing only for a brief period of time. I think that's delightful. You know, I, uh, a, a play that never gets sort of like a, a filmed release sort of vanishing is, is a it's a very special thing. It makes every performance separate and different and I think art can benefit from a limited run. But it's like an ice sculpture as well. You know, you don't an ice sculpture that lasts forever otherwise you'd make it out of glass. The fact is you make it out of ice because it's it doesn't last. It's there for that one specific time. Things can go away. That's okay. I think like Stuff like video games and things that are published in that domain, I'd like to stick around. Just from a, a historical and archivist point of view. But I don't think there's anything historical about anything I've ever done. <laughs> yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think there's shit all. So I scrap says, oh, you remember my birthday? I did. Happy birthday to you. We played the Star Wars world for Sins of Soul Empire. Maybe the guys who made Star Trek Battle 3. No, because they made Star Trek Battle 3, which is better. Only OG fans remember the striptease video. Not even all of that. Uh, I'll also benefit from being documented. You take a picture of the sculpture. Yeah, but what does a photo convey from a sculpture? You know, you don't go, nah, I don't need to see that sculpture. I've seen a photo of it. <laughs> yeah, it's D brain is not compatible with the concept of things not lasting forever. I mean, I am big into physical media. I am big into keeping things around that I want to keep around. But also, you know, I think it's okay if stuff doesn't exist forever. And that's okay. What do you think about the whole Dragon's Dogma 2 situation? Oh, I saw the reviews. I was like, oh, wow, I might get that. Let's just make sure they don't fuck up the launch. Oh, they did. Okay, skip. <laughs> ah. Wonderful. Do you consider your body of work to be art? No. I don't. It's it's creative, but I don't think it's intention. I don't think anything I do is in... My intention is advertising, I think, more than anything else. Which is weird. Because I kind of... I, 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 you know, I take people to to call video games. That's what I've always wanted to do, is I want to go, hey, there's all this really cool actual art out there, and I can do, like, some silly video things that, you know, you, you, your brain likes to see <laughs> people's brain and then you'll go and buy games. I mean, I've, I've crafted an audience that's so fucking dense now, that even though, like, a video that used to be watched by, you know, millions of people, now watched by, like, 30, 40,000, it's getting the same amount of sales over. So I just feel, I feel like I'm a, a wheel in the corporate machine, the, the capitalist machine, but I, I, I do it in a way that is very as uncapitalist as possible. Because <laughs> I like to push into the thing. Yeah, I like to just do my own fucking thing. What about the 2 video? Oh, no, that was art. That was art. Some, no, some videos are. Just like, for the sheer sake of them, I think are... I wouldn't call them art, though. I, 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 I... That's not what they're designed for. It definitely made up. The Destiny play where you commented over with Ashens was art. Ashens and my beloved Wheezy Wader. But no, I don't think that was art. I think that was just silly. Yeah. Deathloop video is definitely art. The Deathloop video was was just fucking just off the top of my head. Nobody believed me when I said that when it first came out. Like, the the... Yeah, that, that Deathloop video was legitimately just... just It was just ad lib, the whole fucking thing. True story. Completely ad lib. In fact, if you're a Patreon, if you're a new Patreon, 
have a look in the uh, there's an old there's an old video in there which is the making of it um, because Matt was like this is fucking insane that you managed to pull this out so uh, was like can I just upload some of the like you talking to me and kind of explaining what to edit and how to edit and I was like yeah sure and that became a Patreon exclusive so you can actually watch me sort of build the video I think that's more interesting um that's what I like to do with the Patreon extra bits and pieces. Yeah, if you if you're into um, yeah, I don't know. I don't consider that art though. I just consider that creative endeavors. I think they're they're very different things. I think art is uh, deliberately trying to convey an emotion or a feeling or a thought, and what I try and do with what I create is convey. Hey, you should probably play this game. It's really cool. <laughs> Uh, hee hee dub K! Is it hee hee dub K? It is! With $19.99! Hi Dan, I finally have enough money to support! Thank you very much. I've watched you since the vlog days. I'm now 21! Thank you for many, many years of hoping you've mental illness. You are very welcome. Hope you're doing better. Hope you're growing into yourself. Yeah. Making off it is one of my all time faves. I did, I did, um. Yeah. I did enjoy doing that. Because it's just a silly idea I had, because I found the game to be perfectly honest, quite dull. Uh, and so if, it, it depends on the game. If I don't like the game, I kind of put a bit more effort into it. <laughs> um, help me with uh, memories and mental health. Yeah, I, 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 I know what you meant. Hee hee hee, a dub K. Ooh, fuck. You try to make people laugh, though. That's an emotional thought. No, but like it's a specific. Like, I think. Fuck yeah, video games is closer to art because I, I, I'm trying to convey how I feel about video games. And Paradox is a book and it's a proper novel and everything, so that's interesting. Um, Death the Artist is interesting here because it sets it's up to the, uh, the audience to decide why something is art. That's true, I'll just give you my opinion. You can choose. You can be like, yeah, the fucking face ring video is art, and I'll be like, oh, fuck me, stay away. Ah. Uh, <laughs> uh. What's your favorite video I've made? Like what one you sat back and went, damn, that couldn't have went better. Oh, literally, I know this is such a wanky thing to say. Saturday's video. Uh, Epileptic Egg Saturday's video, which I will now reveal to be a state agent simulator. Uh, I expected nothing from and got so much back that when I was doing the edit, I was legitimately pissing myself laughing. Uh, it just, it goes wrong into such perfect ways. It builds up to an actual story. There's a bit which I showed Rebecca, which Rebecca found ridiculously funny. Um, with the, the bit where I go, hello, love. That's the, yeah, that's so good. Um, so there is definitely a, uh, yeah. It's, uh, I came away from that video going, that game couldn't have wigged out and been weirder in any better. It was just perfectly, mwah. What time is Patreon release? Uh, probably nine, like normal. I don't know, Matt puts them up, so. Whatever. Um, the Towns VR video is art to me. Well, that was an era when I was like, well, let's make YouTube a bit more art like. And actually kind of try and push it and do something different with it. But I kind of, I've run out of ideas. I was like, yeah, I just want to advertise cool games. If I get it, miss too many things. Uh, Woody J01, let's resubscribe. As is Chan, 73. It says, hmm. Them sexy, sexy eyes. Oh, sexy eyes. Um, wait, fuck that lumberjack! That l lumberjack game with the horse was incredible. So <laughs> that was until the estate agent video. My favourite moment with a horse in a video game. But yeah, that's different now. That's changed. Uh, Spectre officially, don't know if it's just me, but I can safely say over half my top games are recommended by you, including The Outer Wilds, which is my favourite. Yes. That game was... See, there's games like that which I just get really passionate about. I'm like, everybody has to see this. Everyone has to see this. Estate agency is definitely not art, but what you make with it is a canvas for Dan Vinci. <laughs> yes, I am Dan Vinci. Oh, dear. That's really nice. Um... Yeah, the horse that rolls over just. Why is there a horse on the state agent game? Why is there a casino on the state agent game? 
Why is anything that happens in that video in the estate agent game? I will say it was a two hour recording session and I estated zero agents. I didn't even touch that side of the game. I just, yeah, couldn't get near it. If you play Tunic, I did. I didn't like it, Cinnamon Robin. First we've ever come to Out Wilds in terms of discovery and clever design. I really struggle with, um, like, memorizing layouts of games like that. So, like, a Dark Souls I can remember because you have different vistas and different things and a lot of distance information. But if it's, like, isometric, I can't remember shit. Like, even, like, a Castlevania, I can remember where things are because you've got a background, you've got a backdrop, and I can be like, oh, this is the castle where it looks like this. But with something like that, I could. It's like Fez. I had the same problem with Fez. I just couldn't navigate it. I couldn't get it in my head. So, yeah. Really should play it because the eye. I don't want to. I don't want to. It's too. I, I had a perfect thing. I don't need it. You know, I don't need it. Let's play that. Let's game out. Play the state agent sim. I assume that they have. It's yeah. But I, I don't want to do the uh, thing. <laughs> the tractor song is clearly up. Oh dear. Do you consider stand up to be up? Uh, I have seen stand up that is absolutely up, and I've seen stand up that is just track. Um, but yeah, no, definitely, I've seen some um, some some stand up I've seen, especially in like Edinburgh and places. I've just gone, Jesus fuck, that was amazing. Um, Tig de Toro's stand up special about having cancer is like legitimately fucking brilliant. Uh, Aaron does stuff, says, we're ever having a Project Glint from way back. Oh my goodness. So this was before I had ADHD. Uh, it was a game that uh, we were working on, which sort of fell apart because I had ADHD and didn't know it. And I kept jumping around into different things. So that's why projects are now a lot like, I I'm very careful with what I decide for projects and how we work on projects because yeah project load sort of fell apart from that it was uh, it was like a um what's the best way of describing it rebecca i don't even know what it ended up in the end because you kept changing your mind all the time yeah that's the problem <laughs> that's what happened to it it was basically the point of it was it was a uh like sort of visual novel but the main gameplay loop was you were a teacher teaching children and so you had to teach the children as well as have this like story going on in this like futuristic city thing that was the vibe um but yeah it fell apart because uh, i had adhd i just noticed the sky is changing i think we are going to go into night time still got all the documentation for it yeah we still got it all there Back to the cyclist playthrough. Uh, I did it. It finished. Yeah. How's the card game idea going down if you're still doing it? Oh, well. Well. Um, we are still designing it. We've taken it, basically, a, most of our side projects. No, I'm going to go further. All of the side projects have stopped just because of the uh, fucking building work. Just cannot do extra work. We are, we're just about keeping up with what we actually need to get done. So side projects are all on the back burner until next door shuts the fuck up. <sighs> but it is, you know, it's going. It's going. It's going. But good to remember it, Project Glint. Yeah. Uh, Kieran says, I've never laughed harder than your VR Japanese schoolgirl shooter game. Uh, <laughs> where I end up in the closet. <laughs> Did you ever finish Exapunks? Hang on, wait. <laughs> Still in my fucking top drawer is the Exapunks manuals because I keep going back to it and I haven't beat the fucking thing yet. I've even somewhere in this drawer just a bit busy. I've got the fucking envelope you get to open at a certain point in the game, but I've never managed to fucking get there to open it. It's so hard. Oh dear. So you better decide to play so like Desert Bus and I'll say call that laser tag. And play laser tag right now, I'm doing both. You don't know. Oh wait, you can see me. This is all pre-recorded, this bit here, what I'm pointing to right now. In fact, everything's pre-recorded. True story. Um, think you'll get back into game development? I don't know, hang on, let me ask my programmer wife, Rebecca. Hello. Do you think we'll get back into game development? Eventually. Um, yeah, when, when next door's, um, you know, gone to hell. Yeah, and then I'm feeling better. Yeah. After I've recovered. Yeah. 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 We'll get there. 
Um, yeah, anyway. That's kind of why things are... Uh, yeah, stop. Do you still have the discount togepi? Yeah, it's not true. Yeah. <laughs> discount togepi. <laughs> Your driver today is togepi. And the uh, the sequel, which was the discount for Fable. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> that face is barely visible. Which I absolutely fucking love those two. If this is pre-recorded, then not say these numbers. 65155173890. Done. Happy birthday, it's my birthday on Sunday, says Jess Yesser. My Saturday was so close. So close. Um, that somehow looks more like Dio than Clefable. Yeah, but it's supposed to be just Clefable. And it's the luminous pink. You still put yourself out the key Pokemon. Yep. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. yep. One of my favorite Dan moments was one of Max Payne's game. Pun jumping through a window. Dan commented, Payne's pain, pain. That's why they call it window pain. <laughs> oh, dear. How much you'd know before the out? Oh, in a spoiler friendly way, of course. That's Growlithe Fan 42. How much you'd know about the Outer Wilds series? Some of the things you seem to figure out impressively for a blind playthrough. I know you have played some of the early versions. So I played the early version. Uh, which you've seen most of my footage of, but aside from that, no, I hadn't touched the thing. I'm just quite good at working out obscure puzzles like that. I'm currently playing Chance of Sinar? Chance of Sun. I've only seen the touch screen once. Um, which I'm, I'm kind of blitzing through, but I'm like, this is fucking great. <laughs> but sort of putting weird things together and seeing sort of those little odd connections, it's, it's what I'm good at. Well, that's what my brain fucking does. Um, literally walking ass backwards in solutions. Yeah, I do that all the time. You'll notice that that's definitely a thing that I keep doing. Um, but yeah, there's definitely a... Uh, get new no keeps friends video. No, that was a one-off. Let's keep that as a one-off. Oh, uh, dear. Um... How long to drive then? Oh, well, we're two hours twenty-six minutes in. We've got another five hours thirty-four minutes to go. No, thirty-six because we have to go to like two minutes past because we started a little late. Wow, what a fun fucking time! Um, what are we? What are we? What are we? What are we? Happy birthday to Loki Brand! Thank you very much. Uh, to six 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 has subscribed. Welcome, Crazy Ukadena has resubscribed and says, "Very nice, what the fuck." How much of the road? And he's uh, thinks to be nice, new, interesting, challenging, or an emergency. What to focus on, Bigsy Council? <laughs> yeah. Uh, Lance Solon has resubscribed for thirty-one months. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! Uh, HP Cookie, Dan, question for you: Which thirteen ways to die was your favourite to make? Which was your favourite in general? I remember none of them. <laughs> I must admit. I think the only bit I remember of any of them was because it took about four fucking hours to record. And it's the opening of the Dishonored one with the dun 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 music. And I do a running jump off this massive bridge and then like land directly on someone. It took so many fucking goes to get that shot. So many fucking goes. But yeah, that's a thingy. Major thing says I need new Outer Wilds like logic puzzle game to play because that's the sort of thing Origin Golden Order etc. is exactly one type of game. So Chance of Sonar? Have you played that Veggie Snake? Uh, it's 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 that energy, it's that vibe, it's it's more Oberdin than anything else. You play as like a monk who wakes up at this place and you have to work out the language through context clues. And then you have to <laughs> oh no, it's Isabel Sauce. Oh no, I've been watching with mobile data! Yeah, but it's not going to be huge, because it's been a very consistent image, so you should be fine. Um, yeah, so Chance of Sonar is... You, you have to basically work out logic from... Uh, yeah, from clues. But then you also... Sorry, language from clues. And then you sort of guess words, and you write down what you think they are. And then if you guess, like, three right in the book, it tells you you're, you're on the right path. But then you have to work out other languages... There are lots of languages, uh, and they all have different grammatical rules and how they space their language out, and you've got to work that all out through context clues and reading little bits of paper and all that sort of stuff. And then you have to translate between two of the different languages as helping people communicate with each other. 
so you have to sort of like jump back and forth between two languages. If you are into Obra Dinn, I 100% recommend it. It's called Chance of Sonar. There'll be a, um, something in chat, I'll type it out. There will be a uh, three Fab Games Friday on it because I've been playing it and I fucking love it. Yeah. Oh, it's so good. It, and one caveat. <laughs> It has a um, four, few four stealth sections that are fucking awful. Um, but you just get through those. Just get through those. It doesn't matter. Uh, Jimerson with five pounds. Happy birthday, Dan. Putting a five for your card. Don't spend it all at once. If you any more WWE 2K GM mode, I'm so interested in trying it. I've been playing it with Rebecca. So we've been playing it like sitting next to each other, just taking it in turns playing our brands. It almost feels like a board game. I'm having a lot of, you having a lot of fun. I tell you what wasn't fun, just before my pay per view, when fucking Paul Heyman screwed me over and said I couldn't use any of my champions. <laughs> that fucking guy. Yeah. Can you get the translation wrong and accidentally start a war? Uh, no. No. Um, man, I'm such a grass thing about your low chaos versus high chaos villains in Dishonored. It's what got me into it by the game. I'm so glad I did. Dishonored's still one of my favorite games of all time. I have no idea what you're talking about. What did I do for Dishonored? Did I do a video on Dishonored? Yeah. Cool. I remember it. <laughs> oh yeah, because I know oh, you're right. I did two different videos, and I did sort of the yeah the the I'm not gonna kill everything, and then I did the sneaky sneaky, so you could see the two different ways that the things happened. Um, it's like what I did for Dark Souls. I did the Dark Souls person who's been playing it for ages, and then the person who was new to it. Yeah. Anyway, would you recommend Charles Star on handheld or PC? I'm playing it on PC, but I'm playing it with a controller, so anything. I guess you don't remember that one. Because I've done 3.1 thousand videos on my U main YouTube channel alone. My main YouTube channel alone. 3.1 3 fucking thousand videos. That's a lot of videos. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, Red Hood. 0901 with 7.99 Australian dollar reduce. Sorry about spelling Heavy Tread Hell Divers 2. I've kind of tried a bit of it, but the, the connection was all funky and it was just, yeah. I might pick it up again later, but I'm not going to be getting it anymore. Um, but yeah, I've done over 4,000 4, videos across all my channels, which is. I guess. Um, what else we got? What else we got? What else we got? Uh, Deus Immortal! Or Deus One Mortal uh, has subscribed. Hello. I, AI Cerberus. A cocktail in 2017. You took one look at me and assumed I was a skateboarder. I thought you'd like to know. I still can't fucking ollie. <laughs> you were holding a skateboard, to be fair. I mean, come on. Ah, <laughs> uh, dear. Anyway, it's a lot of videos. It's a lot of videos I made. Uh, I think uh, 2K22 might be my chill, fun game for the summer. Good to hear you both enjoying it. Yeah, re we really are. I really enjoy... Um, just the sheer amount of fucking shit. It's got so much shit in it. What made you bring back the three game series? So I talked about this on the Patreon, but I um, so I do like a like a monthly recap thing where I just talk about whatever the fuck's on my mind. I really wanted to when I came back to YouTube because I took a bit of a break, I, not intentionally, but I was writing the book and I just sort of fell away from it. I wanted to come back and go right now. I know what I want to get from YouTube, and I want to be able to show off as many cool games and things as possible. And I wanted to make sure everything had a space. So the plays is going to be for really cool games that you might not have heard of. And silly videos. You know, challenges and stuff for old ones. Let's be doing nostalgia and stuff like that. Uh, then we get the free fab games where I'm like, you know. Chance of Sonar isn't for me going to do a whole video. I won't be able to keep that energy momentum up. But I can go, here's a really cool game. Give a really quick explanation. And I've got the audience now where people are just going to fuck off and buy it. And so that's, I was like, yep, that's for them. And then live streams is just for whatever the fuck I want to do be it stupid long stuff like this or going oh there's a new game out today you know let's try play a new game a little while ago that was fucking rad what was it I played the fuck was I the game came out and I played it like was it oh, was it 2k24 was there another one I can't remember now I can't remember now but anyway um yeah Ugh. anyway um on top of my head, if you made an update highlight video for the main channel, what are your best bits to include? It's got to that point where I just don't remember them. <laughs> I think what I'll do is after this year, I will do a highlights video that's just from this past year. So yeah. Um, 
Open the stream t to a hacking jump scare or that. What, where, where are ads playing? Nothing should be. Oh, if you open a stream, yeah, sometimes. Uh, doing a full video on charts and I will spoil some of the story, so putting in three games is a better fit. Exactly, yeah. It gives me that sort of. It just lets me show games really quickly for people, you know. Um, sure, Bag says, I trust Dan's opinion so much now that he has to, all he has to do is save the name of a game that's good and I'll play it. I, yeah, I think that's the thing you want. Um, happy birthday, Dan! Another real question. Ducks or geese? Says a blade of kitten too. Can I pick. I'm gonna go for ducks. Geese are dicks. <laughs> Tastes a real fucking dicks, Jesus. Excuse me, God, I've got air coming out. I've got itchy nose. God, falling apart. Uh, potato sword fighter it says damping on Taskmaster would be the funniest thing ever. Okay, maybe not as funny as David Carreros, but he's a force of raw cast. David Carreros is the best thing to have happened to Taskmaster. My God, absolutely incredible. Um, I'm, I've been invited to be on Taskmaster. There's a video on my channel where I've been invited to be on Taskmaster. The series like 200 or 400 and something, so, you know. I'll be there. Series 400 and something, I'll be there. Uh, Curve Knight! The $10 ruse! Uh, I just remember you were detonating a gas station in a Just Cause video. I made a throwaway joke about having none of us become inventors. I'm now working on developing synthetic muscle fibers post uni. That's so fucking cool! Like, wait, like, so you're gonna, like, Fuck. For what purpose is that for? Is it like a food thing? So it's like to make artificial food, or is it for like replacement limbs and stuff? Is it for like robotics? That's fun, that is. Fantasy YouTuber Taskmaster cast. Down as the Taskmaster. No, I want to be in it. I want to play. Thoughts on the upcoming Taskmaster cast? Uh, very excited that one of the uh, Inside Number Nine uh, lads is on there. That's the good stuff. That's the good stuff. Um, but my still my number one pick for, for Taskmaster is Ross Noble. I want to see Ross Noble on there. Mm-hmm. Oh, dear. Uh, Conkabru! Dan, currently using you as a podcast while driving for my job. Thank you for the entertainment. You are very welcome. She bet Taskmaster VR game. Oh, yeah. That's a plays video. <laughs> that's easy. Easy peasy. Final series of Inside Number 9 this year. I know, I've seen like no episodes of it. I think it's a great show that I definitely can't watch because it's too scary. But I think it's a great thing. Uh, oh, Confidence back. Hopefully I can do robotics and industrial applications. I want to... You want to try a house moving castle style. It's a pretty good option. Um, yeah, so like synthetic muscles for robots. That's fucking cool. Uh, Dude Mini says, Holy crap, if I teleport a decade into the past... I'm 25 again! My limbs work! <laughs> ow, ow! <laughs> I just pull my fucking shoulder out and suck it. Uh, Comedians, really. Which might be on a wintry one, like one of the New Year's ones. Uh, uh, uh. So, did I see you around? Hello there, dude, media. Hope you're doing well. What happened to that what guy? Oh, you mean my really good friend, what fan, huh? We haven't spoken in... Oh, fuck. Days? Well, actually, I think he sent me a message this morning. Uh, excuse me. They sent me a message this morning. Um, I, I have what over every Christmas. <laughs> we, 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 just a friend. Just a good friend. Um, has the Taskmaster from Marvel Comics been on Taskmaster? Not yet. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, anyway. Uh, hi, I love you, Dan, says DJ Corden. Yep. Uh, been sub for 10 years, can't get enough of that gorgeous smile. <laughs> Very welcome. Great tonight time says, oh yeah, I sat listening to Rahala Support because of you. <laughs> oh dear. Rachel Wolf says, what is lovely IRL? Correct Amundo. Have you played Genshin Impact for a video? No, I downloaded Genshin Impact because it got a lot of like buzz before it came out. Um and I've <laughs> This is genuinely true. I turned it off before the opening cutscene had finished because it was so anime. I went, I don't care how good this is, I cannot play this piece of shit. I was like, nah, nah, I'm alright, mate, I'm alright. I'm like, <laughs> day one. And out day one. What was on a Patreon podcast a while ago? Yes! Uh, when what was around for Christmas? True story. Eyes on the road. I need to look at the road. 
Sorry, everyone. Is there still an everyone? <gasps> One person's lot gone. They turned to a pipe. Bye, one person. What's that pipe doing? There's someone's leg going. <laughs> Someone's just trying to get out the window. Ah, <sighs> dear. Um. Anyway, two. Who are your passengers? Uh. -huh. Well, one of them is uh, Esri. Every. Someone in, in chat, and then whoever's at the back is gone. Also said hi. Oh, was it you at the back? I can't remember now. I'm gonna say to the rest of this, when we get there. Okay, Jeeves. I'll ask you later. But... Made a white choice. Get you to back to shit. Talk to a friend of mine. I've never shut up about it. Since they've been eliminated from the friend group. That is fair enough. That is fair enough. It's just like the one in the back. Ah, oh, okay, yes. I knew you were there. Oh my god, do reckon I can play the game Monopoly in 41 minutes. But not Monopoly Go! There was a thing recently that Monopoly Go's advertising budget was larger than the development budget for the new Spider-Man game. It's a mobile phone piece of shit, Skinner Box motherfucker. All mobile phone games are shit. Hang on, let me check my Marvel Snap. Should we play Marvel Snap? Oh, I'm driving. <laughs> Does not suggest the same. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right, I'm booting up Marvel Snap. I'm not gonna fucking lie. Look at this. Oh yeah. Is it the missing person the person who says we're smelling like exorcist? That was basically all of them. Oh my god, a Nokia parcel face reveal. Anything else you want to see? Is my mouth hurt? If I do it quick enough, you'll see the whole me. More people need to know about the, the knowledge base game. Strange Horticulture! I have strange horticulture. Oh, ew, advertising. Is that adverts? Where's adverts? Apart from this. You still watch Yahtzee? Yeah, there was a, a Yahtzee video this week, for some reason, I don't think. See the shitty Spore mobile ripoff that's been made? That's probably been a fair view. Challenge. Can Dan win on Marvel Snap while driving in Desert Bus? Absolutely. fucking <laughs> um, Currently level 86. Uh, I've only missed one season not being infinite. So... Um, I've got currently running an anti-Thanos deck that I built. But I don't need to do this. Uh, can we see your left ear? Wait, that's my right ear. No, they're in headphones. The secret. I was talking about the app, Monopoly Go advertising budget. Yeah, it's good, isn't it? Fucking weird. Um, what's your current Marvel Snap back? Yeah, so I'm running a. Uh, oh god, I've moved the mouse. Uh, 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 oh fuck! Oh, somebody news in. Hello, new person. Woo! <laughs> Lovely. Uh, Life hacker forty-two says I've destroyed. Hi, Life Hacker 42. Yeah, I'm running a, an anti Thanos deck because Thanos has been so up that every deck I fucking go against was Thanos. And I'm like, well, that's the meta. Let's. What I basically do to get it infinite is I'll see a deck appear over and over again. And I go, okay. I'll just not. I'll just do the opposite for that. Uh, so, my. Yeah, my current deck, which I call Anti Purple, is them cards there. There you go, that's all I'm showing of you. Uh, yeah, Nebula, Core, Grandmaster, Master Mold, Black Widow, Mobius, Rock Slide, Shang-Chi, Iron Lad, Taskmaster, Dark Cork, and Ronan. Basically, it's to put as much shit into people's decks as possible, because um, Thanos comes with six extra cards in his deck, so that's really fucking useful. And if you can stall him getting his cards out, that deck fucking dies. And the Plasterer, I too am convinced that the matchmaking varies depending on your deck. If you start running a discard deck, you go up against other discard decks. I, I swear that's fucking true. You call your deck anti purple? Anti purple, but yeah. <laughs> Dan, you on Team X Men or Team Avengers? I'm Team I'm not playing that shit. I don't care. Yassi's having a break after GDC. Ah, oh, it's GDC, isn't it? Yeah. Of course, that's why. That's why there was no Unpithal podcast this week. Or will be. Do you play Midnight Suns? I booted it up on Steam Deck, but it made my Steam Deck be very loud, and I don't like very loud Steam Deck games, so I didn't play anymore. Gold of Sun is set in. I'll get back to it at some point. At some point. Um, all things of you lead back to Taskmaster somehow. Well, it's the same way that all podcasts lead back to Tim Key eventually. Like, there's no... Uh... <laughs> yeah. Tell me fuck with that deck. Thank you. Feel free to use it. Feel free to abuse all these fucking Thanos players, even though they've just got... Um... Thanos just got a nerf. Oh, yeah. Imagine Greg Davis in your deck. I want a Greg Davis variant. That's what I want. Um, you do your return trip? No. No. 
I thought you floated off into space after Just Cause videos. Let's see, you have internet. I've been making videos the entire fucking time. Ah, YouTube. Chats that seem dead worth getting. Oh, BSK Blue. It's the most beautiful games console of all time. I spent so much fucking time on it. I legitimately don't think like if I wasn't if I didn't do this for a living, I wouldn't have a computer after the Steam Deck's a thing. Because it's just it's just all the lovely games. Nom, 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 nom. I've been playing Ultros on it at the moment. It's just shit, it's so good. Um anyway. Oh god, it's happening again! It's just Waddle! What a rush of nostalgia! How's everyone doing on this glorious day? Doing well. Doing right. Need a wee. Can't do the thing. Rebecca! Can I worry you for a second? <laughs> do you uh, do you want to just drive the bus for a second? Yeah, not really. Okay, I did a wee, uh, yeah, yeah. and otherwise the bus will crash. What, what are you going to do about that then? Uh, I don't think I'm allowed to piss on a live stream. What did you, what did you plan for this? I forgot to plan for this oh, until just now, Yeah. and I've drunk quite a lot. Yeah, for you. Yeah, so I could do with a little wee. If you could just like, just nudge the... Because I've, I've wedged down the back button. Oh. So, so a little, just just, yeah, just don't push the back button at all because it will pop back up. Um, just just the, the left hand look stick, right? Yeah, it jerks a lot. The bus veers slightly to the right. Yeah. So when it, just, just go left. You can be in either lane, it doesn't matter. Thank you. Rebecca's going to talk to you all now. Oh, wow. Look at me. <laughs> look at my shirt. I'm going to eat the sweeties as well. So I go, ah, 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 ah. Well, don't put that on the seat. I can't sit down. Oh, right. Oh my god, stand here awkwardly then, shall I? Hello! I'm gonna put that on a sticky plate because he should have left it on the seat. Hello! Oh, what are you even seeing? Hello. There we go. Is that good? Am I in the right place, place now? How are all of you doing today? Are you enjoying Daniel's stream? Oh god. I am worried I am gonna crash it because <laughs> that would not be good. Oh dear. I know a stream with me on with it with a camera on. On me, not on a dog. What's that about? That's not on. There we go. Crash of content. I mean. Well apparently you can crash it on the side of the road. I am gonna let you in a secret. I didn't watch any of Daniel's Desert streams. Hello Daniel! We kept going! Have good. Yeah, I didn't crash it. Well done. Do you want to do this for another six hours? No. Or? <laughs> I'm scared. It's scary. It it's scary. Ugh. Thank you. You're welcome. I hope it was a good way. Yeah, it's delightful. Absolutely fucking delightful. It really was. What kind of music do you like, Rebecca? I like lots of kind of kinds of music. I love eighties music and I love metal and I love country. At the moment, I'm listening to the undertones. That was a speedy piss. Goddamn! Well, the bus is going fast. I couldn't leave it to Rebecca. You've been enjoying the undertones as well. I have, yeah. It's just your mouth. Anyway, we're Mr. Rebecca ready. I'm going to sit back, <laughs> and then my eyes will be in the right place. I'm going to sit well, fuck back. Uh, <laughs> Did you wash your hands? Yes, with piss. As you do. Oh, how quick Rebecca's no was. It's quite a stressful game, right? Like, it's consist consistently like just a low level of stress. Um, did I say that Ogmelon has resubscribed? Because now I have to. Dan, you'd have Rebecca do your eye makeup. It's gorgeous. Maybe some lipstick. No, I don't want things on my face. I can't do face paint and stuff as a kid. Ugh. Uh, Fleshy Lily 5049 has resubscribed. Says hi Rebecca, so happy to see you. Oh hello. Jumbo Slice has resubscribed. Suffer Dan, renewed for Rebecca. <laughs> Maybe sleep with a private with the Sega CD get out of the Uh this isn't the Sega CD version, I'm afraid. This is the new version. You hope for new dot two? Yeah, when's the trailer out? What time's the trailer out today? We're coming up on the three hour mark. We're doing okay. It's now time for me to say something controversial! Anybody got anything to want me to talk about? There's a... Uh, uh, wait, there's a new robot style event being reported for Mech Plus today. <gasps> Compared to in interest requires... Like, a request went out today! <gasps> oh my god, yes, new, new robots on Mech Plus. I want them to get the license. 
Five, uh, five is coming, that's when this gets bad, yeah. The fuck, man, look at my hand, look. Can you see the little scar? Oh! Don't have it then. Just stand up with it. Dan, what's the coolest dream you've ever had? I dreamt that me and Joe Biden were in a library reading books. And Joe Biden turned to me and he asked me to spell a word for him. Um, and the word was Gafudimapur. And I went, oh, Joe, you silly fuck. And he went, <laughs> I am a silly fuck. And then he went back to reading um, Rebecca Lynch's, or oh, Becky Lynch, as she's known, uh, autobiography. And then he exploded. It was really cool. <laughs> Royals event is Mecha Mania being hosted by Rebel Slave. Hoping to end a featherweight. Neat. Even for the Stargate remake. They're remaking Stargate. Darth Nemesis, don't remake Stargate. Continue Stargate. Will you be watching the new Ghostbusters that came out today? I have seen one Ghostbusters film. One. And I didn't like it. <laughs> um, it's Frozen Empire, the new one, isn't it? Uh, no, I, I watched the original, but I honestly I didn't watch any others. Because Ghostbusters is this, is this set of films, right, where there's only actually one good one, and it's the first one. And everything else is apparently shit. So why would I care? You know, why, why would you care? The Stargate remake? I don't know! The Darth Nemesis? With two pounds. Says there's a remake. They shouldn't remake it. Just expand on it. Stargate's the best fucking... One of the best sci-fi shows ever made. Just expand sequel it. Never got Ghostbusters a shot by a guy. Watch the original didn't really enjoy it. Yeah, me neither. It's just, you know, it's just got that cynical American thing. I was like, eh. Even the first one wasn't that good. Yeah, it's not really my thing. James A. Caster is apparently in the new one, which feels weird. Yeah, that just sounds like stunt casting. Yeah. Did you see the Alien Romulus trailer? Nah, I'm waiting for Alien Remus. Uh, that's gonna be where I get to the series. That's a dangerous joke, because Alien Remus might be a thing, because I know nothing about the Aliens franchise, I've seen none of them. Apparently it's a sitcom with a cat, I'm not really paying attention. Alex Salt says, I've never seen Stargate, what makes it so good? So, it starts with the humans finding the Stargate, and working out how to dial it, and realising it's a wormhole between other Stargates, so that we can start to travel and explore the world. And by the end of it, because we have travelled, and we've negotiated, and we've made friends, uh, and our technology has advanced, we start to get things like Earth has its own spaceships and shit, which we didn't have at the start because it's set in modern times. Or modern times in the fucking 90s. So, as we met more people and as technology came in, it didn't just go reset button, reset button, reset button at the end of every episode. The actual show and the universe expands and humans start to move out into the stars. It's still a bit hush-hush and undercover, but it's all very much happening Which is, uh, yeah. It's just kind of, it's a show that always evolved always evolved yeah it's good shit I think James J. Caster is an actor makes sense he got plenty of experience from his career as an undercover cop <laughs> yeah he did yeah you know he probably did a bit of acting when he was an undercover cop it was uh, <laughs> uh, that was a very good joke good reference what up mm -mm -mm. dad which finger do you use with your thumb when you click them Big point of contention. Wait, to click my finger? All, any of them. They're just all fucking... They all just fucking shatter. Is Stargate Universe worth watching? No. I don't like Stargate Universe. It was like, what if Stargate? They're edgy. And Stargate is like, light camp fun. It's the Torchwood to Doctor Who's Doctor Who. It's not... It's not necessary to watch. You know. Watch Doctor Who. Watch, you know, Sarah Jane Adventures, which is Atlantis. And then, you know... But skip them. Skip the universe. Um, yeah. Anyway. Uh, yeah, SG ones were really Jimmy good. What's the objection of this game? Ah, Dusty Knox. Uh, we are driving. We're just doing a little drive. We've left Tucson uh, two hours fifty three minutes ago, and we're heading to Las Vegas. It's a three hundred sixty mile drive, uh, and it takes eight hours. And when you get there, you get a point, and that's it. Uh, how many on the bus still? 
four. One of them's face has fallen off. But they're doing okay. Uh, what would be the top two equivalent to lower decks? Uh, Fanfiction.net, probably. I don't. I don't know. I don't actually know. I don't think we have one yet. We could really do with one. An animated comedy Doctor Who would be genuinely brilliant. Um, but yeah. Do you want to go back and play GTA Four? I've not. Oh, Leather Cap is a new member. Hello, Leather Cap. New member on YouTube. Oops, Daddy. If you Taskmaster Minnesota, I haven't. But do they speak with Minnesotan accents? Because I will fall in love with everybody. Because it's one of the best accents in the world that I could not reproduce in any way. But it's a delightful accent. And I want to live in Minnesota because every I could I would be friends with everybody because they all sound like from Minnesota. <laughs> it's probably the, the audio sounds like the bus changing gears. I am. I'm currently up to gear seven thousand nine hundred fifteen. Yep, 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 yep. I've heard people compare Atlantis to DS9. It's more like, what if Voyager actually remembered its central premise? <laughs> I don't think, I, I think it didn't, they didn't really get a DS9 out of it. It's very similar to SG1. Very similar to SG1. But yeah. Have you seen the biggest ball of twine in Minnesota? Not a weird ass song. What the fuck's my nose so much you today? It's all the cocaine I've been sniffing. That's right, kids. I've never met a bus driver one on the trolley. I thought I was just getting into the characters. Anyway, I've got the munchies. Ignore that. Um. <laughs> um. Yes, they do. Ah, oh, beautiful. Your eyes are always looking away from the road and it's worrying. And what's brilliant, right, is this is me looking at the game. This is me looking at chat. My eyes are not on the mo road. I'm just saying that now at all. Uh, the DJ, Monkey Fad. Monkey Lad. Hey, mate, I looked back at your channel and then figured I've been watching for 12 years. Happy birthday, Dad. Thank you. I'm old. Uh, Ninja Badger has resubscribed. It says, inspiring more viewers' careers. Dan zigzags his way through the frontier, bust barely on track, his eyes staring back, capturing souls to power more years. Oh, fuck. Uh, Yuri Eliminates, so something there yet? Um, coming up to the three hour mark. Which is a pretty good hour mark to be at. Yeah. Have you seen the Harold Halibut trailer? That name rings a bell. Is that the game where you sort of you were jumping into other things or doing something or. I can't remember what the fuck you were doing. That was definitely a game that I remember playing. Yeah. Yeah, my my um my birthday is tomorrow, and uh, yeah, the YouTube channel thirteen years old, thirteen years old. Oh, it's the clay animated game. That's the one. Have you seen X Men ninety seven? No, I haven't had time to watch it yet, but I will be watching it because um, I love that idea. Just going back and just carrying on an old fucking thing. Oh, Harold Halibut. Now I know what it is. I've just clocked it in my brain. It's the claymation game set on a crashed spaceship that's underwater, right? That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. That's my vibe. We've got a blurry as fuck. There we go. Oh no, it's time for this channel. It's bright teen years. Oh yeah. They're doing that. Uh, what made you dust off Desert Bus for such a special occasion? Well, I wanted to do a game from the year when I... That I I, I like the idea of when I played uh, Sonic. No, Sonic. What the fuck am I talking about? When I played Thingy, Simpsons Hit and Run. And I wanted to do a game that came out in 2011. I wanted to beat a game that came out in 2011 that was uh, about eight hours long. And I was like, well, nothing really came out in 2011 that I want to play for eight hours straight. The only thing that was there was Portal 2. Because my channel's about the same age as Portal 2. So... Yeah, I don't know. I was like, yeah, whatever. I'll just desert bus. I just felt like doing a road trip, and I didn't. There was no new games to do road trips on. I was like, well, if I do desert bus on this version and actually finish it, that's not what I thought at all. I was going to do the old version, but I could. I just want to go back. I've never done a desert bus live before. I wonder who they're going to cast for the desert bus uh, movie. Margot Robbie, I hear. Yeah. 
<laughs> I've seen people complaining that X-Men 97 is too woke. Okay. I've seen people complaining that cans of beans are too woke. Like, you just, just ignore all those people. That's what I like to do. Just get off social media. That's, I've made my life so much better. No social media, you're like, oh, no, I'm not going to know anything. Oh, wait, everything's legitimately fine. Oh, shit, I was getting fucking long. Can't see the sun anymore. We're in for a long old fucking night. Because we hit hour three. Anyway. Um, pause hard stream, because you can't really um, add anything. To yeah, it does a lot of talking for itself. A lot. I just wanted to chat the chat, you know? I'm fucking here because of you lot. And I thought, like, you know, a good way to celebrate the um, anniversary of the channel was just chat for this. And also, then I'd have to edit it down into a live highlights video. <laughs> a fox guy, hey down, I've never been to one of your streams before. Hello, welcome. So, say happy early birthday. I've been watching your channel since Omegalodon. Hope you've been doing well. Oh, I loved Omegalodon. We need to bring that back. Need to bring that back, because that was cool. People that complain shit's too woke don't realise woke things have existed forever. Star Trek was woke. Now they didn't bitch. Oh, yeah, there. Yeah. Just progression in it. Progression's scary for people. It's like, no! Have things the way they were. At some point, you know, I, 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 get, I understand a bit of that. You know, there's the thing that's like, most most kids are watching TikTok and not films anymore. And I'm like, well, films are better. But that's just what the young want to do. Let them do it. I don't give a shit. What would a highlight to do this be? I don't know. Um, but down here, also I seek out things that make me irrationally angry, but have a conversation with said person on a platform run by Nazi. Social media is fine! Yeah. Wait, you play the better looking desert bus, but not in VR? Yeah, this is something I only found out while trying to fix the actual original desert bus. Yeah, just playing on a controller. And I assume all my passengers are too. Ooh, I'm, nope. The person in the back isn't. But everybody else is. Are you doing the return trip as well? No, my voice is already starting to hurt, and I'm only three hours in, so... Everything's gonna be fine. Uh, imaginary mind with five... What's that? Fifty Donkey Kong Kongos! I don't know what the DKK stands for. Uh, good lord, here we go again! Would you play the original one, the VR one, three or four times? I've been here. Uh, oh my goodness. In about one year, I think. Uh, love you loads, you're very welcome. Oh, you've seen all of them, that's so... Yeah. all of these. I mean, I've never watched any of these. Um, Alex Fella! Two pounds! Up by there, Mr. Cube! Time for a bus oil change. Okay, let me just shake the bus oil out. There we go. Uh, and the Darth Nemesis from MDB, it looks like the original writers, are back for a new remake trilogy. Of Stargate. Wait. An original trilogy of... Wait, are they remaking the Stargate movie? Oh my god. Were you doing a Pokemon live stream for the new Pokemon card set that came out today? Yeah, if they turn up. I ordered them, but they seem to have vanished into fucking Royal Mail. So my plan is that next Friday stream is going to be um, Pokemon. And I bought two boxes this time! None of that Elite Trader box bullshit. We've got two full boxes. It's like 700 something cards. So that'll be fun. Anyway. Mm hmm. Dan, it's my mate's 51st today! Oh my goodness. Also, we're gonna have a good time. Happy birthday to you! Thank you very much. So, I um, apologize. Maybe we got the wrong there, 15. Yeah. They already made the Stargate movie. It's called Atlantis Lost Empire. Just because Daniel Jackson is in that film as well. Ah, such a beautiful sunset. I mean, the sun, I think, is set over there. I can't quite see. Has the sun set? Are you checking for me? Is it set? Yeah, okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Um, uh, you, would you still enjoy Power? I haven't really gone back to it. They don't get bored or anything. Just so many games are coming out. I'm just trying to keep on top of everything at the moment. But I did enjoy it. Wait, did this game get remastered? Yeah, and it's free! <laughs> Favorite GTA character from any GTA game? Uh, Candy sucks. No, uh, the 
Tommy Vassetti, it's gotta be Tommy Vassetti, right? Tommy Vassetti, it is a man! I think he's the only one where they were like, proper psycho before Trevor came along. Just like to hit things with other things. Sky in that face cam is brilliant. It's, not, it's a real mirror, I'm actually in this bus. How much to crash? A million pounds. Anybody mind if I crash for a million pounds? Oh look, the sun's setting! It's going up the side of the bus! There goes the daylight. Bye bye daylight. We'll see you maybe the other side. I don't know if this is a real time. Well, I don't know. I also don't know if lights ever come on and I might have to turn the lights on. I assume they'll come on my clear, it'll be fine. Um Yeah. What are you most excited for in GTA 6? I'm excited for them to not fuck it up. That would be really good if they didn't fuck it up. That would be really good. Please don't. Please don't fuck it up. Please. Only if you donate a child's play. Fuck them kids! My birthday! <laughs> They are gonna fuck you up. I don't know. I think a big open world to explore and have fun with. I'm like, yeah, cool. As long as microtransactions stay in the, you know, the multiplayer, which I don't want to touch this time around, you know. Sure. I think it'll be a fun game to, you know, explore. But like, I'll be interested to see what new things you can do with the open world game. Because like, everything you could do in Vice City, you can do in Five. So like. You know, where are they pushing it to? What are they going to give us? Interested to find out. Interested to find out. Is there any tumbleweed in this game? I don't know. I haven't seen any. But I haven't really been looking at the road, to be honest. You're going to make the nuclear uh, microphone mic and transactions? Yeah. 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 Ooh. Uh oh. Fresh yard. Fresh yard. Three hour mark. Oh. We're actually going to get to the end of this version of the game this time. Yes, we fucking are. Yes, we fucking are. Is anybody else seeing flashing lights? <laughs> Little sparkles every now and then, or is that just me? It's cool. It's all good. It's all fine. I'm just going to have a just quick. I'm just going to just have a quick time to sleep. Okay. And I'm awake! Okay, that's it. That's the naps we can get. Yeah, it's gonna be more realistic. Red Dead Redemption 2 was... Yay! That was the best bit of Red Dead Redemption... Uh, I didn't see no sparkling lights. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! Um, I need to eat something. What do I fancy? I've got crispies, got onion, onion rings, got popcorn. I don't think I can eat popcorn during a stream. I'm gonna shit my teeth. I'm gonna try it though. Is the popcorn flavoured? Oh, oh fuck! Oh, it's, it's um, it's stale as fuck. <laughs> it's really stale that popcorn. Oh, I'll, I'll cook it. No, keep it. I'll eat it. Um, that tastes like sugar puffs. Is that the sugar puff one? Yeah. Sugar puff popcorn. Are we gonna make some food? food? Like what? I don't know. What do you fancy? You? Oh. 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 Um, yeah, I could do with a little actual. Proper meal because if I eat any more sugar, I'm going to collapse. Are you hungry? Yeah. So thank you, best friends. There's only four people on my bus, and one of them is my caterer. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Lilith. Oh, big stretch. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> <gasps> Oh dear. Um. Wait, anyway, what the fuck we doing? I've totally zoned out. Fuck me. Energy, energy, energy. R repeat, repeat. <laughs> la 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 la. Whoa, we're having a really good time. <laughs> Sit up, focus. Mhm. Mm yeah, that'll do. Um. I don't know where I'm looking anymore. It's quite hard to work out when you're this zoomed in, like where I'm actually sitting. Not there. That'll do. Oh, actually, tilt it back that way a bit, because that's why I tend to lean. Um, 
There should be UFO Easter eggs. I mean, I wouldn't see them. <laughs> oh, so a Stargate video game came out last month or so. There's no Stargates in it. That's my forehead. There's no Stargates in it. There's no Stargates in the fucking Stargate game. It's fucking mental. Um, and Quites has resubscribed. I, Yoba I, has also subscribed. Uh, and Veggie Steak, I don't remember how many years I've been watching you, Dan. And I can't break for Oganda being a long time. But I'm grateful for your influence in my young life. Your love of video games and comedy sort of combined my love of mythology, like a social skills, to make me who I am today. Uh, genuinely funny NB who lives for storytelling. In other words, thanks to you and Rebecca uh, that I have ideas of who I am and what I want to do in life. Thank you. You're very welcome. I'm glad to have assisted with you, the witness. <laughs> Um, how are you feeling about the new Dragon Ball Budokai Tanaki? Oh, uh, Sparking Zero. Yeah, I'm fucking in. I, I watched that little gameplay thingy and I'm like, yep, 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 yep. Um. Oh, fuck. Jumbo Size One with 500 Twilly says, Happy Birthday! I first uh, found you through the original Overgrowth video. I loved your stuff ever since. P.S. Love the latest rebound. I think it's my favorite one. Yay! I like that people like the new rebound. I've tried very hard to make it the uh, thingy. Still by social screenshots of Stargate's in. Yeah, I, I don't think you actually ever like use them. <laughs> it's very weird. Oh, it's just doing full headshots now. Um, uh, <laughs> well, I'm fucking going to sit back down again. Good, this is a perfect shot. It's really funny how the first of uh, the announcement for that game was saying there's like 20 Gokus and 20 Vegetas. Oh my god, it was just Gokus and Vegetas. And that's what we want. That's what we want from a fighting game. Of the Goku and Vegeta fighting game. You know? Um, great stream complete idea. Uh, Rodina, every asteroid, every collectible. That sounds like a lot of work. Akia draw cam. There's always Akia draws. Uh, any upcoming meet and greets? No. Oh yeah, they're, they're on that side. Read that sign. That's where they are. Um, have you listened to any of Robbie Williams' dance music he's doing? I haven't listened to Robbie Williams' music for a while. But yeah. Uh, Warrior Cat V2! Hi Dan, happy birthday! Hope you had a better day than mine. My cat managed to cut his tongue chewing grass, the goblin. Okay, that's cat. Oh wait, hang on. Warrior Cat V2? Was it you? Did you did you do that? <laughs> Where you say, my, hang on, wait, my cat. <laughs> was it you? I think it was you. I think it was you. <laughs> Thank you for 20 pounds as well. So, weird thing. Some come through as 20 pounds, some come through as like 1999. Where is that 1999 coming from? I just genuinely don't understand. It's very weird. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, that's that good shit. As that Robinson's crushed mint thing. Ah, oh. how you gonna piss again if you need to? Let's just doing this. <laughs> anyway, um, uh, how about that? Down, I love you. Thank you. And your yearly Xmas collabs with Ashens. Ah, oh, Advent. This is my favorite time of year where I don't have to think about any of these. What do you think about Moffat's return about Doctor Who? Uh, I think the phrase is Return of the King. Uh, so I am, um, yeah, no, I'm into that. I always love that. Always love a bit of Moffat. Have you intentionally listened to any music that isn't Super Tramp in 2024? Music from 2024? No. Uh, no, not really. I haven't been listening to huge music at the moment. Yeah. Holy shit, dude, he's playing Desert Bus. It's Christopher Z Zuniga. Zuniga. Zuniga, that's your name. Holy shit, dude. Yeah, I'm playing Desert Bus. Gotta love it with the Desert Bus. Muppet Best Doctor Who writer? Yeah. Didn't you dislike Muppet back in the day? No. Definitely fucking not. I met the guy. <laughs> I've been to his house. Uh, oh my god, Dan is still playing this game. Hey, best friend. Yeah, I'm three hours, 13 minutes in. Did you see the world's first Dragon Ball theme park is opening? Rebecca! Yeah? We have to go. Okay. We have to go. You want to go to a theme park? 
I want to go to a fucking Dragon Ball. This is Dragon Ball theme park. What does it look like? Wait, you're at his house? Yeah, I went. To, I went to Stephen Moffat's house. I was invited to his house. That interview is in his house. You got spooked by a weeping angel in this garden. I looked into a garden. And there was a weeping angel there. You try to unscoop spook me. That old Moffat interview is amazingly awkward. Yes, Moffat's was the reason I did writing and stuff. It's very, very, yep. Yeah. I tried. Bless. I tried. Little me is struggling in that interview. Who wrote the episode midnight? Russell T. Davis, the person who's currently writing it. You should have your giant Daleks. It's not giant, it's just normal size. Or your Daleks are small. Ow. <laughs> hey, Abby Spooks, how's things? Well, sunset. We are three hours, 14 minutes in. And I'm tired. <laughs> I didn't manage to get a full night's sleep last night, so... Uh, um, Windows the 95 fan, 2017, with 10 dollaroos! Happy birthday, Dan! Thank you very much. Everyone's so generous today. It's nice. Um, I've watched your videos for 10 years now, and you're one of my favorite YouTubers. Thank you for making my day every time you upload. You're very welcome. Very, very welcome. Um, I thought you didn't like the Capaldi era. I didn't, but that's because when Capaldi era came out, I was, uh, I needed Doctor Who to be very happy and bouncy, and it wasn't. And I was like, I just need some fun with my television, please. So I kind of avoided Capaldi. I think he did a good job. I think it was a very good thing. There's some great episodes in there. They won for me when I, when it aired. Fantastic Hats had used to be obsessed with the OG Desert Bus playthrough at 13. Would watch it start to finish and start it over again. I hope everything in that is good. No oh dear. Hyperspace 1006. Says something that I think is genuinely sickening. Best episode of Doctor Who is Voyage of the Damned. Change my mind. I will allow that on one condition. Look around your room. And if every surface is covered in pictures of Kylie Minogue, then yes, I will believe that you believe that. But, yeah. Otherwise, no. Yeah, I never liked Clara. Clara just really, I just didn't... Yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah, Clara didn't... didn't I didn't go with Clara. That's okay. That's okay. You know, she's not coming back. She's definitely dead. Um, the <laughs> bird or something. Get out of that. Bill, Grant, and Clara. Correct. Absolutely perfect opinion. If I had to rank the companions, Clara would definitely be at the bottom. Because um, it was just awful to watch. <laughs> Kylie Minogue, why are you bringing up the Queen of Australia? Because Kylie Minogue is in an episode of Doctor Who. She's a huge fan. Only three of my four walls are covering Kylie Minogue. She's short though, that's the thing. You don't get a lot of space. You get a lot more poses you need. Is Chibnall Zero worse than the final few years of Classic Who? Chibnall's Doctor Who was worse than anything I've ever seen on television, so... Still Clara over Yaz? Oh yeah, no, I totally forgot that Yaz and... and uh, the other one... <laughs> the other that metal basketball about four miles. Those two are underneath Clara. That's my, that's my, yeah. Uh, Kieran Tindall, don't know what to say, so, this gay kiss! We should do a this gay kiss art print for the Patreons. Spoiler warning, it's coming soon. Ryan, that was his name. Yeah, Ryan. Jesus, nothing, nothing remembered. Um, don't make short jokes when you have a Rebecca wife. I can make short jokes. Might not survive them, but I can make them. Just realised Watch Dogs turns 10 this year. Yay, let's have a Watch Dogs 4. It's not going to happen. Also, for Ubisoft. Ugh. Never touching the Chibnall era again. I just can't. I don't think I've rewatched like, any of it. I watched a two and a half hour video on why Chibnall's era is good. I don't need to do that for any other era. <laughs> That's how you know it's good. Because you watch it and you enjoy it. You don't have to go, it's actually very clever. And here's the reasons why. You go, oh, actually it is good. <laughs> Hyperspace One, you're right. I'm obsessed with Kylie. I fucking knew it. <laughs> uh, 
Ah, yeah. Fucking knew it. Um, remember when John Bishop was companion? Yeah. Yeah. Hey, shooty Gatwa, we got shooty Gatwa. We've got Millie Gibson. This era is fucking great. We've only had one episode and it's fucking great. We're only, what, two months away? From New Who? Two months from New Who? Eight lovely episodes across seven lovely weeks. Anyway. The last Watchdogs was such a waste of money since Red Star. It's my favourite one. I love, love Watchdogs 2. Watchdogs 1. Eh, I don't give a fuck about Watch Dogs 2, I fucking love. Watch Dogs 3, I prefer. Legion was just so good. For just, it's something I've always wanted, which was to just have that. Hire anybody and build your own team and not have a central character. I felt like single player AAA games are so focused on the story that actually letting us tell our own stories. Like, you do have to lean into the roleplay. Um, that's important. And like, you know, have, giving those characters different things that you'll think they'd be good at. And yeah, you need it on hardcore mode, because I love the idea that you can just fail a AAA game. But that final mission with Enid... The health, like, is that... Amazing. That mission is one of the most tense moments in video gaming, because it meant something. It actually meant something to me, because this is a character that only existed in my playthrough. You know? That was it. It was good stuff. <laughs> Unless you've been able to go through Watch Dogs Legion with an, old, uh, with an old affable British band really makes it for me. Yeah. It's such a delightful fucking game. Did you say earlier you struggled in role-playing in D&D? Yeah, not that kind of role-playing. I meant like setting characters up and being like, oh, this character does this thing and this thing and this thing. Like, you know, in the Fallout 4 series. Yeah. Hi Dan, I've just uh, walked to my closest shop back and I wish I was dead. Is it CFS or can't? Oh my god. I wish I was as live, yes. Also, it's my birthday on Sunday! Happy birthday! I'm older than you. Which Doctor speech is your favourite and why is it the Rings of Akatan? I love the Rings of Akatan speech. You take it! You take it all! But come on now, like the era defining speech from Matt Smith? Stonehenge. Stonehenge is pretty fucking good. Um, if you don't like Legion, they tried some new ideas. Yeah, it definitely was, it felt experimental. But like that, getting to that final thing with Enid and just legit, like, right, here's how good that game is, okay? Here's how good that fucking game is. My save file for Watch Dogs Legion exists on a memory stick. I copied it off and I saved it because I didn't want to lose those characters. Because they were important to me. And losing them, remember Anne? Remember losing Anne? It fucking sucked. It felt like something... Yeah. <laughs> it's a good game. It's a good game. If you just want to go in and ah, shoot things, yeah, no. But if you want to actually dig into what the game actually is, I legitimately think mechanically it's one of the best. I mean, they, I've done it a few times and it's like legitimately brilliant. Ah, I should really replay the fucking game. Absolutely loved it. I want some good mods for it. The only mods I've got kind of just unlock all the DLC and stuff. <laughs> RPM. Yeah, the, the ability to lose a character not from a story way, but just because you just fucked up. It's brutal. Games don't get that. Taking those elements from a, like a roguelite and putting them in a big AAA open world game. That's brilliant. Shaman crashes a lot on the Steam Deck. Oh my god, I had no problems with it on the Steam Deck. Apart from the fact it made so much noise. Ah, no, I was running it modded. I definitely modded it on the Steam Deck. Um, and I added some patches and things that made it work a lot better. Yeah. I played I played through it on the Steam Deck as well. Um, someone's probably already made the show. This is the best use of tw uh, Twitch Meta I've seen. Hello, what's Twitch Meta? <laughs> Am I supposed to be, be playing something... To certain things. Am I supposed to be doing certain things? Oh my goodness. What's Twitch matter? I don't know. Uh, Jessimo! Hey Dan, thought I'd let you know. He's getting the hell out of me for a split second with a stream title since it's my birthday today. Yeah, we're celebrating your birthday, Jess. Get in here. Come on. Uh, happy birthday for someone who's been watching since Crashtastic. And speaking of Crashtastic, let's keep going. Let's keep going. 
Um, <laughs> fine, I'm convinced. I'll have to rewatch the Legion playthrough. Or you can just play the game. You know? Remember, Chapman, did you keep one of the DLC characters you were going to kill? Yeah, because Chak started to get attention to what's her face. I don't, does she have a name? Ah, uh, shit, I don't remember. <laughs> With the ears, she had the ears and the, the, the hair and the glasses. Oh fuck. What was her name? Cause she said she wasn't the character that we found, she's one of the DLC characters. Harriet Chat remembers. <laughs> Isn't that good though? You see that's that's what that game did, unlike any others. Any other big triple A fucking open world games. None of them fucking let you remember characters like that. Twitch forever responding to chat uh, watching other people's YouTube videos. Oh, okay. What, on my phone? Okay, let's do that. I'm going to watch a YouTube video on my phone. While I... Uh, uh, oh, I've actually got an email from my band. Alright, okay, cool. So that's actually moving. Good. All right, what's in my subscription things? Yeah, books moving. Uh, ooh, LGR. Ooh, restoring a 1997 Gateway PC, Windows 95, Pentium 2 desktop. Woohoo! Got a Rahulis to purr, quite a lot of uh, AEW Dynamite. John's been playing Balatro. He'd probably play it wrong. He'd call it Babla Blow or something. Uh, Stephen Lawson. Ooh, very nice. A bit of Cracker Milk. Love a bit of Cracker Milk. Bigger preview of a upcoming hot toy. Yeah, it's good. I'm enjoying this. The second win is it weird? We're finally we're already talking about PlayStation Five Pro. Yes, it fucking is. Uh, <laughs> best of the worst. Oh shit! There's a new best of the worst that I haven't watched yet. Wheel of the worst. Okay, well, there you go. That was good. Hope you all enjoyed that. Ah <laughs> uh, dear. Twitch bearer is hiding your body just enough to imply potential like a clothes. I mean, I'm wearing so little clothes. Does it actually matter? Is the podcast coming back? I've tried to get a hold of John. I've even been on his fucking streams. But John is so busy with shit. It's, it's just like a real person. Ugh. Ugh, real people and their things. Um... What else? What else we do? Uh, and he actually, with 1,500 trillions, goodness gracious, thank you very much. Uh, happy birthday, you glorious bastard! That's me. Uh, I can't stay, because it's almost daylight. It's just coming night. Uh, and I should have been in bed six hours ago. I look forward to the VOD. I hope the road is straighter than you. <laughs> Nothing straighter than me. And be wife. Uh, Vegetech says, okay, I'm playing Chance of Sonar demo and I already love it. <laughs> you told you! Oh dear. And uh, Ibsomzio gives you two T1 subs. Oh yes. Oh yes. Do you remember what a zoom cage is? I actually been crash tastic because people are talking about that. I built a cage that went fast. Maybe besieged. Yeah. They shouldn't make pro consoles. They should just keep working on the tech for longer before releasing a slightly better version. Yeah, I got no interest in a PS4, a PS5 Pro. No interest, I'm afraid, so I have not really got much interest in a PS6 at the moment, because the PS5 kind of... I love it. I think it's a beautiful system. Need some fucking games. Need some fucking games. When was this remastered? Many years ago. Do you mean John and Matt have me up in person? We've met up once. It was awkward. <laughs> Dad, what did you think about the Oscars? I didn't watch them. Did Barbie win? Because <laughs> if Barbie didn't win, I don't care. Oh, no, no. We need a new Naughty Dog game yesterday. No, we don't. We need a new Double Fine game. Mm -mm -mm. Tiger Lily's birthday! Happy birthday, Tiger Lily. It's crazy how they made the PS5 with no intention to make games for it. <laughs> we need a new Jack and Dexter game. Oh, yeah. I'd be there for that. I'd be there for that. We need a new Bithel game. Pretty sure Bithel's working on something. You know? The PS5 is five years old? No, it's three? Three and a half? I don't think it's much more than that. 
Bobby didn't win anything, huh? Great. Fucking great! Um, you need a new Sly Cooper. I didn't like the old Sly Coopers. It's one of those franchises I've never really given a shit about. Hang on. Uh, I need to get a new drink. Uh, uh, meh. Meh. Is Mike still working at Disney? You can Google what Mike's up to. You can Google what Mike's up to. Oh, yeah, we're in. Oh, life is good again. Get my voice going. Ludicrously big IP will Biff will get next. You can Google it. Um, <laughs> uh, new Counter Prime, yep. Mm -hmm. The PS5 came out in 2019. Yeah, so three and a half years. It was the end of 2019. Still feels like it only came out last year. Yeah, that's the fucking problem, isn't it? It's probably because you couldn't get a hold of one for fucking ages. Yeah, I think it's a beautiful console. I just, I just, um, I just think that the more they go on, the less I give a fuck about AAA games. I must admit, it's twenty twenty four, Dan. It's what? Wait, ah, oh, fuck! <laughs> no, 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 no. Shut up. Cover years don't count, correct? Where are you getting 2019 from? It came out in November 2020. Yay, see? Oh. Oh no, my trick worked! It started to accelerate! Oh no! I stopped accelerating, I heard it go. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Wedged it back in. I can see that being physically exhausted from desert busing. I love it. It's, it gets a bit tiring. Yeah, 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 yeah. We can cry if Cody doesn't win the belt. I'll kick my fucking tail again if Cody doesn't win the belt, I'll tell you that. How disappointed were you in the su oh, the suicide, the suicide Squad game? Uh, I wasn't disappointed at all because I expected it to be an absolute load of shit and it was an absolute load of shit so if anything I was completely satisfied. <laughs> How about that again? you? Do you want to play The Outer Wild? So thank you. You're very welcome. All ears. You know Don't Evil do it to you. Oh, don't. Don't do it again. Don't do it again. Please. Uh, you warned me I should get my puppy used to me pulling my fingers in the mouth, and then, as if you were a prophet, uh, she tried to eat a piece of plastic I had to pull out of her throat, says Farmer Beige. You see? Learning. Learning. Who gets hyped for AAA games anymore? I don't know. Are there any AAA games coming out? I mean, Elden Ring DLC is going to fucking rock. But, like, what's the next? Triple A game that's coming out that anyone gives a fuck about. Anyone? A a anyone? I watched the iPatch full fit on Roman Reigns. I have because it kind of explained to me the era that I missed because I didn't like Roman Reigns and then there was the era I missed where everyone started liking Roman Reigns and then it's now and I still don't like Roman Reigns. Uh, GTA 6? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, not really, is it? <laughs> I'm kind of like, eh. yeah. Final Fantasy Rebirth, that's already out. And Wolverine Games for it could be okay, yeah. But like, you know, there was that trailer for a Marvel game, Captain American Black Panther. Is anyone hyped for that? I don't know what kind of game it is. I don't. For me, I just like here's a game you not heard of. It came out a month ago, and it's fucking great. Does Death Stranding 2 count? Because I'm excited for that. Yeah! Dragon's Dog Maku 2 came out today. Yeah, but the microtransactions have put me well the fuck off. There's quite a games like Skull and Bones. Lol, 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 Indiana Jones game? I don't like I never looked at Indiana Jones either. Um, damn, this game makes you drift way more than the first one. I think it's about the same. I think when steering it gives you a bit more, but yeah. The next Pokemon game, Legend Z to A, is coming 2025. It is. Uh, Second World Trade! Ted, I've been watching since the original Universe Starbucks video. Look, Deficit, thanks for being a constant presence in my life. Happy birthday. You're welcome. As I hit the four hour streaming mark, even though we're only three hours 30 into the drive. New Stardew Valley update was this week. Oh, yeah, no, I heard, I, I heard the um, concern date put out another patch note to the size and length of the fucking Bible. Uh, 
Yeah. Yeah. World of Q2? Yeah, I think it's like exclusive to Switch or something to start, but... Yeah. Nothing really big. AAA seems to have stopped. It seems to have hit this big clunk of a stall sort of thing. Oh well. Um, drinking mayo? <laughs> oh, is that what you can do in the Stardew Valley? <laughs> Uh, what's your best memory from being born? All that light and shit, that was good, wasn't it? <laughs> I should probably go back to Star Trek play it for, since it, I think I played it when it first came out. Um, Dan, have you heard of the Will Smith game that came out? There's a Will Smith game? Almost no one heard of it until IGN did an article about it being a flop. Oh, that must be a real slap in the face for Will Smith. <laughs> Skull and Bones is fucking baffling. How have they make a worse version of a game that are inspired by? Uh, because it is the industry chasing these trends, which leads you to a Suicide Squad game made by Rocksteady that's a live service game and not a good Rocksteady game. Have you played Hypnospace Outlaw? That's one. That's the one where you have like the computer and you go online and do all that sort of shit. Yeah. Uh. Um, I'm sorry, my fucking. I literally. I hit. It's always, isn't it? It's always. I hit the four hour mark and I start to fucking drop off a bit for a little while. That's okay. I just rest up. That's <laughs> <laughs> something we've got the slap joke. Um, <laughs> there's the quad I choke. Oh dear. Thoughts on Twin I've never seen it. I've seen some of um, thingy stuff. Lynch. I've never seen... Well, I've seen a bit of Twin Peaks when I huge mouth. But it's but it's beyond me. It's beyond me. Um, Brandon Mooney with $5 ruse. Happy birthday from Birmingham, Alabama. Yeehaw. Finally catching a stream live. I've watched you since Minecraft. Thanks for making this awful week better. You are very welcome. Here's to Birmingham, Alabama. What else? Uh, Birmingham, Alabama is a place that rings a bell what happened in Birmingham Alabama that I know of what's in Birmingham Alabama I know something need to add a random bend in the road to keep going straight I've always said that at some random point a car should just come the other side probably not good things yeah relate to Destin ah is Destin from Smart Every Day around there that might be where I've got it in my head Cough, <laughs> not good things. I mean, yeah, there's definitely. I meant like you know, in a more pop culturey sort of way. Um, not a Martin Luther King kind of way. Rosa Parks was that? In, was that Bobby Alabama? Yeah, they did a lot of civil rights stuff down there. Yeah, where'd say he's destined from down there? Mm. Dan, what's the chance of us getting an Oki play Subnautica? Uh, well, I beat Subnautica, so quite low. I beat it on the Switch. Destin is from Huntsville, Alabama. I must just have it from somewhere or something. Uh, Lissam Squatch! Gonna try and write a paragraph, because uh, you know you hear this a lot, but I've been watching since the How Don't Suck Minecraft days. Uh, now, my ADHD diagnosis came out as by an NB. I truly think I truly figured out how I am in the world. Thank you, Dan, Rebecca, and Matt for being there through a lot. And happy birthday. Thank you so much. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> I forget, if you crash, you get towed instantly. Into the track door. Wait. Yeah, no, I think it's a pretty immediate. Dan, was that House Flipper series? You promised. Um, someone on, I think it was Patreon, Rebecca pointed out a comment that I'm going to do. Someone said that I should do a challenge video where I attempt to make Croft Manor from memory. And I thought, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> that's exactly what I'm going to do. So I would try and make crop matter from memory. But yeah. Can't believe I've been watching this channel since you have uh, been drinking soup from a mug and talking about news. Ah, uh, no cube soup or soup with no cube, whatever the fuck it was. Oh, yeah. I mean, there's also a bug in England. Yes, I'm aware there's a bug. Bug! We got a bug! <laughs> I 
We got the bug! Oh my god, it happened! Oh my god! Oh, amazing! Amazing! <laughs> Wait, how many achievements are in this game? I just got an achievement then. Uh, drug down to Badoko with five pounds. About to hop on uh, Call of the Angler. I hope you have an amazing birthday once you use to Frank the Zombie. Oh, those are some good fucking times. Something new to stare at for hours. Yay! Everybody at the back of the bus, how are we feeling? Cool! <laughs> There's like 50 achievements. Can somebody read out what all the achievements are to me, please? Thank you. I'd like to know what all the achievements are. You turn the virtual wipers on? I don't think so. I'm afraid to push buttons in case it kicks me out. Bug's name is fucking dead. Never got to the bug in the podcast one. We went for more than four hours, though. It's just random. Should you turn the lights on? I think there are lights on. Like, weak little lights. I don't want to wipe it away. One of the achievements is to crash as fast as possible. Well, that's a bit late. 15 hidden achievements. Well, look them up. Come on. You can find them on the internet. The book was at the end in your original playthrough. Yeah, that sounds about right. Oh, there's a speedrun achievement where if you slow down tall, you miss it. Well, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to do okay. What how you get 15 achievements out of the world's simplest game? I don't know. Keep the bug. We'll keep the bug for now. We need to name the bug. It's a fucking big bastard as well. I'm kind of glad that we're in a, <laughs> our inside. Oh, dear. There's a better achievement for failing at 7 hours and 59 minutes. I mean, maybe. There's an achievement for spending more time driving than it took to program the game, which is 500 hours. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> That's a fucking prehistoric dragonfly, Christ. There's an achievement called 120 hours well spent. We have to play for five whole fucking days. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Oh dear. Oh no. Wait, start the bus. Oh, I would have probably would have got that one. Drive one mile, drive ten miles, drive to Las Vegas, drive back to Tucson, 120 hours, 240 hours, kill a bug, crash and get towed, spend more time than it took to program the game. Jesus. Hey y'all, fun fact, Lego Movie's now 10 years old. That's not a fun fact, fuck you. Go back, take that information out of my head. Here's a fun fact, shut up! <laughs> um, okay, so... Oh, oh fuck. Sorry, bud. Good thing I put the air conditioner, the air freshener there so we don't have to smell bug. What's your earliest gaming memory? Um... I remember Sonic. Definitely remember getting Sonic very near release. Um, but I also remember Horace Goes Skiing. Playing that on an old Amiga somewhere. Christ knows where. But, um... Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, hang on, sorry. I literally am reading an email that's for work. Uh, 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 uh. 8th or 9th of April. Sounds like I'm going to get uh, my next version of the book back. Cool. Everything's moving. Everything's good. Do you ever play Pen and Tell's VR game? The fuck do you think I'm playing right now? <laughs> uh, here's a not fun fact. Portal is 17 years old. Yeah, but Portal 2 is as old as my channel. It's not that old, is it? It's not that old at all. Zubini's be my list memory for games. Ah, oh. Zubini's. That's a great game. I remember playing that in school. 
<laughs> I left you talking about Sonic. I came back you talking about Sonic. Yeah, so the last three hours, 44 minutes, uh, slowly drifting off and talking about Sonic. Um, hang on, I need to do something. Oh, no. Damn, damn, damn. Um, cock. I was going to do something. <laughs> what I was going to do is I was going to turn the brightness down on the camera so it sort of matched the surroundings a little bit. Maybe I'll just um, turn the lights off around me or something at some point. So it just gets a little dark, just a little darker. Just a little, hang on, wait, wait, I can do it, I can do something from here. Oh, oh God, Red Low Midi started playing. Let's just turn these lights off. <laughs> okay, just a little, just a little bit off, just a little bit. Just getting chill, just getting chill with it. No, I'm never finishing Zubitz because I think after the second difficulty, it's just inside. It's on Steam if you want to have a uh, go at it again. <laughs> so I'm saying there's no new edutainment game like Zubinis. I know, right? I fucking love Zubinis. That was the good shit. Like I said, Alex Brooks has resubscribed. I don't think I did. And now I have. Bunniest Bun has resubscribed. And Zuara Twitch. Twitch character limit is angry. So here's the footnotes version of my thoughts. Thanks for everything these last 13 years. You mannerism have bled into my own. Uh, your follow series is how I found my name. Goodness. I uh, made your video, uh, you had some South Sweets from a family sweet shop. <laughs> oh, yeah, with, with Lauren, my cousin. God, I feel old. Above all my uh, fellow queer ADHD. CFS procrastinators. Mwah! Smooches for you all. Um, I need to turn the light back on because that's making me fall asleep without having the very blinding multicolored lights blasting me in my face. That's <laughs> good. Roughly gonna fall asleep. Um, hey Dan, the Dutch trailer isn't apparently showing up in the UK yet, but it is in New Zealand. It looks absolutely incredible. What? That's my fucking trailer. Give me the fucking trailer, bitch. Where's my Doctor Who trailer? Don't one Doctor Who trailer, please. One Doctor Who. Shut up. Doctor Who. Doctor Who trailer. I want to see it. I want to see it. I don't see it. It's not that. Ah, there. Is that sweet shop closed or is it open up? I don't know. I haven't been, I've been anywhere near fucking shipment for a long time. I'm lying. <laughs> oh, dear. There's a, um, don't text a drive. I can text a drive all I fucking want. Look, ready? Look, looking at, looking at chat. Yeah, looking at the screen. Everything's fine. Looking at this. Looking back at the thing. Look, that didn't move a muscle. It's fine. Jesus. I can shoot, shoot, shoot. Gifted ten subs to me and you. I can shoot, shoot, shoot. Gifted them to Peter the Great. Really, Wolf Wolfies, Andrew G. Epic, Omaluck, Typhig, uh, Drew the Pumpkin, Victim to Gaming. Fellow Toe Rail 80, if you had a little knock on a connector down, thank you very much. I can shoot, shoot, shoot. Let's do squiggles, do do do. There's a bug just there, and I'm squiggling up and stuff. Thank you very much. Oh, that's that. There's a hype train going on. Hype! Hype, 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 hype. How are we all doing in the bus? I think everybody's dead on the bus. Everybody's dead on the bus. Uh uh. We missed the bus, please. No. Uh, yep, four hour mark, Dan starts to go insane. We're not at the four hour mark yet. I haven't even begun to go insane. I'm very tired. Woo have you seen that cactus before? Yeah, I might be going around in a circle. Mm. Prove it's on a hundred twiddlies. Thank you very much. You're so lovely. Uh, Siren has subscribed. All this money, all of it is going on a treadwall. Just saying. <laughs> Watching you since you stuck your head in a bin. <laughs> Don't worry, you have an age today. I will say that haircut machine makes an appearance in one of the upcoming Patreon prints. Which I think I have here. I do! It could give you a very. Hang on, wait, I'll do a sneaky little peek here. Oh, uh, 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 that's a rainbow. Oh, 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 yeah, oh. Ta da! <laughs> Upcoming! Actually, those ones are uh, out. They've been packaged and everything. They should be getting shipped out soon. 
Um, I just looked up and says that my local gym has a treadmill. Try to want to go, want to go try it now. Oh my god, short bag eleven. Go now. Uh, you've got four hours to get back and let us know how fun it is. <laughs> Rebecca drove straight into this. Rebecca is a driver. So, yeah. Oh, dear. You wish it does the video. It's fun to go back to every now and then. You got bananas in that video. I do, probably. I need to quite... Give me, give me a question with a meat on it. Give me a question with some meat on it. Let's do some proper chatting. Let's go deep. We can do next print shot video. Oh, yeah, probably need to record those. The print should be going out. Matt was unwell, but we've got, like, three months worth of prints packaged. We've got... The next month's worth of prints ready to go. So we're like. Does Rebecca still got you more driving? Absolutely. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, heads up everyone. There's a full trailer breakdown from People Magazine in America starting to spread on Twitter. Uh, they must have got that early. How much you get the original end song back? Hashtag Treadwall. So there's Tip Tops on the YouTubes. The original end song is in the last video I uploaded, right? Yeah, in the Outcast video. It makes an appearance in the Outcast video. <laughs> Rollercast Tycoon, the very first one, is 25 years old today! I actually have a magazine. Which might be there. Um, which has like an original sort of like review of Rollercaster Tycoon. Because it's old. Would you rather have eyes where your nipples are, or nipples where your eyes are? Wait, I get... Would I rather have four sets of eyes and four sets of nipples? Give me the fucking nipples. I mean, eyes. Uh, give me the eyes. JJ Wild has resubscribed. Says, Happy birthday! Thank you. Um, are you planning to continue utilizing all your learning in therapy to continue to be better yourself? Or do you think you will grow complacent with being better? I think you've always got to keep being better, Mr. Villain. I think I always need to work on uh, improving myself. I think when you stop wanting to improve yourself, that's when you. Uh, stop growing and when you stop growing you just go bleh in fact make your own treadmill by resting a treadmill vertically against the wall that's a fucking genius that's fucking genius that's my first answer sorry take his eyes no I have to do this it's too hot for twitch <laughs> um quad nips ooh yeah 100% I don't know what that means uh, Casey E28 has resubscribed. Hi oh, you can hype train over to a level four hype train. Hey, train. So please tell me what a fucking treadmill is. Uh, well, you know a treadmill where you um do that sort of thing. Well, it, it's a climbing one. It's a it's a cl spinny climbing wall wheel thing. If you had to survive 24 hours in any fictional universe, which one would you choose? The universe from Love Actually. It's just this universe, isn't it? But like a little bit more magic. A little, a little bit more fucked up, let's be perfectly honest. <laughs> it's climbing on a wall, but a treadmill. Yeah, basically. So it trains you to walk up walls. Yeah. Why not? What recent film have you not understood the hype for? Uh, recent films have there been? I watched Knives Out and Glass Onion. I liked uh, Knives Out. Glass Onion was a bit more of a... This felt, it was just basically just exposition for two and a half hours. Can we sell for McDonald's? We will. There's one in Vegas. There's none until then. What's the least favorite video you've ever made? Like the process of making it. Uh, oh, that's a good question. Process of making it, like the worst to make. I really, really, really hate videos where I have to set a camera up. <laughs> if I have to do that, I really get, I'm like, oh, fuck this, man. I hate that shit. Yeah, I really didn't like the other videos. If I had to do, like, oh, I have to set a camera up in loads of direct, like the sketches we used to do. They were fun to film, but I just don't like the actual process of filming. Video 100 with the Minecraft Maker Adventure. I love doing that one, because it took ages and it was fun. You know. Would you rather give birth or be born? I've already been born, so I'll take that one. Just keep going, innit? Hey, everybody. Yeah, everyone's dead at the back there. It's fine. 
down also on the road there. Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> getting tired. Uh, did you watch Poker Face? What, the Lady Gaga music video? Of course! P -p -p Poker Face. My name is Lady Gaga. Can't something doobly do do doobly dooby Poker Face. Uh, does this bus have a bathroom? Nope. I hope Rebecca gets back soon because I need a bathroom. <laughs> Last time you crashed about now. Yeah, so we could do four hours back. Okay, I crashed at the four hour mark, right? It's the sign. I don't need the sign. Um, what's the longest you've ever driven in a video game? I don't know. Uh, if you consider flying driving, it would be Flight Simulator. Because <laughs> that was a long time. Any hey, crash you want to collab with you've never collaborated with? Yeah, no rolls barred. Hit me up. I want to play. I want to play Monopoly but communist or something equally Monopoly horrific with you. That'd be great fun. Just sitting there going, oh god, why is Dom being scary and weird? Victorian child labour Monopoly. <laughs> In fact, the lyrics for the chorus of that song feature the words for fuck fuck her face. Because Gaga knew nobody would check. <clears throat> Not so. One of the sets of lyrics in the for Poker Face does include the for Fuck Her Face. And one place, like one little radio station, did actually bleep it. So one person's. Um, yeah, so there we go. Poker Face is Rian Johnson TV show, Murder Mystery, came in 2023. Oh, with Lady Gaga in it, okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, I won't do that. That sounds fun. Um, yeah, I don't know. That's it, really. I just want to go and play some board games. <laughs> play board games with... With Stalin. <laughs> what no cube related neurons barred Monopoly but blank B. I would li I like it to be something I know nothing about because I think that's more fun. Monopoly, but animals! <laughs> it's just, you're a lion, you maul any smaller animals that come past. You know, I want it to be stupid and silly. But historical, because that's kind of Dom's thing. And I didn't, I would enjoy that. Uh, if you could be first officer on any Star Trek ship, what would it be and why, says Timeless Spectre? First officer? I mean, the Titan? We wouldn't have to do shit! The Racket would do it all! <laughs> I mean, that's the... Yeah, you're tiny. You just put your feet up, really. It'd be lovely to do. Absolutely stunning. <laughs> uh, what's your favorite federation? Starts your... Uh, why? It's time to Spectre. Okay. Uh, well. It's this. It, uh, just getting the model down. Uh, and it fits perfectly in the view that we currently have. Uh, it's the NX-01 Refit. I think that is the most beautiful ship. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, it's so beautiful and pretty. Look at it. And now I will attempt to put this back. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Keep driving. Keep driving. Keep driving, you fool. Oh, God, I'm fat. There we go. Yeah. Biggest animal you can take in a fight. <sighs> Like if, uh, I could probably like punt a small deer in their head. They're quite fragile. Not like a fully grown one though, with antlers and shit. Nah. Nice double chin down. Excuse me. There's like eight chins there. <laughs> uh, Alex Brooks with 180 Lee. Happy birthday, Dan! Thanks for entertaining me. Fuck knows how long. Whoop, two daisies. Um, I have no idea what my first video was, but I do distinctly remember your Sims 3 video. Uh, and your many shitty German simulators. Your videos and streams have always been a constant in my life. And so I started being chronically online, and in many ways, you helped me get through a lot of shit. So thank you. Also, please turn up the echo, Mr. Bus Driver. It's getting stuffy in here. Well, the fan doesn't work. I tried. There's no button for it. Also, yeah. If you have the facial hair of any fictional character, who would it be? Uh, Tony Stark, but on my pubes. Uh, Pyro, be any to subscribe. 
It would just be really funny. Does your dick look like Tony Stark? Yeah, a bit, yeah. <laughs> uh, Carl Sagan's Empire with 500 twiddlies. Thank you very much, my goodness. You lovely people. Oh, uh, dear. Daniel, I'm eating. Okay. Well, you're saying say you uh, don't want to have to tap. Just don't tap this. Don't, don't, don't tap anything. Don't do anything. Look at them. They're not doing anything. Perfect passengers. They've all sat down randomly. Uh, halfway there. Not yet. I just got Midnight on Mars. Midnight on Mars. Mars after midnight. Yeah. You got me to look at Pope. It's like sorry, reason I brought the play date. A uh, play date is a beautiful thing. Play date. Play date. Oh fuck. Come on, where's the four hour mark? Four hours, four hours, four hours, four hours. Come on, nearly halfway point. Nearly halfway there. God, I really need to piss again. Fire! <laughs> Excuse me, I go shave my pubes. So, we've, yeah, in two minutes we'll be at the halfway point. Oh, God. <sighs> M2 the second 777, seven, don't know if you remember. I asked what you do about feeling guilty because I passed out, fell, hurt myself. I remember! It'd be better now that I take care of things and we'll find out what the heck happened in the first place. Good! I'm glad you're getting sorted out. I do remember that because I remember I made a joke in the house of viewer that you vomited on the ceiling. <laughs> uh, oh dear. Uh, <laughs> Funk, Mary Kill, Jeff the Shark, Kenneth Kennison, and Pensive Man. Uh. I'd kill Kenneth Kennethson. That would make the world a better place. I fuck Jeff the shark, because, you know, he can fly. But I would marry... Pensive Man. I would. So pensive. What are you thinking? Um... <laughs> Best joke in a shitty movie, in the Simpsons movie, where the guy throws the binoculars and they hit the dome and just go back into his face. It's so good. Uh, anyway. You have to recite one game script from memory at gunpoint. Which game is it? Tetris. Because here's the script. Tetris. <laughs> Press start. Maybe. Fuck. Um, are we getting a Final Fantasy Rebirth or Elden Ring DLC video? You're going to get an Elden Ring DLC fucking stream? And nothing for Final Fantasy Rebirth because I've not played the first one or the original and I don't give a fuck. Ah, dear. I think it touches with good one. Oh my goodness. <sighs> I just tried to hurt you want to marry the pensive man. What the heck? <laughs> Hi, Lisa Misa. Lisa Misa, Jar Jar Beans. Um, hey, this movie is great. It's from back when they were on the old seasons, which is why it's so good. It is pretty good. But I just remember that that joke is so much better than everything else. I, I've been re-watching this. Well, no, that's a lie. I've been watching excuse me, Modern Simpsons! Yes! Modern Simpsons! Uh, from not the most recent series, the one before. And there are some episodes there, I'm like, that's good Simpsons. That's good Simpsons. There's some good shit. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not having you on. There is some good modern Simpsons. When can I watch a Simpsons movie? I've never seen it. I assume it's on Disney Plus. It's yeah. No, it really. Like truly, there was an episode. Um, for reasons I'm not going to get into. Uh, uh, Lisa and Bart were put on steroids. For, to cure a thing and it made them get fat after a few um, yeah after a few weeks and so Bart takes his newfound fatness and ends up sort of joining a gym thing and it's a whole fucking secret underground gym that doesn't matter but Lisa's storyline is that she um, Marge says that she's looking chunky and that word sits with her and it's all about how your parents fuck you up <laughs> And I really, and Marge kind of apologizes for it, but that doesn't make it any better. Um, and keeps make, keeps making the same mistake. 
Um, and then you sort of you go inside Marge's mind and you see that she's got the word plane given to her from her mum. And it's kind of just the, just a beautiful, like, generational trauma episode. Yeah. It was good. It was good. It was good. I liked it a lot. And it has a good resolution of going and going, yeah, it's probably not going to fix it. Actually, I was watching one episode and fucking Bill Cipher turned up randomly. Which I thought was fun. You gonna watch Godzilla vs. Kong? Uh, yes. Yes, I fucking am. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Did you play Ghost of Tsushima? I did, but I wasn't I wasn't super keen on it. I was just like, eh, it just feels like another open worldy thing. My dad's just finished playing it and he absolutely loved it. Um Plain, as in P-L-A-I-N. Oh, we got lights! I think that means we have officially hit the halfway point. Wow. Wow. I'm watching Simpsons for the first time, but I'm currently near the end of season 10. Do I stop? It's probably best to, yeah. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, whoop, shit. Yeah, it's like if you if you could you know talk about these things, you can dig them out, but it takes a long time. And yeah, for it's fine schedule, I know, right? Best groundskeeper Willy joke. Well, it's it's not even his joke. It's Homer's joke during the Treehouse of Horror, where there's that sign next to the thermostat that says "Do not touch Willy." Good advice. <laughs> <laughs> It's a good episode, fuck you. Um, anyway. Stop the van, I need to piss so bad. It's not a van, and I need to piss as well. You should have gone in to Son. I'm sorry, I literally cannot. Avoid pissing. Uh, <laughs> lousy smudge weather. What's your opinion on the lag? Uh, the look of the Enterprise of Strange New Worlds. I thought it looked beautiful. I like that it's all kind of oldy clicky buttons as well, but I think they've done a good job. I like it a lot. I like it a lot. Um, surely there's a VR Simpsons game. No, there's not. I don't think there's been a, a Simpsons game since the Simpsons movie. And when I say game, I mean not the Simpsons Tap Tower or any shit like that. I mean like actual games. Speak for yourself, I brought a bottle of me to piss into. Ah. Um, Dan, as a Brit, are the words Willie and Fanny funny to you? Yes, exceptionally. Exceptionally hilarious. All the time. Permanently, yes. There is one, it's called Virtual Springfield. That came out in like the year 2000. <laughs> oh dear. JC, happy birthday, Dad! Thank you for being a real one. You always be my favourite YouTuber! JC with your ten dollars, and now to celebrate, it's time to crash. Beep, 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 all the way home, motherfuckers. No, let's not. Let's not do that. Let's not do that. Simpsons taps out. Ah, the wonder of the weird era. By the way, that's legitimate, right? I managed to get to the max level in that game because I found a pretty fucking interesting little bug, and I was like, oh, if I kind of keep doing this thing and I could get basically infinite of the premium currency and they didn't really give a shit about making that game that's a game glitch you just genuinely crashed in well it would still take about the same amount of time to get back <laughs> my name is William my mum's name is Fanny I'm not fucking kidding oh my god that's amazing <laughs> I have brought this my entire life you will now suffer yeah, please. Oh, it's long gone. I shared it with a committee at the time, but now it's long gone. Uh, it's just—it was a bug where you could use one of the one of the shops, and it, I can't remember how I did it. it. It would basically make infinite of the premium currency, which meant you could buy everything. And so I would just buy literally everything, and very quickly I just yeah, weird era was glorious. I like the weird era. My stream just froze when you went over the rumble strip, and I genuinely panicked. <laughs> Hmm. My voice has started to go. La 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 la. Um. Shouldn't your seat be bottled on the floor of the bus? 
I see his boat, but it also rotates for fun. You'd be getting any of the new Star Wars TCG? No, and that's because I really didn't like uh, Lorcana. I got the the. I always just buy like the starter decks, and I was like, ah, it's just I just uh, nothing there for me. Nothing there. I'm gonna eat something. What am I gonna eat? Oh, I don't know. Fuck. I keep deciding shit. Ah. Oh. Hey, damn right question. M dash or semicolon? How about neither? That's what editors are for. My parents have a friend called A Muff. Yes, I want to be friends with A Muff. Uh, and his wife is his his wife is called Pat. You can't get married. You can't get married if that's gonna you're gonna change your name for that. <laughs> How'd you feel about the next Star Trek movie being a prequel? I don't give a fuck. It's all prequels. Everything's a fucking prequel in Star Trek. Let's think about the future, but first, let's think a lot about the past of the future. Are you getting the Fallout Magic Gathering decks? No, Rek is not a, a Fallout fan. In fact, Rek does not like... Sorry, Rek is a Fallout fucking fan. Rek does not like Magic the Gathering, so no, I'm not going to uh, be picking up. Maybe the dog beat one. How did you sleep last night down? Badly. I haven't got a few hours in, so I'm quite tired now, as you can see by my face going like this. Uh, do you think Deadpool um, Wolverine will revitalize the MCU? Yes. Absolutely. How old are you now? Now I'm 34. Tomorrow I'm 35. The day after that, I'm still 35. This is not aging a day at time. My mum has a friend called Milf. Ah, oh, that's filmed backwards. That's absolutely fine. Um... Did I say Pyro BA2 is resubscribed? Well, I have now. I think I did. Yeah, no, I did. Okay. Quick, I want you, uh, my seven year old cousin, don't swear, says Preposterous Withens. Okay, I won't swear. Fuck! Okay, we did it. Sorry, that was as long as I could last for. Oh, dear. Anyway, it's good. Um, yeah. Just gonna sit here and zone out. I really need a wee with Rebecca. <laughs> I need someone to drive this bus. <laughs> I need someone to drive my fucking bus for me. We have to stream on 3D a pinball space cadet one day. I'm so shit at pinball, you have no fucking idea. Oh dear. Oh, because the accelerator I heard it click out. I was ready for it. I was ready for it. I've checked, I, I've checked out the Alien Romulus trailer. I don't, I don't give a shit about the Alien films. Ah, I don't give a shit. Star Trek got, loves to go back to the future. Yeah, I just want a post TNG show. Yeah. We well, haven't a couple space program too. Well, I played it and it was a bit naff, so I stopped playing it. I think a lot of people did that. A swearing joke in Saints Row 2 video. I don't know what that is. Get 449 people on this bus. Please don't kill us all. Well, that might do. I need to make some dinner and walk my dog. Don't crash while I'm gone, says Zebra Legend. Well, yeah, I might a little. Someone else is play playing this. I'm going to pretend you're racing. Really? Oh, shit. Wait, how far are they? How far are they into it? I'm going to just do a very naughty little test here. I'm going to see if I can just click off the screen. Oh, wait, hang on. Wait, wait, wait. Will it stop the bus? Nope. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. I'm stuck forever. Oh, no. I'm going to piss myself on a live stream. Ah. I <laughs> can't get the job! <laughs> listen for us, unless it's been subscribed for 80 months! It's just over a year. Uh, what do I have to. Sh 80 months, what do I have to show for it? I'm gonna die on this bus. Yeah, but that's okay. Um, quietly set up a macro to hit every 3 to 5 seconds. I mean, yeah, I could do that. Oh my god, piss reveal. Oh dear. Just nice to tire on the dash. Yep, four hours, 13 minutes in. Oh, 
Having a good time, having a good time. Definitely don't need to piss right now. It's all fine. I smell toast. That's probably not a good sign. <laughs> oh, don't worry about that later. Regret your choice of game already? A little bit, yeah. A little bit. How long's the journey? Well, I've got another four hours to go, and I'm 35 now, so, you know, I need to piss all the time. Especially when I'm talking for this long, I need to drink all the time. And if I need to drink all the time... <laughs> hey, you should Google it. <laughs> Someone should Google it for me to see if I can actually stop without the bus breaking down like it did in the original. Because that was mean. Don't stop him now, he's having such a good time. Having a ball. Do you have an empty it? Yeah, but it's a can, and it's, I think they have more accuracy than I think I've got. You did in the VR vid. Yeah, but it's like if you leave it for a while, you can. Oh, you see people saying I can. <sighs> Slow down the bus to eat something. Oh, that sounds about right. Uh, Lynn Mac, back up on my computer, finally! Take my money! Rebecca! For God's sake, go piss! I'm trying to make your food all I can hear as you whinge and on about how you need to piss! Go piss! Jesus Christ! Thank you, best friend! <laughs> Fucking hell, who's dealing with the last thing you requested? <laughs> oh no, man, Hello. Oh wait, where, where do I have to sit? There we go. Oh shit. Oh. <sighs> Hello, how, how are all of you? <laughs> I'm trying, to, I'm trying to make food and every two seconds all I can hear is a new piss and I'm like, oh my god. Fucking hell. I'm making pizza. Because I didn't know what to make and I was like, well that was a good idea I thought on the uh, uh, hit and run stream because it's easy for him to eat. But um, I'm, I made the dough. <laughs> we don't have any like pre-made in. So that's what I've been doing, and all I can hear is I need a piss. I don't want, I'm going to be in the middle of something right now. But that's why he's smelling toast because I'm preheating the oven. I assume it's got the stone in it. Anyway, are you all right? <laughs> what? Are you all right? Oh, yeah, there you go. I'm so old for this shit. That's my problem. <laughs> okay, I nearly did crash when I handed you the controller as well. I'll be back in like ten minutes. With Okay, thank you, best friend. I'll need a piss again in 10 minutes. <laughs> it's funny, because it's true. Anyway. Oh, oh. I feel better now. Oh, this is good. Just think one day you actually take this bus journey. Uh, no, no, thank you. What'd you get as a gift for your birthday? I don't know, I haven't got it yet. I do know. <laughs> it's in the other room. It's not even wrapped yet. Um, reckon we crashed the bus by not steering when you passed the controls. <laughs> Classic. Classic stuff. Um, I have uh, the Green Goblin Hot Toy. Everyone's pitched in that will be a Green Goblin Hot Toy, which is very nice. <sighs> it's a good, it's a fucking good stream, this one, isn't it? And a, and a lovely time! <laughs> Just a bit fucking better on myself. Okay, well, that's all good. Oh, dear. Is it another Dalek? It's Lego, isn't it? No, it's a fucking yeah, Greek Goblin hot toy. Which I was talking about in the last stream, I think. Um, that's a good 20 seconds of Rebecca. I hope you see me get another two hours. That is the vibe. That is what we like to do. Have you got any of the new Lego sets? I haven't bought Lego for a long time. Long time. I mean, I did buy the flowers for Rebecca for Valentine's Day. But apart from that, long time. I just got too much Lego to actually build. And so I went, ah, I don't need to get that anymore. Ugh, I'm gonna eat a few crispies. Meh. Best crisps in the world. These are my current pride and joy. These are the things I love the most now. Little potato sticks, salt and vinegar potato sticks. 
Oh, yeah. Ah, that's the shit right there. Speaking of Lego, I saw the Jazz Club ta uh, town set in the shop. Looks so cool. I still haven't built my one from last year, the, the Jazz Club. And I haven't even bought the Natural History Museum yet. Direct says, Donnie Chris, I'm bringing you food. Oh, shit. Quest her away. <laughs> God, I need a wee again. Um. <laughs> Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, I know you just told me. You said 10 minutes, and I was like, well, I'm hungry now. It's been four hours of driving. You got tired after 40 minutes of driving, didn't you? <laughs> Love you, Rebecca. I don't know what, what, what food's coming. I don't know what food's coming. Did you tell everyone what food's coming? Does Rebecca tell you what food's coming? You don't tell me. Calm down, I need to wait. Should you go for wait? We had uh, we had a, a new thingy. <gasps> pizza! I'm getting pizza! Oh, she beach. When oh, one hits, yeah, I like a big pizza pie. That's another little buggy friend. Um uh, M to the second, seven, seven, seven. I'm pretty sure the largest set of collected built so far is the scale model of the DeLorean from Back to the Future. Comes with an action feature where the wheels flip up and the flex capacitor lights up. Oh, that's really cute. Yeah, I, di I didn't get that because I already have a model about that size of the DeLorean. I was like, oh, I can't have two. It's fine, it's fine. Um, anyone else disappointed with the redesign for the D&D &D set? Uh, Lego Ideas is really sort of like hit and miss with it. Sometimes they take something and they make it incredible, and sometimes it's an incredible thing that they take and they just fucking <laughs> shelf. Uh, hi, Animal Crossing Lego sets. No, oh, thank you. So disappointed. Um, yeah, anyway. Oh, bah, 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 bah. Have the office set. I was I bought the office set to do on a live stream, so I could do like a live stream of building Lego, and that office set is earmarked for when I, when I do that. Oh, excuse me. Just got the Riverdale set. That's really fucking nice. Uh, Six thousand one hundred sixty-seven pieces. Yeah. For Christmas, I got the. Uh, my parents got me the Avengers Lego Tower. Really big one. With all the Avengers in it. They have not given it to me yet. They've just, just got like, ah, I'll give it to you at some point. Guess I'm not allowed. I'm going to Did you buy the Lego Titanic? No, because I drop it and then it would just, you know, give some people in the area flashbacks. Ah, uh, dear. Um. Got the Jurassic Park one with the other oh, dinosaur and the da da da, yeah. The T Rex. Uh, and the Redis Look Art oh, one. They're, they're nice sets. They're very nice sets. Um, yeah, I, yeah, I, I gotta. My next one will be the Natural History to go in my town, but I just. I did. At Christmas, I, when we were watching Christmas movies, I built the Home Alone house, which I really enjoyed doing. I just haven't had time. Just a lot of my time has been taken up with dealing with noise. The T Rex. But the Batman animated Gotham looks absolutely beautiful. Oh, Matt is going to fucking buy that immediately. Absolutely. Lots of desert bus Lego set. Well, I actually legitimately had an idea for a Lego desert bus set. Where we would design the bus from the outside and it would sit on a treadmill of road and cactus that was... You would rotate the treadmill and it would push under the wheels and go round and round. So it would go round and round and round forever. I thought that would be cute, but nobody would buy it. <laughs> nobody would buy it. How are you doing about there? Everyone's doing okay. Uh, what's your opinion on the newest Star Trek series coming out in 2025 based around Starfleet Academy? I'd love a Starfleet Academy series. I think that'd be really fun. Just keep it, you know, Strange New Worlds vibe. Be really good. How much disturbance to the neighbours, Craig? It's sounding like a lot. Uh, 18 months of building work so far. 18 months. It's great! 
Really loving it. Really, really loving it. Um, but loud noise if it gets too loud, I can't record. I have to, I basically just have to go to bed. It's good. Are they building a whole new house? No, because that would take less than a year. They just keep fucking changing everything. It's fine. Will also be a book signing with Paradox Paradox? Uh, I don't know. And will you be able, willing to sign? Yeah, I'll sign anything. If I do do one, I'll do anything. Don't worry about it. There's room for the Academy series that we set in the 31st century. Oh. Really? That's not very... I don't know, for me Starfleet Academy is San Francisco, you know? That's, that's Starfleet Academy, is seeing the big red fucking bridge. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Disappointed. Anyway, uh, back, uh, the final personal signed book a couple months ago, can't wait. Hey, yeah, it should be in San Francisco, it really should be. Tilly went off in season four of Disco to work at the Academy. I think she'll be in that series. Oh, uh, that's less interesting then, isn't it? Um, if you do a book tour, would you accept a Robot Wars toy as a gift? No, because I have every single Robot Wars toy I ever made. I'll accept a real robot, though. That'd be great. I'll, that's all I'll accept, actually. Only real robots. Uh, Abby Smirk says, uh, Hey, Rebecca, nice to see you. I love your own shadow. Thank you. Uh, Scott Hutch, day four, has resubscribed as a Civil Mayhem. An epic crowd, 101! I well, was watching the original Desert Bus at work today. Now stream of it. Happy birthday, you wonderful madman. Four hours. Going inside. Um, tornado deserved that win. You know which one. Uh, mods, Pan, one of many Jameses. Uh, Sai! Six per wolf. Making a vegan shepherd's pie. And a cornflake tart at the same time. I'm listening and I'm so worried about messing up the pans or getting distracted by this. Then my lights the Lego Modular Museum once we've eaten. Oh, I want to get that museum so badly this time. Having a time. Having a time. Having a time. Um, got the certain five off eBay. Oh, good shit. That's a good one. That is. Damn, when it comes to doing book signing, could you do it in New Zealand? It's only a 35 to 52 hour trip away. I did it in 20 hours. I'm just saying. Um, I'd love to. I'd love to. Sounds so nice. 150 gram ant weight or three pound beetle weight? Ant weight! And I've always wanted like a proper ant weight. Or like five to battle and break. Flippers! How many comments did you sign in fucking video games? Uh, on the book tour, I'd say just under a thousand. In the warehouse, I think it was three and a half thousand. It took several days, I think three days. It was good. It was tiring. But it's done now, you know. And I think it's more for Paradox, so. But I'm so used to signing things. I mean, I signed 3,600 fucking art prints this couple of weeks ago, so. You get used to it. You get used to signing. I'm glad I came up with a good signature for it. Mm -mm -mm. It's a good book. I'm quite happy with it. Paradox is way better. But, like, it's good. It's good just to prove that I can actually write. <laughs> That's what it was there for. Unlisted video on Disney Plus just gone public. There's an unlisted video on Disney Plus. Trailer! Where's my phone? I was thinking it was going to go about five ish. Let's see if we can uh, get some live reactions of the. Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. I say live reactions, I just want to watch the fucking thing. I'm not, I don't react at all. I'll just be there going. <laughs> Okay. Did your signature change of the course of signing? No, I came up with my signature for the signing. Oh, it's not up on the googly thing yet. Um, yeah, I came up with the signature when I realised I had to sign 3,500 copies and I hadn't got a signature that I've ever had consistently. So, yeah. I felt like it was time to do a call signature. And I used that one now, so that's really nice. Is this a full run-through? Oh, yes! Oh yeah, Sean, we are four hours, 28 minutes in. Yeah. What was your favorite thing to sign on the book tour? Do you remember The Strange Calendars? I must admit, the book tour is a blur in my fucking mind because it was so full on. It was so much stuff 
So I remember, I remember good vibes, but detail wise, nah. I remember the haggis that I ate before the first day, and the meal and ZZs that I ate at the end of the last day, and between those two <laughs> points, I don't remember very much at all. <laughs> you know, I love to see Lego doing peanut slash newbie. Oh yes, please, that would be so cool. That would be such a beautiful little set. I could design that one. Because we've been getting Doctor Who just over a month. Yeah, two months. Um, yeah. I really have enjoyed it very wide. <laughs> Carrot's very funny. Oh, fuck. Uh, 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 uh. You dropped a dog in Bristol. Excuse me, unholy pitch. I didn't drop a dog. I remember that fucking dog. Somebody had me like a little, this little tiny puppy thing. And I nearly dropped a dog in Bristol. Matt Berry's people came up to you too. I do remember that because I still have the Matt Berry t shirt and the Matt Berry music CDs. <laughs> Um, Lin Mac says, I think I've actually got the bus. Lin Mac, do a flip. Do a spin. Maybe other people playing. You can't just play the game. I'm waiting for the for latency of things. Go on, Lin Mac. Do it. Rotate. Rotate your head. Do something. Do anything. See if you appear. <laughs> this is not with the scary bunnies, right? No, that was a different game with the scary bunnies. I remember the scary bunnies, yeah. I would you say uh, of Johnny Whittaker's Doctor... Oh, what of it is worth watching? Uh, first episode, Rosa. Uh, the one with the frog. You tried! Oh, you're not. Only four could try, I'm guessing, so. Um, oh, yeah, no, I want to watch that. Um, there's a Peanuts streaming show. I watched the Peanuts movie, like, less than a week ago. Um, the animated one, it's so good. Like, I've been a huge Peanuts fan my entire life since childhood. And they absolutely fucking nailed that. Absolutely nailed that film. Fuck me, everything about it. The soundtrack, the visuals, just the styling of it, the pacing, the tone. Just the fucking vibe. Perfect. Could not have been better. Could not have been better. Absolutely perfect. Um... I think it was something like dog <laughs> dog shamming or cabin pod. Oh, that was in York, wasn't it? I was next to the calendar display and I got really weird because there was like one of the calendars was called like cabin pay or something. Cabin cabin porn, that was it. Yeah. Anyway. Uh, yeah, there's a Franklin. Amazon uh, has done a special on Franklin, which I'm really, I'm really excited to see. But no, that was the one I was talking about. How much time yet? Yeah, I just watched the original, the um the movie made by that company that Disney went and killed, uh Blue. Blue Sky? Is it Blue Sky who made the... Or is that the thingy? I think it's Blue Sky was the company that made the thingies. Yeah. Yeah, they were the one that who did the Ice Age films. Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that, that film. Um, that Snoopy film. It just... As a, as a, as a lifelong fan. Um, couldn't have been better. Jack1998 says happy birthday! Thanks for the laughs! Time for me to go to the gym! <laughs> muscles, muscles, muscles! That was why I did that bit there. Oh shit, Rebecca's bought a. Oh shit, it's a full pizza! Oh, you'll get half, I'm happy with the half. Oh, what? It's a half pizza? <laughs> you fucking piece of shit! <laughs> <laughs> Would you like any sauce, any drinks? No, that looks good. Would you like to describe the pizza as I show it to the, the, the audience? Um, pizza, handmade, homemade pizza. It's got Richmond's vegan sausages on because I don't know what to put on. Ooh. And it's got uh, frozen peppers on it because I don't know what to put on. <laughs> and oh. it's got. What's the cheese? Cathedral City. Cathedral City vegan cheese. Ugh, fuck, 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 fuck. And I'm going to leave it there because last time I nearly. I had a burn in my mouth for fucking day. Oh, help, help, help. <laughs> help, I'm trying to drive a bus here! Thanks, best friend. i got to let it cool because last time I went straight for it and it all, it all went to shit. Hello. Yeah, anything, any sauce, anything? No, no, no. I would like a drink because I've run out of drink and I've drunk two cans and all of that. What would you like? I think there's a bit left in this can, so I'm going to keep that can. Just, just, just a squash and six more cans. <laughs> Thanks, best friend. The record delivers to moving buses. It's the strategy of theirs. Um, 
Uh, my chemical romance says I've already driven 115 miles IRL during the stream. About to drive 150 miles back. Thanks for the entertainment during the drive. You are very welcome. Um, pizza also made even crash. It's good pizza. It's a good pizza. How many times have you beaten the game at this point? Once. I've only ever. Then this version? Never. I've only ever beaten the game once. Um. Jack! Oh, I read that one. Yeah, Jack on that. Off to the gym! Muscles, muscles, muscles! There's a whole kitchen in the back of this. Yep. It's true. Uh, yeah, I mean, I drink so much as I. As I'm recording and streaming, I just fucking drink endlessly. Can after can after can. Oh, I really want to take a bite of that pizza right now. <laughs> it looks so hot. Oh, it looks so hot. Uh, Vaughn Cocker! Or oh, Coca, which is even funner name. Uh, bruh! You, uh, like my childhood! Lol, just trying to remember you existed when downloaded Just Cause 3. Ah, yes. A game I'm in. My little logo is in that game. My old logo. In fact, my old old logo is in that game, but yeah. That's good stuff. Oh. The accelerated pedal just popped out. R2 button. There we go. Wedge it down. Wedge it down, motherfuckers. Um, Melissa, for some this is off. Gonna sign off for now, uh, so I need to do my workout. Hey, it's at the bus driver, bus driver, bus driver. Hey, it's at the bus driver, bus driver. Me. <laughs> anyway, let's, uh... I'm bored. Can we listen to some Gary Newman? Okay, yeah. Here in my bus, I can safest of bus, and lock all the bus, and nobody does a bus. uh uh Trailer is out. Apparently the trailer is out. But it's not in my subs. So why is it not in the fucking top two YouTube channel in cars? Hey, best friend. Thank you for the orange drink. Dogs get real close to my fucking pizza. Matilda, I will eat you. I didn't bring them any treats, but they're really excited. So I guess I'm going to go... Find some trailer. <laughs> oh, no. Go search for Disney Plus. I will find this trailer. It's, it's, oh, the Acolyte. Oh, I give a shit. Uh, no, it's not there. You lied to me. You're all lying to me. You're not allowed to phone you drive it. I'm a <laughs> Not allowed to have pizza delivered while you're driving. You have to throw it through the window. <laughs> um, now apparently it's only on Disney Plus. Uh, what? Do I have to wait till midnight? Wait till midnight. Are you excited about a maybe community movie soon? Yes, definitely. I'm excited. Yes, thank you. Yes. Yes, please. Yes. 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 There. Uh, yes. Doctor Two isn't on Disney in the UK. Yeah, fucking no. I wish it was in the fucking UK. That's my first. So it's just talk to your trailer. Where's the talk to your trailer? Where's the talk to your trailer? I think I found it. 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 Three minutes ago on Disney Plus. It's just called Disney Plus. Okay. Wait. I gotta try and watch this and drive at the same time. How long do you have to drive to win? Oh, there's no win. <laughs> but there is after eight hours, it's fine. Okay, I'm gonna watch a trailer. Um, I'm gonna, oh God, my phone doesn't auto rotate. Fuck. <laughs> Can I get my phone to the little button? I like the little button, but fuck me. Becca, do you wanna watch a Doc 2 trailer? Yeah. Uh, where was it uploaded? It's on, a, it's on the Disney Plus YouTube channel, but not the letter plus, the word plus. I'm gonna play with audio. Oh my god! Oh, Tom is skidding into the unit base! <gasps> Give me the it's my boy! Oh, I've seen this episode! Now I've seen this one! Oh, <laughs> Tom's just crashing through the house and going Oh shit, he's so cold. I love you. It's the doctor, oh my god. Ah, to Talent! Talent! 
Oh my god, and it's playing Bowie in the background? Oh my god, oh my god, it looks so pretty. Dinosaurs! Oh my god! <laughs> ah! Stabby got a butterfly! Oh, freaky aliens. Oh my god, magic drag queens! Scary drums! This is so good looking, oh my god. I can't hear a thing because I can only hear a bus. <laughs> oh my god, this is amazing. Holy shit. Oh my god, what the fuck? I'm gonna watch the trailer like a hundred times. Oh my god. Sorry, I've literally just watched the whole fucking trailer. Feel free to meet the stage, watch your own. Ooh, Tyler seems a bit fucked up. My tab! <laughs> How good does that look? Holy shit! Holy shit! How good is that? That's eight episodes! Is there any point in watching any of the journey before watching the new one? No. Just watch the talent specials. Old TARDIS? Is this the continuation of the Key React series? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Good talk to you. Is that legal these days? That's all we get these days. Russell T. Davies is back. How good is it? Oh my god, I'm gonna watch that on like a oh, hundred times. Oh, big smiles, big smiles on my face. Ah, <laughs> uh, that's pretty. That's pretty. Yeah. Okay. 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 My favorite writing episode three. Is that been revealed now? Is it called Boom? Because uh, he's been he said boom in a in a trailer when he, in a, in an interview where he said he wasn't doing it. He just said the word boom and it felt really weird. And since then I was like, is he just calling his episode boom? Because I think that would be a fucking delight if he's been basically saying the episode title in interviews while saying he's not doing a thing. So that's uh, but yeah, no, I'm glad my boy not it's back. Dan, you okay? You're playing Desert Bus? Yeah, I've been playing it for 4 hours 41 minutes now. <laughs> Tenant's little head. I just saw the trailer, holy shit, I'm so excited. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, it's heavy speculation this episode 3. Okay. I hope it's called Boom. That's what I hope. Did you watch the trailer yet? I just watched it literally just then. Did you mute me to watch the trailer? Ah, <laughs> uh, a bit of Bowie as well. Can afford Barry! Doctor Who can afford Bowie now! I can have a bit of pizza. Celebratory pizza! Uh, okay, fuck. And then, oh, fuck. And then, oh, fuck. Break it, split it, twist it. <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh, so fucking good! My compliments to the chef! That's you. Thank you. <laughs> Do you think the new incarnation would be a good jumping on point for Doctor Who? Yes. Yep. Yep, 100%. Yep. 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 It's literally being called season one. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I forgot what I was doing for a second then. Yeah. It's going to be a great jumping on point. I mean, there is already one episode of it, though. They will say there is one episode that's already on. So watch the first episode of Shooty Yet One. Oh, my God. I've just seen ten of my eyes were drawn towards Shooty. Yep. <laughs> Joe Hex says, happy birthday, I'll trade ages. I'm okay, thanks. Anyone else worried about the poor TARDIS looking overgrown in that one shot? No, Time Spectre, because here's the thought I've just literally had pop into my head. What if that's Tenant's TARDIS? What if he's gone? What if he's died of old age and that's just his old, the old uh, TARDIS? Merging back together? Bloop. Tenant was in the trailer? Well, uh, sort of. <laughs> I mean, yeah, the actor David Tenant was in the trailer. In a form. His face was. But yeah, if you want to watch Doctor Who from scratch, now is the perfect time to. to sorry, to just jump on. Now would be the time to uh, watch it. Yeah. Yeah. 
And the Christmas episode that's already gone would be the first time to watch it, because that was actually the first episode of this series. <sighs> hey, Nomi on the YouTubes. Uh, happy other birthday! The stream is perfect for having the background while doing boring paperwork, lol. It's a lovely background. It's a My Millennium Eyes to see Millennial Die. Oh, for fuck's sake, I can't speak! A My Millennial Eyes Deceiving Me, says Justin S. He's actually playing Desert Bus. Happy birthday, Daniel. Thank you very much. So I don't need another plot point to the Chibnall area? Era? I'll give them to you. Um, the world and the universe kind of got mostly blown up. Did I just flop on the, myself? I did a little bit there. Um, well, half the universe got astray. Um, or a third, or a quarter. Actually, Chibnall never... Chibnall says it's all of it, uh, and then it never gets mentioned. But Russell was like, yeah, it's sort of half of it got destroyed. So half the universe was kind of destroyed. And then... Yeah, watch the specials. That's a really good idea. If you want to watch, yeah, watch the three most recent specials with David Tennant, which are on Disney Plus. If you're if you're new and watching it on Disney Plus, start there with Tennant's three specials. Um, ah, eh, no, just start with Shuey. Actually, skip the special because they really focus on Tennant's era and and thingy ones. Yeah, start just with Shuey's episode. The Christmas special from this year, the Goblin. What's it? Church on Ruby Road. Start of the episode. Church on Ruby Road. Yeah, I play in the UK, Disney Plus, everywhere else. And let's enjoy Doctor Who together as a world. Even if we have to step to midnight to watch it now. <laughs> okay, oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. <laughs> so good. I love the 30 second expiration Russell D. Davis gives to accept flux and move on. Two of them. In two specials it gets put up. First time, Tony gets really angry and kicks a wall a whole bunch. Incredible acting sells the pain. Uh, and then the, the toy maker pushes on it to piss the doctor off. And, um, yeah. It really is a... Uh... And then Tony goes into retirement. You know? So he then gets to go and sort all those feelings and emotions out so shoot, he's not burdened with them, which I think is a genius way of getting around it and keeping Dog 2 a continuous thing. Um, yeah. Because Russell's a great... Russell loves Doctor Who. Simple as... Simple as... Neil Patrick Harris was brilliant at the Christmas special. I agree. Said that. Craig 2N. Oh, Craig. 2N, yes. Um... Absolutely. Absolutely. Makes hard to keep uh, building in a world where you do a zillion years of a show. I feel like if they hadn't done a reset, the power would have been too much. I mean, Doctor Who has a natural reset built into it in regeneration. Which is genuinely brilliant. Uh, and so it is, it is going on, it's gone on for now for over 60 years. Six, over 60 years that show's been running for. Which is pretty fucking cool. <laughs> and everything happened, and nothing happened, and yeah, let's go for it. Oh, excuse me. Oh my goodness. Do you like the idea that all regenerations were bioregenerations? Yeah. All regenerations were bioregenerations, but also they weren't bioregenerations. We followed a doctor where they weren't. There are now versions of the doctor where they are. The multiverse, universe, whatever. They just could have been. It adds that option. By writing in bi generation as a thing for this doctor, it retroactively allows you to go back and go, what if there was a bio-generation hit? So that's fun. So they're keeping that trailer on Disney Plus YouTube, not the actual Doctor Who YouTube. Yeah, that's kind of a bit weird, but... Oh, well. Um, love Jodie's Doctor from the few I saw. Shame was in the Chibnall's era. That is the common consensus, yep. Wait, when did Disney buy Doctor Who? They don't... They haven't bought it. They bought the streaming rights. Very different. It's um, a BBC-owned show that is being made by Bad Wolf Productions, but a fair bit of the funding came from Disney, who wanted exclusive streaming rights to it. Because of that, it's getting a weird release, where it's still being released BBC One, 7pm or whatever, um, on the Saturday, but because it's airing in America, they want it on Friday, and you know, streaming, they want it Friday primetime, which is like America's big 
time slot that they're aiming for. Um, so it arrives, it airs Friday prime time in America, which means it airs midnight in the UK on iPlayer. So you can watch it before it airs on BBC. Um, and I've seen some people getting mad at that, um, and I understand why you'd be mad at that, but also it's a different world streaming like what well, actually sitting down to watch tv dog two is the only show i do that for like i'm not that bothered like genuinely you know you know everything's eventually going to be streaming in some way or the other um yeah be prepared to avoid spoilers from us viewers or just stab to but not and watch it like i'm gonna do it's more people watching dog two and that's the thing right russell's smart the one thing Russell wants more than anything else is more Doctor Who and Doctor Who to continue. Doctor Who to continue beyond him. And in doing that, you know, get these specials, get the special stuff, get it on Disney+. Plus. If we have to do a whole new streaming thing, we'll do a whole new streaming thing. You know, Doctor Who lives. If more people are watching it, Doctor Who lives. And we'll just keep going. Yeah. Uh, I just finished work. I'm a delivery driver. Says Cheesy Chats. Happy birthday, Dan. Oh, did you deliver me this lovely pizza? <laughs> Oh shit, I need to get a slice. Ah, I'm gonna do it. I'm on the road still, that's good. Uh, Lewis Hedry, happy uh, cute birthday! I've been watching your old Sims 3 video, and it's funny seeing you hate on vegans, lol. How times have changed. Sometimes, people are making good points, you're just not smart enough to listen. <laughs> yep. Is this still going? Bloody hell! The road between, can't remember, and don't care, takes forever. Tucson and Las Vegas. It's eight hours, we're four hours, 51 minutes in. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, if Chibnall had not done the timeless uh, child crap, five generation could be described as a glitch of the era. Sorry, a glitch of the extra generations Matt Smith got. Could have done that, yeah. But it just lets you. It, get, it gives you talent. If you're doing spin offs, which Russell's definitely doing spin offs, you know, then. We got Tenant to face some of those and bring people in because Tenant's like the most popular doctor, so. Yeah. It's all good. Look, I have ADHD. I like knowing that I can watch something at midnight. <laughs> Midnight's easy. What would your dream Doctor Who series be? Doctor, Companion, Showrunner, etc. Um, doctor. Shooty Gatwa, Companion, Millie Gibson, Showrunner, I'd say Russell T. Davies. <laughs> I'm quite happy. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. So. I still can't figure out what about the Chimney series look wrong. I can find my page. It's too zoomed in. And that's me talking. But so many of the shots are so close in on people's face, because that was kind of an artistic thing that was happening back then, that the characters don't have, the actors don't have room to move. They can't move, they can't emote, they can't do fuck all, so... You know. It just limited everybody. Bad choices all around, really. Um... Uh, uh, this is strange. Someone playing Desert Bus and having the time of his life. Ah, you know, good stuff. Um, Chris Schimmel is directing this stream. <laughs> this little bit. And argue, I would argue that Chibnall's ones was more zoomed in. You got a lot less left and right. But saying you're blocked into this thing, yeah, you don't know. Um. Yeah, it's just, I don't know. And Shuri came back, and I'm like, yeah, Shuri came along, and I'm like, yeah, this is, that's what you want. You want a charismatic doctor. You want a companion who is intelligent, but not like Clara level, where they just, you don't want that shit. Um, you want someone who's intelligent and emotional, and you want uh, a writer who loves the show and science fiction, which is very important because Chibnall never felt like he liked science fiction. That was, I think, one of his big problems. Um,. Uh, the face down with the villain in Rosa in that warehouse. Don't remember one establishing shot, just mid shot and closer. Yeah, there was hardly any establishing shots. It's very weird. So what you're saying is you're the world president of the Christian Will fan club. I mean, yeah, 
yeah, why not? <laughs> I'll do it. 20 quid. Um, yeah. After you did us triple to work at this new series, but you turn it down. I think you kind of have to. That kind of friends, you know, Doctor. I mean, the the, the thing Chibnall did was he kept Doctor Who going, not very well, <laughs> not very well at all. But he kept it going, so I'll be ever so slightly grateful of that. Because without him, then you know, there maybe not have been anyone to take the shoes of the show runner. And we'll see. We will see. So, um, you could write Star to be the companion Doctor Who because you're all of those things. I would no. I'd write it. Sure, but no. No. He kept it alive during the pandemic. Mm, I think Jody kept it alive during the pandemic. Oh, fuck. Jody was really good during the pandemic. Absolutely fucking nailed it. Kept in character. Really good job. Absolutely brilliant. In Classic Simpsons, where you do a, a Marge Lisa Generation Trauma episode about putting in a happy face when depressed. Yeah, but we do another one about other things. About the generation trauma that gets put on you by the generation you're talking to. Da -da 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 -da. Right. Doubt they wouldn't have been able to find someone else. They might have been not have been able to find someone else. But I mean, like the isn't there like the writer and director of Loki series ones turning up to write some of this new Chibnall stuff? Chibnall stuff. Russell Davis stuff. You got me saying Chibnall now. Mm mm mm. Mm 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 mm. -mm, -mm, -mm. Um, I want some people for a big finish to be showrunner. I mean, Chico, okay, that would be great. I think I think what you need though is Doctor Who to not go that. I think Big Finish is great because it is like Doctor Who for the real Doctor Who nerds. But I think you need someone with that eye on television and the general public and sort of constant pop culture that Russell has to really make Doctor Who shine. It's the acceptable face of science fiction. In a weird way. Um, yeah. I've watched your original Desert Bus videos on a healthy number of times to think about your Ashton Jelly Beans. <laughs> yeah. That was, a good, that was a good time, wasn't it? Where's a good place to start with Big Finish? Just dive into what you want. Who's your favourite Doctor? Who's your favourite companion? They're probably doing shit in Doctor I mean, there's Tennant Rose stuff. There's Tennant Catherine Tate stuff. That's always a good place I get people to start on. Because it is just... It's just episodes of Doctor Who. Just episodes of Doctor Who. And it's good. Looks uh, more like the face of science fantasy going forward. Yeah, I mean... I'd argue it was that with Moffat as well. Because Moffat definitely pushed the fairy tale aspect very hard. Um, so how many episodes have you got written for the day the writers are inevitably stupid unless you write a season? A whole season? Jesus. Uh, well, I could cover a whole season quite easily. Wouldn't be too hard. Um, Ninth is meeting River Song soon. Oh, Jesus, I need to get on that. i got to catch up with Ninth Doctor stuff. I'm so glad he's still doing it. Oh, yeah. Um... I did. Oh, yeah, somebody's asking if I watched Ding's retirement match. I did. I really enjoyed it. I thought it was a great match. I mean, it was no Osprey uh, to cash, which was. Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. That was a good one. Anyway. Uh, Cannon Harkin! Remember, for one month, you are my perfect background noise. That's why I like to be, baby. Just in the background. I like streams like this, where you just vibe it. That's nice. That's nice. Um, do you still collect the action figures of Doctor Who? Yeah, only the ones I want. Now, that's my thing with that. With, I used to be like, I have to have everything. But therapy has definitely helped me to go, I'm just going to get the ones that I want. You know? Just want the things I think are cool looking. It'll be really cool, like a Green Goblin hot toy, and that I can open now. Be friends. Not your yeah, it's not my birthday. I know. <laughs> um, you do any more Doctor Who stuff with Ben Ted's? I'm doing stuff with Ben Ted's, but I'm not gonna talk about it here. Not yet, anyway. You smell onions, maybe. 
Sing's final words of the pay for you will, will point you. Hang on, I'm getting cues. Yeah, if, uh, they, they upload on the YouTube channel what you said after that, which I thought was very, very fun. But yeah, he's just basically talking. They're like, we need to have the pay per view, dear God. No, overall, fucking great pay per view. AW's pay per views just don't miss. Oh, five hour mark, three hours to go. Let's fucking go. Um, we got Mania. When's Mania? The 6th of April? 6th, 7th April? I'm excited for Mania. Um, I don't know what's the card apart from we've got night one, we've got uh, Rock, Roman versus Seth and Cody. Uh, which I assume Cody will lose due to cheating so he can win on the next night. Um, but yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm excited for it. Are there any, match any other matches for Mania announced? What we got going on? Because we got fucking Os. Was it? Is are we doing Osprey Danielson at Dynasty? AW Dynasty. So like, that's the one I'm gonna go. Um, thoughts on the new Rick and Morty? I have not seen any of the new Rick and Morty, and I literally I was looking for it the other day, and I just couldn't find it. It was on Channel Four, but it's not on Channel Four anymore, and it's not on Netflix where the rest of it is. So I don't actually know where you could watch the new season Rick and Morty. So. Yes, I think Fallout looks cool. Kidonian Hankin. I love the random ways you get my name wrong. <laughs> it's because it's it's coming up like blue and my eyes are just not seeing it. It's just, it's, I see a K and then there's a vowels and then there's Hankin or Harkin and I'm like, yeah, that'll do. That'll do. <laughs> oh dear. Um... Uh, Gunther versus Sami Zayn. Uh, that sounds like fun. I love both of those guys. Uh, Becky Lynch v. Rhea Ripley. Okay, that's just... It's like when your crush is fight. Um, it's on Comedy Central. Ah, but in the UK, we don't have Comedy Central. Rick and Morty new season is on Prime. You have to buy it, though. Yeah, I don't like it that much. <laughs> I liked... Uh, I like how they did the voice actors in Solar Opposites more. Well, they just got a brand new actor and like, yeah, he's British now. Corvo's British. Fuck it. Have you watched June? No. Or June 2? No. I forget if I said no and then yes. We have Comedy Central. What? Is this like a streaming thing? I don't know how television works. Tell me in streaming services. <laughs> Rick and Morty's on Knox. The fuck is Knox? You're just making shit up now. I'm having a bit of a pizza. You just make things up. Rick and Morty is on. <laughs> oh. Oh, oh. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. I thought it was on Netflix. Series 7 isn't. Series 7 is not on Netflix. And that's the new one. <laughs> Isn't Tony Central on UK TV Play? I don't know. <laughs> There's too many. I only get one at a time as well. If you have to pay for it, but I only do one at a time. My Amazon runs out in two days. Uh, Fletcher, St. John Brown says, How much did you pay for your hot toys? Uh, Goblin, so I'm thinking about buying one. I got it for just under 300 Brand new, which I'm very happy with. And it's the deluxe one as well with the, with the, um, this little glider. So I was happy about that. <laughs> Mm -hmm. okay. Did you watch Mother Boy spinoff? No. The first episode, I was like, yeah, this isn't for me. Political cynicism I can stand, but like kids and TikTok cynicism, that's my job, and I don't do it like that. 
Yeah, I cancelled Amazon when they were like, we're doing adverts! And I cancelled Disney as well. I think they both actually end on the same day. Yeah, why no VR? Because my head would be tied and then you wouldn't see my luscious eyes. <laughs> um. Yeah. Ezri says, alt tab back into the game. First time in about two hours. Hi. Okay. <laughs> Glad I checked. Oh, dear. Um. You should crash at 7.59 to run. No, we're making it this time. I've never made it. Well, not in this game. You watch any House of the Dragon? No. Do you have any interest in season two? Yes. No. No, I didn't watch it. I've never seen an episode of Game of Thrones. Oh, hang on, there goes the accelerator pedal. This game is basically a podcast with infinitely more effort for Dan. It is exhausting to keep turning. It's has, Have anybody here actually tried to play this? Invincible fans here. Hello, I'm here. Yes, this is where we meet. Um, I have, I, yeah. I was like, I'm going to get Amazon for the Series 2 bit. And they're like, no. And I was like, oh, well, I, uh, uh. Oh, God, it's not worth it. <laughs> okay, you turn around so it looks like you're looking at the road. I'm looking at the road, sort of. Sometimes. I actually did, but I gave it up for 30 minutes. I tried it for five minutes. I might try it once the stream is over. Make any more video games after Systems Dominal? Uh, I think we made Pi Fight after then, which was a mobile phone multiplayer silly thing. Uh, but not since then, because we've just had loads of other shit on. I've been writing books and stuff. Mm -mm -mm. <clears throat> yeah, it gets automatic after one, you forget to turn. Yep. And I got ADHD, baby. <laughs> now you mentioned Invincible, did you like that? I'm enjoying it. Yeah, I really do like Invincible. My only uh, concern is. From watching the first half of the this new series, looks like they're trying to redeem Omni Man, and I just kind of want a villain who's a villain, you know. Quasi Plane five four two with five dollar rooms. Happy birthday to my favorite YouTuber for over a decade, man who introduced me as a child to the word cunt. <laughs> R.I.P. the jet engine six hundred decibel PC fan though. <laughs> I'm sorry, I told you the word cunt. Maybe took the word can't. Oh. Oh god, that's a mood. I just like I don't know. I like a good villain, you know? I feel like villain villainy is sort of being a bit redeemable villains, fine, I think that's interesting, but it's just a, a, it's a trope that needs like looking at. Because if your redeemable villain is like fucking Vegeta, who's like blown up entire planets, there better be some fucking angst in there. <laughs> And some real heavy redemption, otherwise it's just like a, you know, it's just a fucking guy in it. <laughs> just a prick. Uh, oh, we got there. Hello, Clinton! 67 months, that's almost a year. Uh, holy good lord, that's a long time, that is a long time. Hello, Dad, long time to speak, happy birthday. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I said cheesy chats resubscribed. I've said that a few times now. I can't remember. Um, uh, steady. Epic Store has the Atom Eve game free this week. Ooh, interesting. I might not own that. It was like a visual novel thing, wasn't it? Um, that train scene from Invincible kind of fucked up any hope of redemption. I'm, I'm hoping he's got no redemption coming, but we'll see. She was a great redemption, but Freeze and Cell War is beyond redemption. Have they tried? Like, I don't. I haven't watched any of Super, but I'm pretty sure they've tried to redeem Freezer. <laughs> that's like a thing that's been happening. But Vegeta, no, Vegeta did. He, 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 he you know, spoiler warning for a show that came that started in the 80s. Uh, Vegeta did end up uh, sacrificing himself in it to save the day, which is the ultimate sacrifice. Which sort of, kind of makes up for it. it. Made up for it enough that you kind of ignore it. <laughs> oh, Mr. Lurie's saying, are we there yet? Are we there yet? No! We've still got three fucking hours left. Then Max is going to go do a quick workout. On the on the treadmill! Go do a treadmill! Uh, uh, uh. What do you say to someone who you think needs to go to therapy but won't? <laughs> I've said many things. 
<laughs> I have said many things. Uh, my current uh, <laughs> this is not going to be helpful. <laughs> my current mood with the with uh with that is <laughs> fuck it. You die then. Um, no, I. Uh... <laughs> Yeah. Uh, my current thing is, well, I don't know. Next stream of Treadwall, I'd love to get a fucking Treadwall, man. Jeff Stocks a Treadwall, I fucking wish. Could use them to buy a Treadwall. Oh dear. Um. Yeah. I've actually been on longer road trips in real life, yet this is still the most painful. Because <laughs> it's just nothing. Apart from the fact that you will crash in. How long is it? Hang on, let's just hit the... Where is it? There it is. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Sixteen seconds! So every 16 seconds, and that's from the furthest left, um, if you don't interact with the game, you will lose. Pronounce Euclid. Euclid. Yeah, that word. It's Lily. Oh, hello there. From my book. I hope you're doing well. Thank you. I hope I'm doing well too. I don't know anymore because I've been doing this for so long. I'm fucking Eagles did. How do you handle bathroom breaks? I have a special device for bathroom breaks. Rebecca, mm -hmm. you're my special device. Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Can you do a bathroom speed run in 60 seconds? Rebecca, mm -hmm. do you think I could do a bathroom speed run in 60 seconds? 16 seconds. No. Do you think I could try it? Do you want me to try it? No. <laughs> Would you rather just play the game for a little bit? Me? Yeah. What do I have to do? Well, you don't now. I don't need to piss right now. But, like, you know, in the future. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Paris the Rogue says, No one has ever called their wife a special device and lived to tell the tale. <laughs> just stop and fix the steering alignment. Oh, unfortunately, it uh, can't be done. Fuck. Bath is around 16 seconds. Sounds messy. And Charles of Hell Divers plays vid. Yeah, probably at some point. I'm just waiting for it to. I'd I would like to bring Matt and John in on it, but I really do need to wait for it to. Couldn't even get the friends bit working to connect to friends, and I was like, you know what? No, I'll wait. I'll wait. Uh, 15 seconds per drift means you have to press it 240 times per hour. Total of 1920 if you go all the way across the road every time. I don't, I don't go all the way across the road every time, do I? Rebecca driving is something I want to see for a while now. Rebecca was driving an hour ago! Did you ever get invited to YouTube Rewind? <laughs> no, Jonathan. No. 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 I'm not what YouTube call, um... Marketable. They don't, they don't like the... Yeah. Just peer pants like the race drivers do. I'm not that cool. Can't pull it off. Cannot pull it off. But I've tried, but yeah. Nah, 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 nah. Hey, what are your feelings of chips with mustard? American mustard or actual mustard? Because I've seen Americans go, I really like mustard, and then they try Coleman's on TikTok and die. Um, <laughs> that's my favourite. That's one of my favourite. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. That's one of my favourite things on TikTok is watching Americans eat Coleman's mustard. Oh my god, on this topic. <laughs> Perfect, I mean pink stuff. <laughs> if you're American in chat and you eat American mustard, does it have mustard in it? Like does it actually have mustard seeds in it? Because I've heard I've seen so many of them go, Oh my god, what is in this? Does it have horseradish in it? Which I think is wild. Um and like I understand that it's got obviously that like sort of burning sensation, but Like when I pee. Right. And I appreciate that American mustard is obviously very, 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 very mild, but does that mean it doesn't even have mustard seeds in it? That's my question. Does it have mustard seeds in it? 
because then if it doesn't, how on earth is it mustard? <laughs> um, oh, oh, continent aerosologist says American mustard doesn't have mustard seeds. It's a mix between real mustard and sour cream or mayonnaise. Oh. But does it have... Oh, Wikipedia says it's made entirely with the less piquant, is that right? Yellow mustard seeds and a higher proportion of vinegar. So it doesn't have any of that mustard seed sort of burn that I would say is quite uh, significant. Like, if that's like mustard. It's fucking bizarre. It's diluted mustard, yeah, but like super diluted. I didn't think you would be able to dilute mustard seeds so much that you didn't get at least a little bit of that burn. Because that's always my confusion. Like, I appreciate that it's just a diluted version, but people asking, has, has it got horseradish in it? It's wild. <laughs> that's, that's, my, that's my bit that I just think is so strange. And obviously a lot of American food doesn't have, like, the th right things in it. Sugar, mostly. Yeah. Or corn syrup. Ah, uh, corn syrup. Thank you very much for answering my questions, chat. <laughs> but cheese at a spray can. <laughs> Jack, woo, 22. It says, hey there, my name is Jack and I've been a major fan since 2013. Can I get hello procrastinator and make my entire world? Of course, Rebecca. I I'm fine, thanks. Okay. Hello procrastinator, Jack. Woo, 22. There you go. You're the only one who's asked, you're the only one who's getting it. <laughs> It's like Kraft Cheese Singles, where the cheese is very plastic and fake, but people like it. Can I eat that as a vegan, do you think? Is there any actual cheese in it? Just ship that up here from Steak and Cheese. On a slightly related subject, ve Marmite, Vegemite, or Bovril? Right, Ronabout. I have Marmite and Vegemite uh, in my cupboard, and I am much more of a Marmite fan. Because Marmite's gooey. You put your spoon in it, gooey, like honey. Whereas Bovril's like a kind of, almost like a, a like a jelly. Like just a squidgy kind of jelly thing. What? You mean Vegemite, not Bovril. Yeah, sorry, Vegemite, yeah. I'm not listening to me. I'm glad somebody is. Um, anyway, yeah. Excuse me, it wasn't me. Um, sauerkraut with 35 euro bucks. I'm super upset. Oh no, the YouTube didn't send me the promised reminder. I love you, Dan. Happy birthday, kiddo. Thank you, Sour Crowd. Sour Crowd. Um, yeah, but I do prefer Marmite's gooiness. But I did buy Vegemite the other day because I wanted to try it. Um, uh, what we got? Massimo, Degrado did a sub to Cork, nearly a seventy-seven. What if knows? If knows. Oh, and we are at a hype train. Hype train, hype, hype train, hype train, hype, hype train. What does it taste like? What, Marmite? Marmite tastes like um, the darkest dreams made real with flavorings. Pretty good. Uh, it'll conclude, conclude Clinton. Uh, super, I'm gonna go, hello, procrastinators for free when I asked for one. It was a game that you promoted uh, on sides, I think. Oh, well, you part from the sides. What was that game called? Uh, oh god. Where you're like running around the, the 3D world but you're just a little man on the signs like the escape man. The exit man. I can't remember what that game's called. It's a fun way to describe my mate. It's pretty good. <laughs> my mate's vegan. Like, that's the good shit that is. Um, and a lot of salt. Yeah, that's what makes it good. Uh, Smithy3689 has subscribed. Hello Smithy. Welcome. Poppadoms or bread for what? Sandwich, poppadoms. To dunk into a curry, also poppadoms. <laughs> Marmite's the best fucking thing. It's the only way us vegans get P12. <laughs> yeah, no, it is. I cook with it, it's fucking great. Um, pop, 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 pop. Sally! I'm not coming out as trans to my mum until she goes to therapy, but I think uh, she'll be the last person to find out. She got the daughter she wanted. Lol, too bad. I do like that slightly anti-parental spite. <laughs> it's quite good. I'm so, well, you listened. 
What's that? Approximately 86,000 babies have been born since you started this fateful journey. What? In the bus? No, there's still just four of them. <laughs> oh dear. Hmm. If you want to go vegan, just get a cheese in calendar. That's what did it for Dan. I really did. They fucked up my inside so bad. I was so unwell. I mean, I play out for laughs, but like, I was, I was there going, uh oh. Something's gone wrong. <laughs> the game you're looking for is Pedestrian. That's what it was called, the Pedestrian. Yes. Oh dear, I can tell. I can tell you how it went down, like, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> oh dear. Actually, Rebecca. Yeah. You know, be really cool. Yeah. Um, because it's like my birthday stream. If you could get that Green Goblin hot toy, yeah. and you could show the box off on my webcam, wouldn't that be fun? Everyone can see it then, Just in the all its detail. Just the box. Just the box. I'll hold it for you. You can hold it for me, and I'm gonna open it. You have to get it in frame, though. It's probably the X-Men charcoal that fucks you up. Charcoal's a bitch. We're not supposed to eat it. Yeah, no, I've learned that fucking thing. Charge this. You've charged it! Oh my god, look what's been charged. That's right, it's the teeny tiny little games console. Is she trying to play it? Okay, wait, no, show off a hot toy first. My, my birthday present. Oh yeah. Are you ready? I see we talked about Disney Plus getting the Doctor Who trailer early. Yeah. I mean, I watched it immediately, so it was great. That was good. It was good. It was good. It was good. Oh my god, here it is. Rebecca, put it in the frame. <laughs> Come on. You said you wanted to. Well, I can't. I need to see the game. Darling. <laughs> darling. Sweetie, darling. Sweetie, darling. Thank you. What do you want? In the frame. Put it in the frame. Come on. No one can see it. In the frame. In the, in the frame. No, all of it. <laughs> <laughs> Get in there. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Move, move. No, I don't want to move. Oh. <laughs> okay. Huh? Oh, miss. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Alright, well, thanks, best friend. So that's what I've got for my birthday. Move, move. Okay. Wait. Uh, okay, well, that's what wait, I've got for my birthday. Is that. Wait, get out of the way. Okay. That's what I got for my birthday. Now. Okay, get out of the way again. Okay. That's what I got for my birthday. Is that a dog? Yeah. <laughs> It's just see Matilda. Hey, darling. How you doing, my girl? That. Yeah, I mean, it's not really in flight, if I'm told. It's, there you go. Oh, there he is. There you go. Well done. Okay, bye. Oh, okay, bye. <laughs> Love you, best friend. <laughs> Will we get to see it properly, I wonder? No, that was see it properly. Uh, should we have a look at this then? Hang on, let me get over the thing. So yeah, this is the Tiny Games console. Oh, up. I'm gonna see if I can play it. It's easily up. There you go. So I can see, I can choose what game I want to play. You see all the games are listed there. Actually, if I, I move it closer, you can actually see that all the games are listed. There's all the games that are listed. Uh, we could play tennis, time block, tiny blocks. Let's play a game of tiny blocks, shall we? Yeah. Start, okay. There you go, look! That. Little Tetris! Oh fuck. Do, 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 do. I mean, the camera's gonna blow this the fuck out, but. Do, 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 do. It's fully playable! It is a. Uh... How many. What's that grid size? Hang on, let me. Oh fuck, rotate, move. I'd say it's about five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten along? <laughs> oh, that's three, that's three. Yeah, about ten along. Full size Tetris! Do, 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 do. So when all you are going, Oh, why are you... Why are you playing the fucking... Tiny Playdate screen? This is what we used to do! This is what we used to play! That's the size! Thanks, my friend. Oh fuck, steady. There goes accelerate. Oh. I'm getting funky with it, ya! Uh. That's my alarm telling me I need to stream in 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Hit 
Hear me out, doesn't bustle in the Game Boy. There is a version on the Play Date, so. Just saying, it could work. By the way, have you heard of the new William Shatner documentary that's meant to be. It's meant to show the, the real Shatner, but the directors had to edit out 85% of his interviews for him to be likable. That sounds about right, yeah. That's a fun killer. Thank you. Uh, play three games at once. Well, currently, I've got a phone, I've got a Steam Deck. No, no, I'm super okay. I've got a phone, a play date, and that little thing. I can play five, four games at once. I only had a cam. Um, <laughs> run me over always. He's in the middle of the road. <laughs> oh, there they go. Oh, no. I uh, gifted five subs before I run them over. They went Alice 7123 to. Uh, what the fuck? To Unsung D3. To Dead Loke. To Westo 454 and to Man Solo. Ooh, fuck. There we go. Thank you very much. Run me over always. Uh, let's try over one of the pastors easy to rest for him. Yeah, well, so do I. Don't see me bitching about it, do you? As long as I watch you play Desert Bus without falling asleep. As long as I play Desert Bus 4 without falling asleep. Let's have a little nap. It's all good. How many Australians are still here, I think? Uh, well, the worst you say is 3 a.m. here, so that might be one. Uh, oh, wrong way! <gasps> I was reaching for pizza and I nearly fucked up. Oh. <laughs> Oops. It's fine. Rampant Fury with five Canadian dollaroos. I remember when you played the original 10 years ago. Is the original 10 years ago? Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Angus. 5636. Six, with 2,000 to release, says you get another 1,000 if you make eye to contact with the camera for 30 seconds. Oh shit, here we go. Are we ready? I'll count them by doing two of these. Go. I can blink, right? I'm allowed to blink. I'm going to blink. I am watching you through a camera. Ooh. Oh, my eyes are going weird. Oh, they're taking in too much light. Oh, I've got the wrong way. I can't see the screen. That is, I think that's too far. Okay, good. 30 seconds, there we go. Prolonged eye contact. Lick your lips to make it more comfortable. Comforting. Oh, my eyes have got really fucking weird now. Uh, because I've got loads of, like, <laughs> coloured lights behind it, so I've just looked at blinding coloured lights. Ah, oh, Angus with 3,000... A person of their word, Angus, with 3,000 more twiddlies. Oh, anybody else? I'll do any. You like fetish shit you want. Uh, sit on a balloon. Shit a cake out. <laughs> but Spiggy said so this has made me properly nervous. Please, no more. Imagine if I did the whole stream in perfect silence, just like this. Maybe not. <laughs> I think it's so much money that I was expecting. Give me a comic bit, I'll just out of 10. Nice. Can you break your mouth? Only if I put it on my bum. Then it comes out. Ba ba dum! Ah, ba ba dum. Yes. Um, I'll give you a thousand free to pack of charcoal cheese again. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Some people have said, this is so much better in awkward silence. Okay, let's just do a few minutes of this then. Hey, wait, I need to check one thing first. I need to check, A, that I'm in frame. Yes, because that is important. And to just want to see how many viewers leave. Here we go. Sorry, I had to see if that punk was still there, because I couldn't see it.
<laughs> so, my eyes got really weird. Staring on the cast got like dark screen, lovely dark screen, very bright lights. Anyway. Now this is content. <laughs> Starts your eye. Just tabs in to check out things are going. Jesus Christ! Helena Rose, Taunton, wait, Thornton Waybrew. I have clearly joined at a weird moment and I feel like that's about normal. This is a normal moment. I was just staring at this degree. Awful. <laughs> so I just said awful. Uh, live Nike reaction. Oh dear. <laughs> Point of view, the driver was judging you. Just being too loud. Look at them all. Oh, someone's gone. Ah. Oh. Bye. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. It's fine. Stop. Says Sally. Stop. Glad to see things are going well, though. I hope the journey back is just as fun. Oh, I don't know. I won't be on that one. Somebody else is going to drive that. Rebecca said that they're going to do the next eight hours. <laughs> Tiny little crumble pipe. Oh. Don't you hate it when someone jumps out of the bus at 60 miles an hour? That never happens on my watch. Because this fucking thing can only go 45! That's okay. I'll pay you just to sit and make horrid noises for the next hour. That's just called living with me. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. I think I left my kid at the next bus stop. No kids! They clash with my vibe. Sure, this bus has to be operational, but there must be a demand for it. But who? People who want to go from Tucson to Nevada? Las Vegas, I mean. Yeah, Las Vegas. Uh, maybe we'll see the Las Vegas sign. Maybe there's actually a Las Vegas sign in this one, because the other one just kind of ends. Maybe there is actually something in this one. Give my fucking nothing over. Really starting to get me in shape. Because it's just nothing. It's just every every sixteen seconds, press the button or you lose for eight hours. Do you think you'd be this chatty if you were actually a bus driver? Oh, I'd be asleep. <laughs> I wouldn't do this as a real job. He'd look at the mirror and just be going. Hey, hey. Micro naps. Sexy, dexty. Five Australian upside down dollar rules. Crazy happy watching you for 13 years. You are literally my childhood. Thanks for the laughs. Happy birthday to the best nerd in the universe. Aw, but it's not John's birthday. Oh, me! Oh, thank you. Thank you this is a weird version of speed. Yeah, it's called slow. Is it seriously getting brighter again? Is the sun coming up, do we think? I feel like it got dark for a bit, but I feel like it's definitely getting lighter again. Maybe we're going to see the sun. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Somehow this won't be as long as the crew road trip, but it feels 50 times longer. No, anything I do with John and Matt feels longer. Also, the crew road trip is fucking great fun. Yeah. Maybe not with that. <laughs> Dan, plays more Shadows of Doubt, please. Okay. I won't stream it, but I'll play it. Thank you. Oh, that's the asteroid that just hit over the horizon. That's just a polite pollution from Vegas. It's two hours away, but yep, yeah, it's lighting everything up. Oh, that's definitely getting brighter, isn't it? Must be some kind of Aurora Borealis. Aurora Borealis? At this time of year, on this strip of desert between Tucson and Las Vegas. Mm -mm. 
Our Hanker said, wait, how long ago was that run where Dan was on the Co-optional podcast? What well, felt like once a month. That's when I really got into Dan. I don't know. My brain says two years? <laughs> it's probably closer to eight to ten. Uh, uh, oh, time inspector! Daniel, darling, if you could travel with any doctor, with any TARDIS control room, what would it be? Well, definitely Matt Smith's control room. I'll go with Shuni. Let's see what he's up about. He looks fun. Looks nice. Looks like he cares. That's important to me. Um, your brain is wrong. Yeah, it did that. How did you meet Dad Cubed? Uh, it's a personal story. I don't want to go into it. Um, if you ever consider Rodina a road trip from one planet to another at docking speed, I could go around a whole planet in Rodina, but that would take quite a while. It's definitely getting brighter. I definitely think it's getting brighter as well. Here comes the sun, do 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 do, etc. Um, I remember being, I love being on the Corruption Podcast. I should go, that's what, that's another one I want to collab with. I want to go and do, um, chat with Jesse and Dodger. Because those two are doing the Geek Enders, and I really like that. It's really nice. I remember the control room in PlayStation Home. PlayStation Home. Was Stevie still alive when you were on? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's that out TV. He's a chat a lot. Hmm. Although we're old, we used to chat on Skype, sir. Oh yeah. We try making challenges when GTA 6 released. We'll see. We'll see. There's there's not enough information about GTA 6 for me to do anything here. Yeah. But that's the headlights could shine in further than five bloody feet. Why? Nothing to see. Apart from a bug, swerve it! No, it's fine. Uh, <laughs> I should message. Uh, uh, I said doggy. I think he said doggy because somebody put dodgy, and I was about to say dodger. My brain went doggy. <laughs> I'm tired. Yeah. Um, what is also Capaldi's writing? I, I, Capaldi's doctor. Sorry, Doctor Ryan aside. I thought the writing was good. It just wasn't the show I wanted it to be. I wanted it to be a happy bouncy show, and it, it wasn't. So I gave up. Skitty. Um, yeah. Have you heard about the issues with the Tesla Cybertruck? The headlights blind oncoming drivers. Yeah, that sounds like... Tesla. Well, that's good, though, because it will warn you that this is, this is a Cybertruck coming. <laughs> and you should get the fuck out of the way. Eh. <sighs> Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Uh. Dan, if you were invited to no such thing as a fish, what would your favourite fact be? My channel's been going on for longer than Skyrim's been a game. I don't believe that. Do you believe that? Don't believe that. It's fucking sick and rock. My fact would be that dress was blue and black. I don't believe it. I see white and gold. <laughs> Um, I saw a Cybertruck in the wild a couple of days ago. I assume you were just like in a forest or something and someone comes crashing through. I can't drive! Help! Oh, oh, there goes the accelerator. I can't drive. Don't check the things. Me and Charles had less reboots in the Skyrim. Are we just? <laughs> How are we going to be bringing the dress folks? I, it's because the dress joke. I was reading a thing about it this morning, like an actual scientific paper on it this morning. And so it's in my head. Yeah. Ah. Dang, your channel's older than year seven, so possibly year eight. A channel will be in high school. And it will learn nothing. And that's fine. Cybertrucks are already starting to rust. Of course they are. Let's see Dan do Tom Scott's lateral. I just think I'd, I'd either be brilliant or stupid at it. I don't think I've got a middle ground with lateral. You know? You read scientific papers? No, I'm an idiot. Let me, no, wait, let me stick with the kayfabe. Oh, no, I'm a fool. <laughs> Why would I do that? Sometimes, you know, it's a treat. Oh, no, the accelerate trick's not working. I think whichever bit of the controller I'm using to wedge this down. Oh, no, I think it's giving away. <laughs> no! No, I got so many good hours out of this. Okay, there we go. That seems to wedge it down again. Um, how about being on only connect? 
I don't think I'm right. I don't, I'm not good enough for Ali Connect. Um, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. That's good. I'll have a go over. I'll have a good try. <sighs> I saw a thing the other day that the kids going into year 7 in September will be younger than GTA 5. That's fucking sick. That's disgusting. Damn, thanks you have started watching wrestling. The only complaint is I want all shows to end with the EastEnders theme. Just life hacker for you too. John Cena, a payback! I'm gonna get the belt off of you! Dun, 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 boom, 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 wrestling theme song. I'd love it. I love that shit. <laughs> Uh, hello everybody! Oh, there's four people again now. This is the night shift. Dear God, he's doing it again! I've been doing it for five hours, forty-three minutes now. Five hours, forty-three minutes. Hello, happy! CM Punk punches out Jack Perry. Slow zoom out to show the Thames as the theme plays. <laughs> yeah, but CM Punk will be pissed because a lot of those buildings are made out of real glass. So, um... Ah, <laughs> oh, dear. Have you heard the David Tennant's hosting a game show? Yeah, he's probably... He's popular, isn't he? Get those hosting gigs and stuff. <laughs> Five hours, 43 minutes. That's almost a year! Is there a VR headset you recommend for somebody who's spaced about 5 by 10 feet? Uh, I always just, I just like my one, but it's now more expensive. I kind of fell out of the, uh, the, the VR world because it's, um, all the really interesting stuff became exclusive for the, the Oculus, whatever the fuck it's called. It's not even called the Oculus anymore. The Meta Quest. And I just don't, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> you know, I'm like, uh, I'm not buying a Facebook thing. Driver, can we put the radio on? Yeah, sure. Uh, that's what all music sounded like at like one in the morning in in, in Essex. When I was a kid, I'd put the radio on because I couldn't sleep. It would, it would it'd be the people going, and in the Falklands there was a delightful amount of people who believed in this. And every other channel would just and then somebody got the mic. We got a call from What the fuck was that? Why was all that? Anyway. Um yeah. Oh, steady on. The <laughs> shipping forecast. That's not on at one in the morning. The shipping forecast is just stupid. Old man down. I was like a child when I used to listen to the radio. And now as an adult, I realise listening to the radio, which helped me fall asleep, was probably ADHD. <sighs> Who's your favourite character on Star Trek Voyager? And why is it the Doctor? Or Seven? Or Janeway? Fidget Snake, it's one of those three, because I think they're the only characters in Star Trek Voyager. It's not going to be fucking Chakotay, is it? Now, here's an idea. What if we have a character with absolutely no personality? Which Chakotay enters the chat? <laughs> uh, oh, dear. Um, how much you had to drink? Uh, three cans and two squashes. That's my... yeah. Um, anyway. Would you, would you rather spend a month alone with Matt or John? Alone where? Do I have opportunities to hide, say, let's say, a body? Um. <laughs> How dare you say that about chocolatey? <laughs> oh, good old chocolatey. We're going to have a character who's spiritual and Native American. Who are we going to hire? Someone who's made a load of shit up. Oh. Um, if you're alone, you don't need to hide the body. I'm only alone for a month. 
it's like a white room. I'd be like, uh, John did it, and it was, you know. Oh, I don't, I don't, I don't care. <laughs> They're as bad as each other. <laughs> oh, dear. Our driver is drunk. I'm not drunk. I'm nicely tipsy. On the sweets. Dan, did I miss the Cody Rhodes chat? Yep, Cody Swan, you did. I've even sung the entire theme song several times. Chat was going on. Whoa! It was really cool. Dan Peter says, I'll take that cake. Why didn't I read that one? It just popped up. Uh, Benjamin Karifus resubscribe! Turn down for free to just say Ben rather than the whole username. Ben Keith. But it's funny words. I remember being shocked when you started drinking. Start drinking. Do you think Cody will win? Yes. I legitimately think my entire future happiness is based on Cody winning. <laughs> I thought you hate the smell of alcohol. Yeah, now we're drinking alcohol. I've had a Fanta. Uh, I've had another Fanta of same flavour, and I've had a Tango. So that's what I've been drinking on stream. <laughs> it's a melon Tango, though. So yeah, I don't. I don't like alcohol. What's the plot to this game? So in 1964. A man named Derek Tucson named a city after himself. And we're driving there. It's called Las Vegas. It was a very bad speller. <laughs> there's a mango tango. I mean, there's a mango tango. I mean... Uh, if Kurt doesn't win, he puts himself back in the AW problem where he can't challenge for the title again. He, it's wrestling. You could literally... You go, I'm never challenging you for the title. Then just do a heel turn and be like, Yeah, well, fuck that. <laughs> Maybe you don't like Prime, but what about Cred? Oh, I've got all the all the Cred. All the Cred flavours. All the Cred flavours. And I am a fan of uh, Randy's OnlyFans. That episode was so funny. I found his cock being out the entire episode to be genuinely hilarious. What happened in my head you drank? I feel like seeing behaviour and assuming alcoholic uh, influence is valid in fairness. Yeah, no, I, I, I don't drink. I got really stressed once and I had like a sip and it was like that bit where Marge drinks wine. <laughs> like a tiny glass. I was like, I just this will this will make me feel better. And it did not. Um, it was like when in the... Uh, what's his face? Oh my god, what's the episode that my mind is blanking on classic Simpsons knowledge? Scorpio! Hank Scorpio! When she has the... She, the house does everything itself. It's got like the electronic mower and sprinklers and stuff. So she has a little glass of wine. And it just goes, dun 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 dun! I swear you said Budweiser. Like, yeah, I'm taking a piss. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. No, no, I don't. I had like one drink once. I was like, nah, actually, this is probably a bad sign. I should probably stop the work. That's like, hey, just go now. Do you ever mix Fanta drinks? No, you can't mix drinks. You get drunk. That's what I was always told. <laughs> you get a lot of highlight video of this. No, <laughs> I'm not bothering you edit this shit. I did The Simpsons, great, yeah, but no. <clears throat> Um, can you use an analog input for constant steering? Uh, I don't know if that's going to... Look, even the tiniest little flick, and it's... Oh, ready? Full power. You see that? Uh, it's really hard to show. Ready? Tiny little push. Full power. No, you can't do that. No, it's just on or off. There have been so many highlights, though. Yeah, but I don't want to go dig them out. It's just constant noise. Maybe I'll edit that, I think. Make Matt edit it. No, God, I wouldn't want Matt to edit AI, so this is going insane. This is still going on. It's been six hours. It's been five hours, 52 minutes. <laughs> I feel like the boss is just doing this, aren't I? <laughs> anyway. Um, if playing games at home is your job, then getting drunk uh, always... Be is getting drunk being drunk at work? Yes. Are you watching AWADM? Uh, no, I'm streaming right now. <laughs> Several legends of some bloody kisses from the back of the bus. <laughs> I 
Oh, <laughs> okay. I don't know. You blind me there. Uh oh, uh oh, the oh no! Why is it spinning? Ah! Oh god! Wait! It's stop! It's stop! Responding! I'm almost sad. Why is it just rotating? Zebra! What have you done? Why is it just rotating now? Oh my fucking god! What is this? What is this? What's it? Oh, why is my? Uh, ah. Okay, I've unplugged my controller. <laughs> Out. Okay, so now we're on a keyboard. Uh... <laughs> Her head starts. If your bus driver's head starts spinning around in circles. Oh, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay, now we're good. We're back. We're back. I now need to rearrange the camera because I have to sit forwards now. Because that was... I had to unplug my controller. I'm going to try and plug my controller back in. I hope it doesn't just fuck me up. Because I really would rather the controller for this. Go. Fuck. Fuck. Okay, now we're back. <laughs> Woo! Oh, dear, oh, dear. I don't know what happened there. Just the, It stopped pulling in uh, from the controller entirely. Not even steering. <sighs> Glitch cloth. Glitchcraft just raided the channel. A glitch, you see? I bet they did it. Hi, hi, uh, Glitchcraft people. I just, uh, got possessed by Satan for a brief second. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, we're back. We're back, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back, we're back. It's a forward camp. Oh, no, I need to get back in the position. We good. Yeah, we good. Um, the Mayday Mother's Day thing has got part of my regular speech because of moments like that. Did I say Mayday Mother's Day? I don't know what I said. Your phone call is like your, it's, your camera is like a phone call with every boomer. No, I find because it's like two people in a vertical thing, so this is how much you see of them. It's the side of the head. Okay, good. That was really, we really nearly lost then. That was, that was horrifying. Whoa, didn't like that. Didn't like that at all. Oh dear. Look, did you see my great gaming skills though? My reactions, just jump on the keyboard. Boom. Steering while, <laughs> while it was spinning. Oh, blimey O'Reilly. Blimey O'Kyle O'Reilly. What do we do if you crash? Start again. I don't know. Have you made desert bus tents? Well, my controller just started spinning out. It just went, ba -doom. Run me over always says, I highlight my message for fun. Oh, uh, dear. You need to cut back on the fan or I'm seeing shit. Maybe I was just spinning in my chair. It's part of the new bus mechanic. Next time you need to run better. <laughs> Lengths of the bus. Uh dear. Would you wait for it while it drives you back? I mean, I would wait until the eight hour mark, but I would not go all the way back home. Um, that's how there's a bus for Hope Stream a few times. What, the spinning camera? Oh, uh, okay. Oh, I've got hair in my mouth. Blah, 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 blah. Who's that? That's mine. Uh, did I say the Woodicon has resubscribed? Because I have now. Alex loves Metallica. Alex loves Metallica with 200 twiddlies. Happy early birthday, Dan. Here's to watching you for 10 years. P.S. Hello, Rebecca. Hello. There it is. <laughs> um, Dan, just put the uh, Doctor Who trailer on the actual Doctor Who account. Disney getting a strong grip. I mean, good. I'm glad they're putting it on the thing. Should we watch again? Maybe there'll be differences in the text. Holy crap, you're still alive. If you've only just come back, Mixer Collective, you just missed just very nearly not being alive. <laughs> I was a half a second away from completely writing off this run. It's a very Disney trailer. What? Very Disney princey. I agree. I'm going to go on my phone for 10 seconds. Oh god, what happened? You had to be there. Uh, <laughs> basically, I got accidentally possessed and blah 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 blah. Anyway. A bum bum. A bum bum. A bum bum. 
We should have Fallout 4 companion. Dog me. Dog me. Um, uh, yeah. Lovely dog. No, I like what's her face. I can't remember her name. The, the Irish punching girl who does the good old Irish punching. Dan's head was spinning. Now he's talking in tongues. My, I literally, my throat is fucking hurting now. This is, uh, yeah. I don't think I can do many of these longs anymore. Kate, that was it. Yeah, from the stream. I like Kate. On the on the Doctor Who channel version is longer because I shoot you telling me to marry him. I mean, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Don't forget. Irish Punchy Girl sounds like a webcomic. <laughs> yeah, it's a spin-off of questionable content. <laughs> potato, wait, Potato says I just had to clean over 30 copies of Shrek 2 off my desk. I don't feel like that's clean. Like, just move. Were they making your desk dirty? Just melted everywhere. Um, Irish punching girls redundant phrasing. I've never met an Irish girl who didn't punch me. I think that's on you. Um, but you know, Fallout Four Becky Lynch one. I mean, essentially, yeah. Think about it. She's just Becky Lynch, you know. If she was a Scottish punching lass, ah, oh! I mean, the death glory enough. <laughs> Six hours in. Don't stop believing. I've got legs. Foot reveal at hour seven. No. <laughs> to, you know what, right? You could give me a million twiddlies. I'd have to get my foot up this high. That ain't happening. That ain't happening. Oh, dear. Stop reading while driving. No. I stop believing. You shouldn't. You shouldn't. You shouldn't. Anyway, you motherfuckers in the chat, ask me questions. Keep me going. Two hours left. What you got? It's your chance to talk to me. Is my bus driver singing right now? Yes, crazy monkey. Singing don't stop believing. I think my girlfriend qualifies as Scottish punching lass as well as the rogue. I mean, I'm just jealous. Um, you're not Scottish, you're just a punch. You don't even a lass. You just hit stuff. <laughs> I got a, a northern like biting envy. <laughs> a, you know that sounds like a type of bird, doesn't it? Yes, the northern biting envy is a lovely little thing with a big beak and <laughs> Thoughts on Yuzu going down. I have no idea what that is. Any advice for not living in your home country? Learn the language. I couldn't and it was fucking difficult. Who's the current Prime Minister? Back where I, I have blanked on the name of the current Prime Minister. Rishi Sunak. <laughs> Rishi Sunak, yes, I remember that. There's no point learning their names now, is there? <laughs> oh, it's the switch emulator. Oh, I thought it was like one of those drinks you mix with milk. Um, that was Yazoo. Uh, it was a milk drink, wasn't it? Um, uh, I don't really. Uh, yeah. I think. Emulating a current console is legally iffy and Nintendo can do what they want to protect their sales, etc. I think emulating a console from five, ten years ago that's out of, like, just doesn't exist anymore, fucking feel free. So it's in the thing I'm like, you know, eh. I can understand everybody's side of things. And it's hard. What games are you looking forward to playing this year? New or just in your backlog? Uh, I'm going to be playing Cheer again when this fucking stream ends. <laughs> I kind of want to do another round of Baldur's Gate. I did try it on the Steam Deck, but it was just a little too noisy for me. So I think oh, I just I wanted that size and scale, so I'd like to play some of that. Um, I feel like so many people in chat ask you young person questions and forget your you. Thank you. Would you ever do Comic Con? Ooh, too many people. I don't like people. Do you remember Jeff the Shark? Jeff the Shark is referenced in Saturday's video. <laughs> so the Dalek. Why do people assume I've thrown a Dalek away? It's there. Look, I'm pointing at it. It's there. It's fine. It's currently got four uh, cuddly toy doctors on it. Borders Gate 3 is in a great small screen game. Yeah, it just feels too big. You know? New Ghostbusters came out today. Are you going to see it? Nope. There's a question for you, Rebecca. 
Yeah. Says, how's life with this menace? <laughs> it's good. <laughs> you sure? For the most part. For the most part, I'll take it. How long's the cabbage for PM for? Forty something days, was it? Penny Mord? No, wait. Not Penny Mord. Don't she didn't become. Rebecca, I think I have dementia. Theresa May, no. Are you trying to think of Liz Truss again? Liz Truss! God, that's a name that is fucking hard to remember. Jesus Christ. I don't need to remember that name. But in my head, who's the Prime Minister? It's good old Queer Harmer. He's my, he's my man. I vote Queer Harmer. <laughs> Keir Starmer, Keir Starmer. Sorry, Keir Starmer. That's his name. The, uh... Liz Trust was Liz Trust is my friend. You don't flee back when she's given the tri the like the award. It's like now don't fuck it up and she picks up and immediately drops it and it shatters everywhere. That was Liz Trust but with the economy. <laughs> it's like, okay, we give you this, she's like, I'll be fine. Well fuck! And she just ran out trying to get a new economy. <laughs> oh dear. Anyway, um any advice as a homeowner? I'm, I'm a homeowner? Rebecca, we're homeowners! Call the landlord, tell him to fuck himself! Oh, oh god, my fucking engine just went out again. Come on, stick. Oh no, that's not gonna stay down anymore, is it? No. Oh, come on. So what I'm doing, I don't know if you can see. Ugh. Lift it up, lift it up, make sure I've got steering. It's got a little switch back here that controls how much you have to press this, how much you have to press this to make it fight. It's like for quick trigger reflexes, but what I'm doing is I'm pushing it down with pressure so it sticks and it holds the button pressed down. Oops. Queer Harmer, yeah, that's what I call Kirst Harmer because it's um, absolute fucking insanity when it comes to a lot of its policies. Better than the Tories isn't better. Uh, <laughs> it's, it's just not much better. It's definitely better, but not much better. But honestly, I'll take a very slight amount better knowing that there's flaws we got to keep an eye out for than more Tories. Yay. I just, I do. Like, my, my logical brain is like, don't you dare vote for the Labour because they've become a shadow of them for myself and they're essentially just a centre, even centre-right party in a lot of their things now. And they're just talking shit. Keir Starmer will just repeat the last thing someone said to him. And the other part of me goes, I wanna fuck the Tories. Lowest vote forever. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's it. Um. Can you still do board game videos? I have, uh, and I hate it. We did one and I hate it. Uh, hey, it's ads. I've done actually. I've done a few now, but again, I really dislike having to set cameras up. <laughs> I really do. I just hate it. I just hate doing it. It's a horrible thing, and I hate working with lights and oh, it's all bullshit. So I don't bother. Yeah. Um. <laughs> hey, <laughs> you. Okay, now <laughs> went off the road. Thank you, best friend. Who was the Prime Minister when the Queen passed? It's going to be an amazing question. Rebecca, who was the Prime Minister when the Queen died? Was it Liz Truss? I don't know. <laughs> My biggest issue is I can't actually remember when the Queen died. It was like a year ago? It was over a year ago now, wasn't it? It was Liz Truss. Oh, there we go. Where did that bug hit the windshield? About three hours ago. What game needs to be remastered, remade, remade, rebooted? Um, just give me a really like high quality version of Voyager Elite Force, but for next generation. The Queen died? This has been, been Ben Jerokeefe! We've just pronounced wrong now, instead of saying Ben. You get that and fix your headlight fluid? Uh, it's evaporated in the desert. Favourite robot for the Robots reboot? Razor. <laughs> I mean, it didn't do very well. I like Carbide though. Carbide was fucking horrifying. Uh, scary. There is no Queen of England. And now the King has a lot. <laughs> uh, 
And now the king has an enlarged prostate. Says over a billion. And I was going to make a joke. But I decided against it. <laughs> I'm being very good. I'm being kind. It's all good. Anyway. Anyway. I don't, I don't, I don't, the royals is the thing I don't pay attention to, because it was like, <gasps> the queen's died, and we were like, oh my god, we have to immediately go out and clap for the NHS, isn't that right? <laughs> no, I, we just went, oh, okay. <laughs> that was my, yeah, that was my thing. Um... <laughs> uh, Dutch Vandalam! Hang on a second, you should be in the past! I want to add you on GT Online. I haven't played GT Online. And can I play GTA 5? No, I don't think I've got about GTA 5. I'll probably play 6 at some point, but you know. VHS DVD, Blu ray, digital. Blu ray! Boo -doo -doo -doo. Where's the sun? Here comes the sun! Doo -doo -doo -doo. Hey Lily, Lily's looking very cute today. Um, I forgot about clap for the NHS. I'm pretty sure nobody in this chat clapped for the NHS. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Uh, Kate has resurfaced. She has cancer. Oh wait, I wasn't supposed to read that out loud. You can read that loud if you want. I thought that was like a breaking news that. thing. Yeah, she has just said it. Oh okay. Why does she badly Photoshop herself then? What's with the? I don't understand the PR, right? It's not the. It's not Webb's Kate. It's like, yeah, she's doing a thing. Like, who gives a fuck? Like, it's just how badly they handled the the PR. You know when, like, after, after the whole pizza thing, Prince Andrew um, fired his PR team and started doing his PR himself, and that's when he did that interview. Do you reckon he was running all the Royals' PR now, <laughs> with how badly they handled it? <laughs> Uh, so I, 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 I owe uh, Mike Biddle some money because we made a bet after our most recent podcast and I said that um, her disappearance aligned really closely with Balladro, uh coming out so I just assume she's playing loads of Balladro. <laughs> uh, oh dear. I guess the Photoshop was to keep the public calm. Public weren't worried. It was breaking news over here in the US. It popped up on the TV. Oh my god. Oh my god. My partner's NHS worker. You better believe I clapped. Clapped them cheeks, am I right? I don't... I don't... I don't... I don't like those weird gestures that people do. Oh, yeah. The sun was worried. The sun's worried about a lot of things. It's such a... The sun is such a weird newspaper. It's like, as a child, I'm like, I'm gonna read the news! Okay, first I have to look at these tits. And that, hmm, is that, is that how we get into that? What's happening? Anyway, Steezy, five dollar ruse, I've watched you for at least ten years. That's how long this fucking stream's been going on for. Thank you for being such a big part of my life. Whether you knew it or not, I did, I'm outside your window. Hi, I'm watching you through her camera. You've got us on camera then. Um, still not disproven, she's playing Palatro. <laughs> Oh dear. Um, I thought the royals were appointed by God. How can they get cancer? Well, fucking Jesus was appointed by God. He only lasted like 30 something years, didn't he? <laughs> That's a great many issues of the sun you cannot own without being on the list. Yay! Sarchify says, Dan, favourite drag queens. Rebecca, answer for me. <laughs> Daniel likes uh, Trixie Mattel and Katja a lot. That's my two. They're my girls. Trixie Mattel and Katya, I just love this this show. If he can lead you to it, he can lead you through it. <laughs> I watch that every time it comes up. <laughs> oh yeah, no, they're my they're my absolute favourites. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, anyway. That's good, that's good. 
Uh, hi, I'm back from watching the chase. My dad, did anything happen? Were you here for the possession? I was possessed. Not kidding, Craig. I got possessed. Any drag kings? There's someone who dresses up as Ned Flanders that Rebecca showed me the other days. So I picked them. <laughs> I picked them. It was fucking great. They even had like uh, a tea, like a, a show accurate. Uh, feels like I'm wearing nothing at all ski uniform. It's absolutely fucking brilliant. I show Daniel Drag Kings all the time. You do, but that was my favourite one. <laughs> absolutely my favourite one. How long have you been streaming? There's a clock on the screen. Six hours, 15 minutes so far. What's the worst console game you've ever played? Ooh, that's a good question. Uh, right to have retribution. That's not a good question, because that came on consoles, didn't it? The highlights finish me 20 second clip exorcism. Is he using an actual wheel? No, I'm using a controller. I'm here, I'm right here. Wait, possessed? I only missed six hours. Yeah, I got possessed a little bit. Yeah. It was scary. When do we get down in drag? I have already performed in drag in my life before. That's a true story. <laughs> uh, when I was, uh, I was in primary school. Yep, yeah, there you go. That's what primary schools used to be like. Um, the Nifflinus Drag Kick video is incredible, right? How good's that? Uh, ba -ba -ba. There's no clock on the screen. There's one there. What do you think those numbers mean? Do you think I'm driving to hell right now? Does, is that a little giggle? <laughs> <laughs> I'm on the highway to hell! Pew pew! Via Toussaint. Uh, 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 uh. I thought you went to a Catholic school. I did. Catholics are fucking weird. I mean, they go to a big dusty room and listen to somebody in track every fucking Sunday, so, like, you know. Oh dear. Um, how much your fingers hurt right now? Uh, well, since I stopped holding down the accelerate button, uh, much better. Much better. Opinions on Jesus has run me over anyways. He can lead you to it. He can lead you to it. That's my opinion on Jesus. <laughs> uh, Jesus was alright. I'm quite a big fan. I like some of the stuff he said, it was all like, you know, sometimes I like slalom around the dots. It was all like, don't be a cunt. Why not Desert Bus in VR? This is in VR. I'm just holding my head very still. Um, yeah, it's just all don't be a cunt, stuff like that, so it's good. Oh, Rebecca's here, hello. Ah, oh, Rebecca's made a tiny bowl of ice cream! Show the people! Oh. Ooh! You should stream building those things. No! Yes! Yes. What? Can't see those at all. I can't see those at all. Why well, you have to put them on the Discord? Put them on the Discord. <coughs> Coin, OP Drifter. Dan, you beautiful man. I've been watching you since forever. I didn't know practically share birthday. Hope you have a great happy birthday. Thank you very much. Um, why is it only ever like men that flow with me? There's just on the internet. Just a question. Have I only got like this queer audience? Because like I'm just so dashingly attractive to exclusively gay men. I think I, I, I got like a genie wish at some point and it went, it's gone wrong. It's like, I wish to be very attractive on the internet. And they're like, suddenly, to people that you have nothing, that you have no connection with. Oh. Yeah. As a gay man, yes. Back shoot, shoot, shoot. See? Anyway. Uh, did I say LP Phillips has resubscribed? I think I did. Uh, but I have definitely done that now. Timberlay with 100 trillies. Adam, 670 plays this year. Gonna watch the play that goes wrong. Come from away. And the Fulty Towers play. Which also sounds like a play that goes wrong. Uh, enjoy your plays. More like, no Q plays, am I right? That's a trans woman, not just gay men. I'll, trans woman, fuck. <laughs> I'll take that. Yes. Can it. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe that's the long con. I'm like, none of the women want me. I will make my own women. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
It's a very clever ploy. I think you'll find. <laughs> um. Anyway. Uh, <laughs> Mixing council, just because I remember myself. Quick self care, but reminder drink some water, eat some food, take your meds. Rebecca, have you taken your pills? Thank you. You're welcome. Look after yourself. I, I'm playing Desert Bus. I'm not looking after myself. But yeah, as a straight woman, I think you're handsome. Rebecca, it's happened! <laughs> Rebecca! Get my camera! <sighs> this is the best day of my life! Thank you, JLo Ducky. <laughs> uh, dear. <laughs> Catfish. Damn! Um, Great Frank, what's your favorite video you've ever done? That's uh, the Saturday's one. I don't know if it's my favorite, but it's fucking funny. Um, I, always, I love that Destiny 2 video, I really genuinely do. After 35 years, finally! A woman likes me! Dun, dun, dun. Um, as an nice MP, you have nice hair. Thanks. Hi, best friend. Hello. Straight woman says I'm handsome. Are you gonna fight them? No. Oh. Fuck. Uh, yes, you want to one. Five dollars. Happy birthday, Dan. Question: How is that cube doing? Will you do any videos in the future? Ah, uh, that cube is enjoying retirement, and at some point. There may be some more things. We will see. We will see. Um, you're welcome, hon. <laughs> oh, it's so... Just the... It's just, yeah. How many am I going to attract? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I, I'm married. It's fine. I'm fine, isn't it, Rebecca? I'm fine. I don't cry about it ever, do I? I'm a big boy, aren't I, Rebecca? Big boy. Big boy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tashina Roberts on YouTube says, Make that two straight women! Rebecca, I've got two straight women! Good for you! Rebecca, you probably got more straight women. No. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh, Alright, where we go. How's it with Blackberry these days? I have no idea. Uh, I haven't spoken to him for absolutely ages. Um, but I, from what I've seen, from the last time I spoke to her, things uh, seem to be going very well for her. So I hope she is having a wonderful fucking time and grand success in all of her endeavors. Yes. Um, have you lived with any non-family that didn't end up non-binary? <laughs> An ex? But I haven't checked in on them because we broke up. So maybe? Yeah. I'm here for always. Says my straight woman girlfriend says you're a cool guy. That's not real. No, no, that's real. <laughs> no, no, that's real, is it? Nah. Nah. A hundred D. I've been watching you for over ten years now. Bloody hell. Uh, oh, that's for five dollars. Happy birthday! Thank you very much. Also, do you have any thoughts on City Skylines too? Yes, I wait for them to make it a playable game and then I will play it. That's my vibe. Um. As a straight man, I would. I don't think that's a straight man talking. I think that's oh no. I think maybe that stands for real superpower. Yeah, I've got the Midas touch, but for turning people. Okay. That's what. That's what I've got. Yeah, 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 yeah. The fucking I'm Medusa. I look at you and I fucking bam, turn to stone wall. You know. <laughs> Oh dear. <laughs> oh fuck me. Anyway, um, I played Dredge. Yes, I gave it a award last year, and there was a thingy video of it. I think it was in the free fab games. I like Dredge a lot. Wait, is it no kids birthday today? No, it's tomorrow. But the YouTube channel two days ago turned thirteen, so it's joint birthday. Woohoo! Uh, <laughs> I, I can't tell if Dad's enjoying this or not. I'm enjoying chatting to you. This is driving me literally fucking inside this bus. It's just a lot of having to pay attention, which is not something I'm very good at at all. Imagine the possibilities if you genuinely have that power. What do you mean genuinely? I do have that power. 
yeah, the passengers are all fine. They're still just there doing their thing. Um, <laughs> Dan, if you're in Robot Wars, which builder, George Francis, Simon Scott, etc., would you ask to guide you in building your machine? Uh, well, fucking George Francis. You made chaos too. You are a god. George Francis, you are a god. What's up the hub? We're almost at hour seven. Ah, oh, it's nearly there. We're nearly there. We're nearly there. Why don't you just speed up? Off the bus. Go on, you. Off the fucking bus. Because it's locked at 45 miles an hour. <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. What's your favorite your YouTube series? Ah, oh, I like the new plays. I like the weird shit. I do like this new run of plays videos, though. Because I think it's good shit so far. It's good shit. Excuse me. Aqua Alford. Says, hey, onto the bus driver, bus driver, bus driver, hey, onto the bus driver, bus driver, Dan, I nearly crashed then. A lot of people ask me what the purpose of this game is. Just gotta drive for eight hours in a straight line on a bus that slowly veers to the right. I think we all agree we want possessed Dan back. <laughs> he should plug control back in. I have got the control back in. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Um. Anyway, 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 anyway. Wait, where's the ice cream? The ice cream's gone. <gasps> oh, fucked it. Nearly fucked it. We're still accelerating. Still accelerating. Everything's fine. My throat stuff goes on. I need to eat something. What's this? This is a bar of double chucky crisp snack bar. Oh, and it's a buttermilk, so it probably goes about 45 fucking pounds. Uh, dip cheeses for five pounds. Happy birthday for tomorrow, Dad. Thanks for helping me become who I am. Uh, and I've been here for so long now, I'm trans. It comes for you all eventually. <laughs> <laughs> Eventually, you just all <laughs> come. Yeah. You don't have to be gay to work here, but it helps. Ow. Oh, I thought I was going to be twitching. It's very tough. <laughs> Is there an option for the bus to veer to the left? I want to align my political views. No, it's like this is the center, and the world slowly drifts to the right. You put effort in, and you can bring it to the left. And then it'll slowly drift to the right. And then idiots do that! <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Mm. Can you drive in real life? Yep. Not for very long. I've driven car, haven't I? <laughs> I guess. What do you mean you guess? You were in the car when I drove it. Is it driving really in the way that they're asking? Did the car move forward under my propulsion? I mean, slightly. Driven. <laughs> oh dear. So silly. No cube, say hi please, I beg! Says dolphins are us, but they, they stopped. They begged and then they stopped. Welcome to the dolphins! Welcome to the dolphins! You do this again, Daniel? Yeah, but I've got an hour and a half left to go. Oh god, I need to just quickly leap forwards. Oh my god, my ass hurts. <laughs> oh fuck. Okay. Oh Any advice for someone wondering if they're non-binary? Not from me. Rebecca! You're in the stream a lot, I've decided. <laughs> Hope you're having a nice time. Hi. Hi. I'm not really sure what to say, if I'm being honest. Ow. I don't know, whatever you feel like. If you if you feel like that, you can say you feel like that, and then if you change your mind and you're like, actually, I don't really feel like that, then you could do that too. Yeah. You could just float around and just see what feels comfortable and what feels right and what you feel like. Oh, wait a minute, this is the more accurate version of you. But nothing's permanent. Yeah. Yeah. Just kind of wait and see, and test and see. I mean, not wait and see, like test and see and see how you feel. And yeah, use the words, use it. the lingo, test it. <laughs> see if it's fit, see if it feels good. See what the mouthfeel of it is. <laughs> I've got the shirt, sorry, my fucking shirt. Do you think that bug and that windscreen wiper there on the right looks like the the Da Vinci painting of God and the man pointing at each other? 
I think I've been playing this game for too long. <laughs> yeah, yeah, me too. Yeah. Creation of Adam, innit? Yeah. yeah. Does anybody else see Creation of Adam in that? <laughs> no, no, but no, no, I definitely see Creation of Adam in that. <laughs> Oh dear. Anyway. Back in that bug is super dry and crispy by 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 by, by, by now though. <laughs> well yeah, it's, so is the painting. Sure, I could also see Rebecca wearing. Oh. Just realize if you could use the wipers they wouldn't reach. Yep. That's why it went. Sure, Dan, we can all see it. Yay! <laughs> Outside of this bus is an air fryer. Oh, yeah. That's delicious. What if there's a bug to speed run? We'll have to complete the game without getting a bug. I think you can dodge the bugs. I think they just happen. I didn't see this one happen, it just was there. I think in the original game, it actually had like a. Uh, it fly close to you for a few seconds. No luck with Matt and John this time around. No, great luck with Matt and John. I didn't invite him. <laughs> One and a half hours left to go. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's fucking go. How does it feel that so many people have grown up watching you? It's a weird feeling. It's definitely a with great power comes great responsibility thing. And I've always felt that need to not be a fuckhead. But that's when I got any audience. I always wanted to sort of be nice and kind. Yeah. Clearly found that. <laughs> Love this camera, probably said that's time and That's great. Thank you. <laughs> It was Rebecca, Rebecca said this last night, and I was like, that's fucking genius, and then it took me fucking three hours to try and make it work. <laughs> trying to crop it down and make the thing, no. Anyway. Anyway, what are your passengers doing? Sitting. In passengers. I think one of them just moves slightly. Like weeping angels, but they don't move. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, oh dear. Can the passengers hang out the side and wipe the bug off? I mean, that would be great. Oh, fuck! Um. What the fuck's going on? Sorry. <laughs> Tell it same time as Dad. Clock goes back one hour. No! <laughs> I can't do another hour. Wait, that's not gonna fa I'm going a distance, not a time. The time is just there. I actually am doing the distance, so don't worry about it. My birthday's close. It's on the 25th. <gasps> well done. Who's better, the rock or stone cold? At what? Chutney making, probably Stone Cold. I think he's got a good chutneying arm, mixing all the brown sugar together. They're aggressively passengering. Oh. One of them spat around. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Lucky Desert Bus takes me back. Takes you back to now. Take me home, country bro. To the place I belong. The weird and wonderful whites of West Virginia. <laughs> Is that where they're from? Yeah. Yeah. I remember that documentary? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, well, I was thinking slightly dangling off the edge. It's, so it's the worst, isn't it? Which is the worst to complete? Desert Bus or Simpsons Hit and Run? I think Simpsons. <laughs> I think that's the worst one. It really is just, uh... You're still here, dude? I went shopping. I did laundry. I had a nap. The bus only goes 45 miles an hour. I can't go any faster. Uh... Are you okay? I'm doing okay. I just need to have a... little... lie down. I'm okay. I'm back. Hello. <clears throat> Seems it's worse because it's endearing and hooks you until it doesn't anymore. Vaguely endearing. Oh, it's on the back. Oh no, hang on, let's not get possessed again. Just, just stick with it, stick with it. Wait for the sun to come up. The sun will be up soon. 
You going for 100% achievements? Uh, no. <laughs> I value my life too much. Oh, fuck. <gasps> Caught my finger then. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Anyway. Um, can we get a cookie clicker complete? No. No. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. It's still coming up. Maybe we'll come up in the last hour, you know? We could celebrate. Describe your world. Describe yourself in three words attractive, handsome, funny, attentive. Um, is there a game as boring as this that takes longer to play? Like a flight simulator? But that's like you're doing corrections that you can put on autopilot and stuff and... Yeah. What do you think about the overground lines? I think it's a stupid idea and they're called the fucking like... Women's football line and the fucking... Fucking... You know, Mumba Wumba line or what the fuck it was. Chumba Wumba line, that's it. Fuck, I'd love the Chumba Wumba line being a thing. Uh, the woke line. It's just renaming all the old lines. There's no goblin line, though. I mean, come on. Why would you do this yourself? You actually say this because I get to chat to some really cool people while I'm doing it in my head while I chat talks with me. Oh dear. My main issue right now, big DC bigs one says, I have uh, two kitties asleep on my lap, but I need food. Eat one of the kitties. <laughs> Problem solved. Oh, uh, dear. I wanted the Venga Boys line. That's one of the ones I wanted. Because then if the line wasn't working, you could have had the Venga <laughs> right replacement pass. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. So stupid. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Did you hear that Chumba Wumba line? What? It got knocked down? Oh, it's okay. It got back up again. Good. <laughs> Exquisite driving bus driver. My ticket is fake, by the way. Yeah, well, my bus driving license is fake. What are you going to do? <laughs> oh, dear. Sorry, I'm so tired. <laughs> uh, the sun will come up tomorrow. My accelerator just stopped again when I looked around. Oh, fuck. Come on, accelerate, you fucker. There we go. See you later, NH London. Enjoy your meeting. Spanish bus driver is psychotic. <laughs> as hilarious and possibly psychotic as this. Oh, dear. Imagine a gang from Mad Max uh, drives up and starts attacking the bus. I don't know, my wing mirrors don't work. How much do you reckon a company would pay someone to do this for you? Well, it's in America, so as little as they possibly can. You're too happy to be a bus driver. Alright, I'm going to get my grump on. Urgh. Yeah, okay. Um. Happy birthday, King! Absolutely legend! Thank you. Dove from above! <laughs> Oh dear, Jesus. What goal do you need to reach to do this in real life? I need to reach employment in Tucson. Wasn't the full road trip quite dull? I mean, maybe. How are the guinea pigs? They're doing okay! And they're here today! In the bus. That's what these are, they're my four guinea pigs. <laughs> One going ape shit is Reese. Um. 
We can run over at least three cyclists in the past 20 minutes. You're not really a bus driver. Not really a city bus driver. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, no, we're still going, we're still going, we're still good. What would it take to do a 24 hour desert bus stream? It would take a full fucking minute breakdown on my part. That's all it would take. <laughs> That's what it would say. How's he like? Uh, he got fed yesterday. Uh, has, has he like eaten? I think he's eaten one. He's only eaten one of his two mice at the moment. I don't know why. I think he's just getting a bit older. Um, I mean, you did your flight for twenty-four hours. Yeah, but that was all right, and it was only twenty. Ah, uh, you have guinea pigs? Yep, I got guinea pigs and budgies and dogs. And a snake and chickens. And a few rats that live under our deck. <laughs> we haven't named them yet. We haven't named the rats yet, no. Oh my god, the webcam! There's a car beat. Hello. Yep. 20 hours of playing, anything else is bad. Yeah, also, I was having a conversation. This is just me and you lot. I mean, and Rebecca every now and then chat stuff up. Does that, uh, having dead mice feel weird? Yeah, Limaka hate it. I absolutely fucking hate it. We are not going to be getting another snake. But Eli, we rescued him, so... You know. What are you going to do? We're going to buy them as ethically sourced as fucking possible. Uh, but yeah, I, I really don't like it. <laughs> How far are you the Tomb Raider uh, remasters? I got to the bit in Tomb Raider 2 where there's spiders and I put it down and I started playing Balatro instead. I was unaware there'd be spiders and it was like, ugh. Ethically sourced corpses. As e put down as ethically as possible. And you can tell that if you get rodents for your snakes and stuff. If they're all just like, in a bag, they were killed inhumanely. But if they're all laid down neatly, then they were killed and processed. You know, they just put them in a, uh, a, a chamber and they eat. It, I think they increase the amount of carbon dioxide in the chamber. So they get very sleepy, fall asleep, and then there's just not enough and they die in their sleep. And then they're all just like, they're in a bag and they're all perfectly neatly lined up. And it's fucking horrible, but that actually does indicate that they have been treated well. So. Oh my god, I just saw the mirror. <laughs> Hello! <laughs> Such a silly idea. Not live mice, right? No! Jesus Christ. Do vegans still whinge about you owning chickens? I am a vegan, and yes. Do you get a new animal every time you walk outside? Not all the times. Just most. But those rats found us. The rats found us. But we do have, we've just found two rats. Because Rebecca left the, we got a, I got Rebecca because they've got uh, autistic superpowers. Uh, a bird feeder with a camera in it, so you can see all the birds that came along. Uh, to eat out of our garden. And, um, uh, Rebecca left it on the floor a few nights ago. <laughs> Some rats eat out of it, but they're really cute. Because we, we, we knew we had rats because there's like um, holes and stuff where they've been digging through like uh, gravel and the composter and stuff. But yeah. Anyway. Um, do you get a sense of superiority when telling people you're vegan? No, I, I wish I did. It would be really nice. I just get a sense of sadness when I see how casually people eat meat and then I remember that I used to be like that and I'm like, ugh. Especially looking after chickens because chickens are the most disposable animal on the fucking planet. And you just you see how beautiful and lovely and full of personality these little creatures are, and I just go, I made some big fucking mistakes back then. So yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Dan's gonna come home with a few pigeons one day. We have a few pigeons named in our garden, and we've taken uh, one in called Skip. We named him Skip because he was uh, injured. We took him in and nursed him back to health. <laughs> uh, have you considered using that fan in front of you to propel it for extra speed? I considered it, but it stopped working a long time ago when I was trying that, so... Yeah. But uh, wait, if you have uh, uh, snakes, do not feed them live animals. Don't, don't fucking do it. Don't feed any animal live animals. Uh, it's A, it's really fucked up for the, for the mouse. But B, it, you literally, it could just kill your snake, and it's just fucking stupid and risky for everybody. So, yeah. 
Uh, we got some twiddlies and stuff. Boop, 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 boop. Veggie snakes. Did I read this one? First discovered non binary was through this community. Rebecca. No, I'm an MP2, so thanks for that. Rebecca's a virus. A virus of envyness. Cyberwolf, I realised I haven't said this on a stream yet. Very exciting, uh, my very exciting job, software engineers, turned to a dream job recently when the company noticed my artwork and I'm now getting paid to draw logos. Oh! Well done. Everyone loves them. Sent the final teams uh, over today. They're so happy. Fucking brilliant. Good shit. Good shit. Only good live food for insect uh, is insects, reptiles. Yeah, insects aren't really like alive, are they? <laughs> are they? Kind of. Uh, yeah, uh, you know, they do. Um, Eli Best Boy says Happy Spooks. Eli's Best Boy. Um, McCarby, hi Dan, hi uh, Rebecca, happy birthday. One question, why? Why what? Why this? Ah, something new for eight hours, isn't it? <laughs> um,. Oh, mealworms. God, we've got buckets of fucking mealworms in this house for the birds. Birds like mealworms. It's really fucking weird. Um, you definitely wouldn't keep spiders, would you? No, even if it came up. Would you like to rescue us? We, we don't say yes to every animal uh, that we've been offered to rescue. We were offered a parrot not that long ago, and we were like, oh, we literally can't because of the noise and they last for fucking ever we're like we literally there's just no way a parrot fits in with what we've got right now we'd have to get a whole new set of stuff for it and we're just like now we can't do that and we got chickens instead yay because that was what we were working towards I remember do you use oil when uh, cooking minced beef you should I, uh, I like use the spray ones that's the good one uh, down on a horse we have a dog to all ones you need at least two though uh, I don't want a horse, thank you very much. Uh, beauty will save us. Oh well. Uh, because horses are uh, nightmare creatures. They're, they are they're, they're big massive hunks of meat that walk on tiny little thin bones and then toenails. <laughs> and it's very weird. And then they explode. Um, cows, I'll probably get cows at some point. Probably rescue some cows, but I think for I don't know. I might get a horse. I think they're quite sweet. <laughs> I think well done with everything, to be honest. I definitely goats. Yeah, definitely goats. Um, but anyway. But yeah, I hope you, uh, your horse is uh, that you want to get adopted. Yeah, adopted and loved forever. Oh, uh, well, so I didn't read. Veg snakes is the vegan superiority complex, is pathway to many abilities, some considered to be unnatural. Goats are just precious. They are, aren't they? Um, we rescued four chickens, says uh, Lily Hausberger. Uh, we did not without planning to, long story. But we love them so much now. Yeah, we took in six just over a year ago. We've now got three. So we lost three of them to various illnesses. Well, two to fucking cancer and one to uh, uh, surgery. We gave, we gave, we spent a lot of money on that fucking chicken. Um, but we, uh, they all grew the feathers back. They were happy and healthy, and now we're going to uh, probably get some more. Yeah. Yeah. Have you seen the video of the pig cleaning his room on YouTube? Probably. I've seen a lot of videos of pigs. Pigs are cute. <laughs> My next neighbor has chickens, and we just throw our veg scraps over the fence and hear the chaos ensue. <laughs> oh, bless. <laughs> Although don't be feeding it without permission because they might be on special diet requirements and things like that. So be careful. Get permission before you throw shit at animals. That's me being an animal dad. Because, ah, fucking hell, we just found out that Lilith's allergic to beef of all fucking things, so. <laughs> when will you rescue a pig? When we can have the space. When we have the space for a piggy! We're going to get a piggy. Um. <laughs> chicken is a vegan. Yeah, but chicken eggs are, if you look after the chickens. Which is weird. My mum has an unhealthy obsession with rescuing chickens for battery farms. Last year we had two, now there's 24. Uh-oh. That's a real little mirror up to our future, Rebecca. <laughs> well, we had six, then we went down to three. 
we're going to go up to sort of eight, I think. But we're not going to that. Of course, I never asked to feed them. Good. Just making sure. Um, it's like there was a, a post on Reddit that really pissed me off the other day because it was someone who posted like there was a on like one of the casual UK subreddits. There was like a, a chocolate orange on the floor. Someone's like, oh, it's a really sad sight of seeing a Terry's chocolate orange on the floor. Pick it up! It's chocolate. It's so fucking poisonous to dogs. Like, if you find some chocolate trash on the floor, just pick it up. Because it's fucking horrifically dangerous to so many animals. Just pick it up and throw it in the bin. All right, you might get sticky fingers, but you'll fucking save an animal. So do that shit. Big vinnies, says Dan, my beloved. Hello. Does noise from next door affect the chickens, says Heavy Spooks? Um, we've had them. The, the, the noise has been going on longer than we had the chickens, so they kind of got ingrained into it. But considering they came from a battery farm, uh, I think even, well, just a fucking chicken farm, I assume that very loud building work uh, is equivalent to thousands of chickens and farming equipment making noise. Vittles! Did I say vitties or vittles? Vittles! Sorry, it's far away. I've barely got any fucking eyesight as it is. <laughs> hey, chickens, it's just a gateway drug. So I'll have you like four chickens. I love my chickens. They're so good. They're so lovely. Uh, we have four chickens outside. And we've got three chicks in a little pen uh, inside. Because they're too small to be with the big girls and not get pecked at. Oh, Bless them. Do you say anything controversial? Oh, I haven't said anything controversial yet. Come on, somebody give me a prompt to say something controversial. Come on, let's do this. i got to get a controversial ticket. Otherwise, is this even a fucking road trip? Welcome to the table. Friendly talk. Are you vegan, plant-based, flexitarian, Dan? I'm vegan. I was. I went vegetarian uh, after we lost Reagan because I realized that animals were, like, cool. Uh, which is something you just don't really consider because society's like, animals, eat them, fuck it. It's like, but this dog's really cool and pigs are like smarter than the dog and more emotionally aware than the dog so why are we eating pigs why are we eating anything um but i was like i'll still do dairy because you know it's a, you know they can fucking work for a living and the nations made me eat a cheese calendar and now stop eating dairy and then you find out that dairy is a fucking dairy farming's way fucking worse I just joined in the front seat i think i'm inside someone oh oh <laughs> oh they're still making out the front oh oh my goodness too hot for Twitch, too hot for Twitch. Oh dear. Oh fuck. Um, let's talk about whether the tornado cheated about Razor. You know exactly how I fucking feel that tornado of cheating against Razor. They fucking cheated and they should be fucking ashamed of themselves. What's your opinion on Reform UK? Is that what BMP, UKIP, etc. are flocking to these done? I don't know. It's there, isn't it? It's like a public service. Like one of those toilets that people do cocaine in. <laughs> um, yeah, anyway. Uh, what the fuck is the Ruby Gate? Yeah, I don't know. The current state of global politics. Oh, no. There we go. Uh, does this drive on the right or the left? The bus or me? I drive on the left. The bus is slightly to the right, like most video games. Uh, what do you think of The Rock going here? I'm not controversial, I'm really glad. I want Cody, I want Cody to win. Uh, uh. What are you drinking? Uh, it's another sugar-free Fanta. What does a house wear? A dress. Um, <laughs> uh, is it Reform UK further right than the Tories? Yeah, it just happened. They, there's always a further right than the Tories. Do you prefer Fanta or Tango? Uh, Tango Apple, Fanta Orange. I think they're good. I prefer Fanta Orange. If you put Fanta, Tango versus Fanta in the orange steaks, I do prefer the orange of the Fanta. Yep. You excited for the Acolyte in June? No, I don't like Star Wars very much. There's my controversial opinion. Opinions on video game piracy. If you're pirating a game on the day it came out, uh, you're one of the reasons that games are now super monetized. Um, one of the reasons. There's many. Um, if you're pirating like old shit from an abandoned console that you can't even buy anymore, you're just keeping old games alive and bless you. Bless, yeah. 
Uh, you're still going. How many times are you going to do this before we finally get the ship community play? We'll get it at some point. Do we have Tango in the States? You fucking better. You fucking better. Uh, what else we got? What else we got? What else we got? What else we got? Ooh. Ooh. The rock song, you're welcome, very seriously. And it was awesome. It was! I quite dread that. <laughs> Oh dear. Have you seen Rebel Moon? Yeah, it was fucking awful. Uh, <laughs> oh dear. Devil Cyborg has resubscribed! That's what you had a message with that as well, yeah. Uh, Timberlake says, I'm Dan, I'm now eating Tesco salted caramel hot cross buns. Not hot tick buns. Thoughts on Dragon Dogma 2 release? Well, the reviews made me go, that's interesting. And then the release made me go, I'll pass on that. So, there you go. <laughs> Probably sum that one up. Ashen says, Merry Birthmas! A chance! Fun fact about me and Ashen is that nobody else in the world, know, world knows. We uh, talk about Marvel Snap quite a bit. <laughs> there you go. There's, there's my big controversial bomb for this stream. Yeah. We play Marvel Snap. <laughs> What's a movie that's considered a classic you think is massively overrated? Most of them? I mean, the... <laughs> oh, I should have done the thing that I can't see. Oh, the accelerator's just broken. Fuck, shouldn't have forwards. Come on, accelerator. You can go for it. Pin it down. Oh, God. There we go. There we go. Steady, steady. Sun will come up tomorrow. Um, Microsoft's actions for respawning and set up camp in Dragon Dunker 2, according to one of my friends. Yep, and customizing your character, which you can only do one of, and there's only one save file as well. So I hope it's an RPG where you don't ever want to like recustomize your character. There's also no way of starting a new game. Uh, or deleting your old one without going into like your files and actually deleting things. Cool. That's fun. Oh dear. Um, I can't believe Dan plays Marvel Snap and talks about it. It's so awful. I know I deserve to be cancelled. Oh god. Who remembers horse armor? Uh, yes, I remember horse armor. I remember Bethesda fucking everything up before Starfield and Fallout 76. <laughs> uh, oh dear. I can see all the jokes that are coming through and I'm ignoring all of them. Um, <laughs> I know we're three months into the year, but I'm already excited for this year's advent calendar. Oh, God. Yeah, that'll happen. Oh, seven hours. One hour to go. I am a physical tired boy now. One hour left. Come on, I need help. Dun, 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 we can do it. We can do it. We can do it. Uh, okay, we're out of control over there. What's your favourite cake? Oh my god, I will literally tell you because I'm having it tomorrow. Rebecca, that's you, Hello. makes a, uh, a carrot and walnut cake. Ooh, that's the good shit. That's the good shit. Uh, run me over always with a, a thousand twiddlies. Says bus driving, driving bus, never stop, won't stop for the bus. And that's almost set off a hype train. The last hype train of the stream. So we have the final hour. Alice Bowden. I recognize that name. Daniel, how are you still here? Are you okay? I'm still going. I've got an hour left, Alice. One hour left. One hour left. How do you think we should implement trans athletes in the Olympics? Oh my god, Jet, yeah, that's a question. That's a question and a half. Here's my very detailed answer on that. I don't know. I don't know if there's been scientific studies into how uh, shifting like genders through HRT, etc. changes your biology. I don't actually know. Um, so I, I'd like that to be checked. There you go. Uh, yeah, check that shit. Yeah, that's uh, uh it's, it's go go with the science. Just trust the science. 
I don't know what science says, but I think we should listen to the science more than anything else. Because it's not, at the end of the day, it's not just like, when it's like fucking snookers, like there was a darts, it was like, oh, well, this trans man had an advantage in darts. It's darts! The fuck, it's like a 12 year old who's currently winning it. Who gives a fuck? That's the chess as well. It's not important. That's fucking bullshit. When it comes to science, just look at the science. Because this is people's livelihoods. This is something that is actually like, you know, it's a job and stuff. Let's make it fair for everybody. And the way to do that is to listen to the actual facts. The end. Research. Science. That's what I fucking want. There. Uh, from me over always says I have leftover thingies. Thank you very much for your leftover thingies. <laughs> but anyway, that's my uh, yeah. We more respect to have uh, more categories for trans people to compete. It shouldn't be able to, unable to compete, but science does show that there is an unfair advantage for some. Then that's what we might have to do. And I know you might be going, "That fucking sucks balls," and it might fucking suck balls, but you can't just like. It's going to get it done for it, but then again, you know, sport is the genetic phrase. Actually, in Paradox, I talk about this. There's a bit of this comes up in Paradox, and I come up with what you should actually do, right? And I'm going to now spoil a little bit of Paradox Paradox. It's a footnote. I don't think it actually fucking matters. But the way sport should actually be performed is that instead of racing against other people, you, before the start of a race, you get genetically scanned, and it finds out how you grew up to this point, right? You get a full biological scan. And it works out what your peak physical performance is. So it's like, this is you at your absolute physical best. You would go at this speed. And then next to you, it creates a hologram that goes at that speed. And you have to race your peak physical self. That is how I think we should do sport. And you'll never beat them. But it's like, a how much of a percentage you get is how you then score it. So you beat yourself, but then you are ranked by what a percentage of your uh, of your actual best. Like 99.994 versus 99.9993, you know. It all gets ranked like that. And so how close you can get to how physically perfect you can be is how we then score things. That's how I think we should do it. There. Anyway. Uh, Bandino B has subscribed! Tim Alay with 200 Fiddlies. Uh, how can you wave your hands if they're on the steering wheel? Uh, they're not on the steering wheel. So, uh, well, we solved it! <laughs> Get it, scientist. Yeah. That's, uh, so basically, it's the only person that's actually worth your time being is yourself. Boop, 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 boop. Um. Uh, oh, I am Sockfish gifted five subs. Thank you very much. My voice is getting really cracky now. Uh, Rubby over always with three hundred twiddlies. Bus driving hype, man. I'm tired, so. <laughs> um. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely trash your health to uh, increase your percentage. No, because it checks how you like genetically would form at the best. So you can't like cut it down. It would go, right, you grew up, because we have all those like fucking identifiers and how things that happen to your body, go through all of those and go, okay, if you're at peak physical performance, you would have come out like this. So even if you tank yourself now, you'd still be going against your physical best, that wouldn't change. Um, it's also probably like impossible with current science. I don't fucking know, I'm not a scientist. Uh, Blee bot five. I might have to buy this Paradox Paradox. It's good, it's got a, a trans character in it. In fact, multiple trans characters in it. What? Amazing. We just should, because of the technologist says we should just ban sport. That's the easiest solution by far. I mean, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, remove the gender aspect, put everyone in different classes based on your abilities. But the problem then is that people will hold their abilities back to push forward later. That's why they do it by gender to make it more of an even playing field. But of course, sport is the domain of the genetic freaks, really. You know, that's the problem with sport. <laughs> it's where the genetic freaks go. So, to make it more fair, I would do the genetic thing. And then that that gets rid of people like Usain Bolt being able to beat absolutely fucking everyone just because genetics were insane. You know. But yeah. Um, every time Dan talks about products, products, I go to pre-order a copy forgetting I've already done that. <laughs> 
Oh dear. Um, but, 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 does that not make for a slightly depressing sport where you remind you you're not the best you could be? Well, you can never be the best. Like, physically, you can never hit that peak. You still need to... You know, you, you, you can't work all, out all the time every time. It, it's too much. But, like, knowing how close you can get is, I think, a great way of put, letting people push themselves. You know, it's like, it's the difference between Goku and Vegeta. Currently, sport is Vegeta. They're trying to beat the best, right? They're trying to beat whoever is the best, they're trying to beat that person. That's who you're up against, is whoever is the best person. Vegeta just wants to be Goku. Goku just wants to be the best Goku can possibly be. So, Vegeta's, like, training has a cap on it that is Goku and wherever Goku currently is, whereas Goku's training doesn't have a cap on it, and he will always be able to push himself higher, and that's why Goku will always beat Vegeta. And I think sports is the same. That's <laughs> Goku versus Vegeta. <laughs> ah, dear. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Um, technique is massively more important than genetics. Yeah, you gotta know all the, the technique and shit. But, like, you can, you, like, you can work it out. It's just stuff. I don't know. Sci-fi story about somewhere about someone managed to beat the hologram. Yeah, but if you start to beat the hologram, the sun's coming up. Ah, it's about you. Um, then the system isn't working, and then all stuff you gotta do some you gotta do some science. But yeah. Um. Anyway, how long have we got? Fucking left. Fifty minutes. We're doing okay. Uh, I'm stuck with you, twenty twiddlies. Here's some coal for the hype train. Thank you very much. You're in the hype train. Hi, hype train. Sport is Goku Vegeta. Most of us are Yamcha. Dude, I'm Chao Tzu. I'm just a fucking weird little possessed puppet boy. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, fuck. I broke me over a ways. Give it five subs. Rebecca's left the room. So offended by the subs. <laughs> Rebecca hates gifted subs. No. no? Oh, you like gifted subs? I love gifted subs. Hey, okay. I thought it was hate. I, I always get those two confused. <laughs> What's your favourite takeaway? Literally, whatever I can get my hands on. Whatever I can get my hands on. Uh, I do like a curry. Curry's uh, on. Nice. Um, this is seven hours in. How did I manage to miss all of this? With magic? Oh, Rebecca's just taking One Piece cards. I've seen you taking them. Hey, yours. We share money for a hype trade by spending it on a Steam Deck. That's okay. Because you left it in Tucson! Okay, those two people are still doing things. <laughs> okay. I'll stay in Vegas. It's such a... Anyway. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Are they good vegan kebabs? Or kebabs? Yeah, Vivirium. Mm, nice. Nice. Make hate gifted subs. Somebody send them to make them mad. Says <laughs> so many star. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, so yeah, Paradox is one of those books where I was like, I can write I can write any kind of characters I want. So I just filled it with trans characters and some ace character. I just want a proper representation where oh, fuck, there goes my accelerator. Where they're not just you know, the, the trans characters uh, problem isn't, I'm trans! That's all been dealt with. That's just a part of who they are. You know, their issues in character development stuff is just other stuff. And it's come, a bit of it's come off of the, the trans thing, but you know. You'll see. I'm on the terrible at Sim 5! Gifted 5 subs! Thank you very much. Oh my goodness. Rebecca's angry. Uh, Anodyne! Here, Dan. Have the rest of my twiddlies. So I play Satisfactory! Yes, may your factories be efficient and your spiders be less scary. Um, uh, Meerkat239 has resubscribed. Dan, right, we will hate that. When's the sequel coming out? There will be no sequel. Once you read the book, you'll realise I don't like sequels. Probably not a question, but how heavy do you think the book will be? Uh, it's 160 something thousand words. Currently, when formatted roughly, like really just my own formatting, it's about 650 pages. So, about the same as a 650 
page book. Actually, I've disabled the spiders with the mod to make them vanish. Yes, that's the good stuff. That's the good stuff. Um, if you if sports were you racing as a hologram yourself, would it be wild to watch someone match their hologram? No, that's the best they'll ever get. So you've seen their physical max. Yeah, and the closer you can get to it, it'll be like, ooh, like fuck, look how close that guy got. I think it'd be really interesting. It'd be super interesting. I think it's a good spectator sport as well. I think you don't have to have like a fucking full digital hologram. You can just do it with a pane of glass with some fucking, you know, lights beamed onto it. But, um, yeah. What happens if the car comes off the road? Uh, we get towed all the way back and it takes 7 hours 13 minutes currently to get back. How long does it take you to write? Four years it took me to write. I, su I submitted it on the four year anniversary of announcing it. And when I announced it, I didn't really have an idea of what it was going to be. So just over four years. It'll be, yeah. Five years in September. Oh. Oh, shit. Um. Yeah. 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 Oops, excuse me. What font is the book? We haven't picked the font yet. I'm going for Windings. Um. <laughs> I think when I'm writing it, I have it in Georgia. I like the font Georgia. It's very legible. Very lovely. It should be a bit boring. It's nobody how to beat it. Not without steroids. No. Because it's about seeing how close you get. It's not about beating it. Nobody can ever beat, like... Like, occasionally somebody might beat the world record. And you can still keep world records for faster things if you want. But it's about su he, su he, seeing who wins at a race. And everybody's going to be racing themselves. So... I don't know, I don't understand sports, but that's like, feels for me, like the best thing. Benny, you'll read that in a single footnote. That's one little footnote in Paradox, it's just off the side. <laughs> ah, the book about in Braille, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, yep. Well, we'll be walking here and then inside the mind of Matophobia. Yes. Will there be a Latin translation? No. Being married to Rebecca, do you ever think you'll go back to writing comics? Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, I guess I think. Um, Ashes could only read webdings. Oh no! Arrow pointing skull. Um, <laughs> what was that windings? I can't remember. Fuck. Anyway, how have we got? 45 minutes! We're doing this! Dr. Edward just gifted a sub! It's their first gift sub! He went to Rousey Plays YouTube. Bless you. God bless you. I think I'd have to get uh, the payback. Uh, then that's longer than my longest book. That's a long ass book. Um, yeah, it's nice to. I now, as of this stream, know that I'm getting uh, in early April. I'm getting the copy edited version back. So once I click off of like that version, then we just go to design. I think is the next stage. Design. Like I've, I kind of have written it. Like it's really weird to think, but like the actual writing of it is like. 99.9% .9 done. And basically when it comes to the copy edit, it's just punctuation. I'm like, sure, yep, fine, yep, 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 fine, yep, sure. <laughs> Surely the competition would be, uh, would get lost. The whole reason to push themselves so hard is to beat their opponents. A race that you'd always lose is demoralizing. Yeah, but if you go up against like a fucking genetic freak like Usain Bolt, you are going to lose everything. All the time. Forever. And you're never going to beat that. But if you are, you're cutting down that that's why we, we time it with percentages of how much you how much of your physical perfection you can get to can you get you're never gonna get to 100 percent, but how close can you get to it how within touching distance of physical peak perfection can you get to you know i think that's more fun um will the book we go to the finest leather no i'm vegan <laughs> definitely not uh, any particular authors who inspired you for Paradox Paradox? Oh, fucking Douglas Adams. Inspires me with everything. Uh, whenever people read it, they say it's very Pratchett-like. But again, I've not read any fucking Terry Pratchett apart from, like, a bit of a Discworld. And I was like, oh, I kind of see that. But I got that with, with fucking video games. People were like, oh, it's very Terry pratchett -y. And I'm like, cool, never read him. And I've got a few of his books I need to get around to reading. Human leather, that's fine. Any plans for any more literature? And if so, would you stay in the sci-fi genre? Um, I have three books in active writing right now. Um, one's arguably sci-fi, but it's not like future sci-fi space shit. It's definitely sci-fi, but it's not like the same kind of sci-fi. Um, I've got 
uh, a thriller and something else I'm not talking about yet. <laughs> Dan, being a nice kid, we're watching new animated X Men. Yes, but I never watched the original. Never watched the original. I remember listening to the theme song, but I have no recollection of anything that happened in it. So I think I just knew the theme song. Yep. Um, have you ever read Brandon Sanderson? No, but I have some books because what really likes Brandon Sanderson is always recommending it. What's about it? Making videos, games, or books? Books. I really like the process. The long process. It's good shit. I really enjoy that. Yeah. Do you think it's possible to organize society without authority? Well, decisions have to be made. And voting on those decisions is a good idea. Because then you get to do that with other people. Then we introduce the whole party system. Everything sort of breaks down, doesn't it? But there's so many decisions to make. How do you make them all? You know? You, know, you kind of elect people like, yeah, you think a bit like me. Let's... Well, that's pretty... You know, well, you, let's elect someone who thinks a bit like me. So that's where the party system came from. And now it's just like, no, I'm right. No, I'm right. No, I'm right. No, it doesn't really work. Um, so I think uh, authority, just from a progress point of view, is sort of inevitable. Unless you do an, an autonomy level where... Oh, you promise to give you this if you promise to give me this. But that has to be set up at a higher level. And if it goes wrong, who's going to police it? I don't know. I'm no one for organising society. I can barely drive this fucking bus. I'd vote for the dead bug. Who better than Trump? <laughs> oh, dear. Um, uh, yeah. Okay. Ugh. Well, we got. Let's go. Let's not talk about politics. Fuck me. We've got forty minutes left. Let's do this. Racing yourself is like trying to beat your personal best in a speed run. A big part of sports is competition against others, athletes, uh, or being physical freaks. They also tend to be hyper competitive. Yeah, but now you said speed running, you may realise that that is actually what I prefer. <laughs> trying to beat yourself. And you are being competitive. Like you will still be being competitive. It's how many, what percentage of beating yourself can you do? And then you get ranked to doing that. So you can still every you can still run at the same fucking time if that makes you feel better. And push yourself by doing that, but you know. Um Yeah. Desert bus speed run. I wonder if there is a desert bus speed run, and I assume it would be eight hours. <laughs> Stretch! Ugh. So it's a percentage of your best, not just winning a race. Yeah, you'll never win the race, but you get like, what percentage, you, if you're at 99% of your best, then that is your score that goes on the leaderboard. Are you basically just describing archery or other target sports? I don't know, I've never seen them scored. Did you play during the Pokemon Go Tour the other weekend? Oh, was that, oh no. Oh God, there's a third person. <laughs> okay. Bus is getting freaky. The sun's coming out. I don't like it. I don't like it. Life Hacker 42 has been saying that the genetic scan, if it detects your starting position, so everyone at the peak was still tired, then they can compete in a more visually appealing way. That is the way that somebody who actually watches sports would think about it, yes. Yeah, I mean, yeah, sure, fuck it. Yeah, that's better, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. And it should be a straight line, not a big circle. That's what I say. There's peer pressure down to turn around at eight hours and go back. All right, good luck, I'm 35. I don't give a fuck about what my peers think. They've all met me. Oh, dear. Important life questions, possessions. Is Cannibal worth using? I've had somebody use Cannonball against me three times so far, and in all three occasions I've ended up winning the match. People don't really know how to use it just yet. Um, the only thing it's really useful for, it destroys cards it can't move, so replaces them with a rock. A lot of people don't fill up their spaces, so that's, that's fine. But with Blob, Blob's ability is that it can't move. So as a pure, down-the-line Blob killer, it will always kill Blob. That's when it's useful. So if you're seeing a lot of blobs, I think Cannibal is useful. 
but I don't see a lot of blobs anymore. I was running blob for ages and nobody was using it anymore. So cannonball, maybe not worth using right now. Definitely not on the, we got a few good cards that are coming up, so I, I'm saving my keys. I'm saving my keys, baby. That was a Marvel Snap discussion with Ashens. That's a bit specific. It is. I mean, when Blob came out, it would have been fucking the best card in the game. <laughs> but, yeah. Saving my keys, baby. Um, yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, there's a... Then you should have a... I'd rather be playing Battle for a bumper sticker. I might have that. I might have that. Marvel Snap sent me insane because I always had the wrong cards. Is that Marvel Snap's fault or is that your fault? I don't know. I don't know. Oh, fuck. You playing Black Shook in turn back? No, my dog is. Uh, Aqua Alpha. Don't run the YouTubes with 199 Pounderonies. Yeah, Black Shook is being played by Lilith. Because uh, she's terrifying. Ah, <laughs> uh, dear. Anyway. It's my good... Uh, oh, my back. Fuck, you know. Still alive, baby. Still alive. How difficult would it be to be back in a snap after being away since season one? That is the same question as how do you become a creator now? I don't know. I've played it literally every single day. I checked during this to make sure I would have uh, had the uh, thingies going on. Actually, who's in my store? Should we see who's in the store today? Ba -ba -ba -ba. What was your opinion of the Hogwarts Legacy strike that happened when it was released? I don't know. I didn't look at the game. I didn't play the game. The end. Um, yeah. I did a video going, oh, I think, you know, it should be fine to play it. You know, separate author and things. You know, like, you know, Roald Dahl was dodgy in this way. And Ender Blyton was dodgy in this way. And then a lot of trans people went, yeah, but J.K. Rowling's still alive. And I went, well, that's a fucking good point I didn't consider. You can actually you still do harm to the fucking uh, to the trans community. So yeah, you're right. No, you're right. That's what I edited the video. Uh, oh, I don't have any damn hip variants in my store. Bah. Bah. Anyway. Um. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Oh my god, YouTube. What's YouTube saying? Dan's dogs play Marvel Snap in a video. Yeah, they could do, anyone. Hey Dan, did you know Edward Midland, developer of The Binding of Isaac, made a game of I Isaac called The Binding of Isaac Four Souls? Card game! Yes! And there's a reason I know that. It's because all of it is in my house. Rebecca got it all. Rebecca's a huge Binding of Isaac fan. And has all of it. <sighs> oh yeah. Dan, you got me to Marvel Snap for your first stream! I fell for a while, uh, and this has come back. Uh, just time for the undo turn button. Oh, yes. I love that little undo turn button now. And having a discard to the thingy, pretty soon there'll be a clan system, and I'm going to start a good old clan. I'm going to have a good time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Another problem with that T crowd. It's one of my favorite shows, but Grey Blue Hand is a piece of shit. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Yep, 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 yep. The heads are spinning, I don't know why. Clan, 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 clan. Yes, there'll be a clan, don't worry about it. <laughs> Expect to see a little chef on the side of the road. <laughs> we play Hogwarts Legacy when J.K. Rowling dies. No, I don't give a fuck about Harry Potter, thinking about it. Um, I was like, that might be fun to get into the... Th Actually, it's just a generic game. It feels a great game as well, then maybe. Oh, there goes my accelerator. Click, click, click. Have you ever seen Avatar The Last Airbender? No. I watched the prequel. Avatar The First Airbender. Yeah. I mean... Boop. Um, for the most part, the IT crowd's fine, but then the last episode uh, is about them being taken out of context and being put on the internet. I'm just like, oh no! Yeah, there's some... Yeah, there's some stuff. What's your QI recently? Grab Lena... Uh, Lena... <laughs> <laughs> Line of cunt fuck. Good spelling. Uh, it was one episode I could up working myself to watch. Yeah, you just got the vibe. You're like, oh. oh. How's your Pop Viva collection going? I have one and it's of me. And that's all I have. Need a wee again. Where's Rebecca? Rebecca! 
Please come and save me. Please. I need help. Rebecca. I got away. <laughs> it's too long. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> Being old is hard. It's fucking difficult. I'm gonna be like this. You can have chin cam for this bit. <laughs> Fuck. Damn, what time is it you are? It's quarter to eight. Nine, hang on, what did I lie and say my thing was earlier? <laughs> oh, oh. You can stop the bus. I don't know. I don't know if you can. I'm over here now. Oh. Oh, the clock's gone back. I swear it said 7.30 earlier. The clock stopped. The clock has fucking stopped. Can't wait to hold the gas down for you. That doesn't help. You need to steer. I veer to the right. I'm a YouTuber. Nice tea. Thank you. They're British. <laughs> Half faster, okay. Okay. Your dashboard says half past. Why is the computer wrong? Because that's actually just counting hours. It's just hours. <sighs> Have you been playing this for eight hours? That's insane. It's definitely is a thing. When I did the live stream one, I wasn't actually having to play a game, I've realized. And when I did the, the one where I split it into the gaps, I think between two of them I took a break. Fuck, there goes the controller again. Come on! <sighs> the insanity is hit. If you have found any younger social media personalities actually state you as an inspiration, there's quite a few, yes. It's quite unnerving. I like being described as a, as one of the OGs. Uh, oh, I just looked. I looked over there, and suddenly everything everything's like it's moving towards me. Uh, mirror being on Dan's shoulders, where I get because his shirt looks like the bus seats. Oh fuck! Do you like dogs? If so, what's your favorite dog? My dogs are my favorite dogs. Ah, oh, come on! Stick down! I'm really breaking this controller. It's fine. I've got it going again. Uh... Shutting down. Any last questions before we wrap the stream up in half an hour? What kind of controller is it? It's blue. Shit. Oh, God. Thoughts of Rooster Teeth shutting down. Uh, they were doing shit that I didn't know what they were doing. I just thought they made red versus blue. Turns out it's a lot more. Right, we're about 30 minutes left now. It's the one thing about this is the destruction is horrific control. Oh, no, it's working fine. It's just the way I've slightly broken it is fine. Windows XP shutdown sounds. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Do your dogs sleep in the bed? No. I mean, they can if they want to, they just don't. <laughs> uh, how many sheep can you count? Let me try. Hang on, one. Two. And throw. I'm really about to fall asleep. This just is such a tiring game. But yeah, I've realized I've never actually had to play it for all eight hours. Like, just straight. How quickly did you go through controls and PC mice? Controls quite quickly, PC mice not very fast. Okay, this stream with the EastEnders theme. I have to find it. 
Alexa, play the EastEnders theme. I don't have an Alexa. <laughs> How many Tom Maltesers can you fit in your mouth? Zero, they're not vegan. Um, Alright. Let's play No More Jockeys. No more jockeys, right, let's play a game of no more jockeys. I'll go first. Um, Amy Rose, don't look at your desk, bookshelves. Amy Rose, no more characters who are male characters, just pink or with tits. Up to you, chat. This is how we play. I've seen your Monopoly Plus testing video 24 times. That's very weird. What? Says Ike Brooks. I don't know this game. You don't know this game? No more jockeys. I say a person in a role and you can't say anything about those people. There we go. Alex Salt on YouTube. Shoot that one. No more actors. Big one. Okay. Um, me. No more people involved. No more people who've ever played Desert Bus. And I'm not an actor. <laughs> I don't have an acting stem on Wikipedia. I'm not an actor. Oh, fuck. I'm not an actor. No, I'm not an actor. I may have acted. I'm not an actor. There's a difference. <laughs> you have an IMDb page. I had that before I was in a film. It doesn't matter. An IMDb can be filled with anyone. It's acting stem. It's all about the acting stem. Dan, any advice on what to do now I've lost my job, says uh, Meow Chico. Uh, find another one. Or do some freelance stuff. Take a little bit of time to think about yourself, if you can afford to. Marius the Rogue says, Dan John Harkassel, born 23rd of March. I am 89, Jesus. No, there's no cubed or no cubed. Is it British? YouTuber, author, and actor. Oh, I lose. <laughs> I'm D DJ Hargassel? Yeah. Can you continue with no more uh, extra dimensional entities? There goes me. I got a Wikipedia on it. It turns out. Ulysses is an actor, writer, director on IMDb. What the fuck have I directed? <laughs> I'm really crying. It's, it's the crash. You gotta get me through this, people. You gotta get me through this. Come on. Country roads. Here we go. Did you ever try that was on YouTube? Yeah, and I hated it, and that's why I started to do YouTube. Here we go. Country roads. To your place. Avalon. West Virginia. Here's a coffee. I don't drink coffee. Rebecca's here. Rebecca's yawning. Hi. Hello. I was going to get you to come in because I needed a way back. Actually, now I need a post. So I might as well just uh, keep this going. Oh. Unless you want to drive for like 10 minutes. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, 15. I won't rush. How far, far up to the end are you? Uh, 7 hours 37 minutes in. And I started like 2 minutes, 3 minutes past. So I'd say I've got another that much time left. Half an hour and a little bit more. Sleepy. <laughs> so sleepy. It really led to the, the repair in motion and the having to constantly play it. Oh dear. You've directed this bus to the left about eight hours. Oh dear. Hi everyone. Yeah, because these are not country roads, it's a desert. Desert road to take me home to a place I belong. West Virginia, West Nevada, South Nevada, somewhere in Nevada. Country road. 
Take me home. There's a present to the place. Come to Canvey Island. It's a hell of a drive from fucking Las Vegas. I don't want to set the world on fire. I just want to boo. <laughs> <laughs> That was for you, that's right. Oh dear, right. Okay. Put on K-Rose. I've got Dusty Rose. Oh fuck. <laughs> it's fine. Amy's head by the desk, it's fine. <sighs> Press the stop button. Bing. Thank you. Press that thing. Wasn't this that pen and tell game or something like that? Yeah. If I push that button, pen's probably still talking. Oh fuck. I've taken out a break. How's the consistency of damn brain? Well, you're called Egg Biscuits, and I think that's a pretty good vibe. Oh, favorite GTA radio station? Flash! Flash. Flash FM. Maybe V Rock. Eyes on the road, you wazzock. That made me do a thing. You have been to Vegas in real life. This is real life. Look, I'm here. Look. Woo! In the, in the mirror. You fools. I'm if you veer off. It crashes. People in the bus, you're unable to talk. People in the bus! There's three of them making out over there. Once I'm a fit and two at the back might be dead. I don't know who they are. Oh dear. 20 minutes! 20 minutes! 23 minutes! Rebecca, give me a song to sing. I don't know my brain doesn't work. I don't know my brain doesn't work. I asked for a song, didn't get one cause I'm a jerk. If this was Fallout, John would still be picking his perks. Cause I'm pretty stupid, but John is a burk. Thank you. <laughs> Plenty of maps, it's 30 hours from Tucson to West Virginia. West Virginia. Anything by Pink Floyd is long enough to kill time. Yeah, but how am I supposed to do that? You're right. He's tired as me. Gotta get to two songs, so I really got shit. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually, this is a tense moment. Will I be able to make the two songs before I shit my pants? I'm 35, you don't know. It could, this could go either way. It's like you. Hey. Hey. Okay. Play Wonderwall. I don't have a shotgun. If you back, go back to this, I go, go <laughs> to this game. It's like cocaine to him. Yeah, that's what people say about cocaine, isn't it? You don't do it for a decade, and then you just do eight hours of it at once. Uh, were you disappointed when the ELO announcement was just a US tour? No, I've seen them live. I don't care. Could you please sing the Doctor Who theme song? Eight hour loop version. Can do, Snowy! <laughs> oh God. How long was the flight simulator road trip? Uh, that was 20 hours. I was a younger man back then. <laughs> Sing Paul Radio 10 hour version. Okay. This was a triumph. I need you to do the back of music. Just go. Boom, 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 boom. Okay, do that. Boom, 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 boom. That's all I need from you. Boom, 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 boom. Rebecca. Boom, 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 boom. Rebecca. Boom, 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 boom. Rebecca. Boom, 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 boom. Tower Bunny has just resubscribed. Boom, 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 boom. That was like six minutes ago. Boom, 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 Rebecca left. <laughs> uh, I need to drill a hole in there. You know when the Victorians were like, 
we think you've got a headache and that's caused by a demon in the brain so we're gonna drill a hole in your head and let the demons out I understand the fuck out of that the amount of times the amount of times I'm like if I could drill a hole in my head right now I'd fucking do it I would absolutely fucking do it sing the theme song from Sonic R which, uh, which hang on wait what was it I, my brain immediately goes to living in the sea in Super Sonic Racing, but it's not. What's the what's the first level's one? Oh my god, I don't even know it. What the fuck's the first level? Can you feel the sunshine? Does it brighten up your day? Don't you feel like sometimes you go fucking insane driving a desert bus across the thing? Hey, Rebecca. <laughs> Is 17 to 18 minutes left. I need to make boom boom. <laughs> <laughs> Pressure video is live. It went live at 8. No, wait. Don't be a fucking leave. Come back, all of you cunts. The city theme. Living in the city, you know you have to survive. You got to keep that dream alive. Well, everything is real, can't you feel? Living in the city! That's it, living in the city. Mind over matter. You don't need to poop! Definitely need to poop. <laughs> Longest I've ever gone in my life without doing a poop. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> Sing Ice Cap Zone, please. Dun 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 I've got the tired crazies. Oh, Subray six five. Ooh, do you not like it? Not really. I'll eat it. That's like 40 pounds worth of chocolate you got there. I am. <laughs> Read Sabri 651's at the top with 500 twiddlies. I'll give a thousand more twiddlies if Dan pronounced my name correctly when reading this. Sabri! Save a 651. Sabri! <laughs> Sabri! <laughs> Hi everyone. <laughs> Rooftop run says the dapper cyborg. No, they're pretty solid poops. <laughs> you okay? They're very, very fucking tired. This was a terrible, brilliant time. <laughs> Saber six five one says it's a good thing Rebecca was here. Thank you, Sabri. <laughs> Can we get a kiss from a rose as the next song? There used to be a girl you got it in the world of the street. You'd have been the face of the Lord's chutney. So you know that I could have put it better. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's going wrong, best friend. I need help. I need support. You don't have that long left. Good. <laughs> Lin Max says they can't breathe because suddenly get medical attention to Lin Max. Oh fuck! <laughs> Made me jump. Dan's lost his mind. Yeah. He's crowning. It's called having a tail head. <laughs> mm. No. Let me shout myself there on that note, same. 
Pretty sure there's a fifth head up in the front row now. Oh my god. We gotta get there quickly, they're forming something. Don't like what's happening there at all. Anyway. Touching cloth, it's touching the chair. Right, Daniel, you <laughs> poo, I'll do the fucking game. No, you just want to take the last ten minutes! You're like one of those people at the hotel who are like, we take you back, and you've brought it all the way from fucking Scarborough. Yeah. And then like in fucking Malaga, and they're like, oh, I'll take it ten feet, and then what a fucking tip. <laughs> that is me. You're Bastards. Me Bastards! Damn, what's the air fresh to smell of? <laughs> Pine. And dead insects. Anyway. Dan is actually a wombat. The poop is where the cube comes from. I do actually have cubed poops. I'm kidding. It's just like an explosion. You know when they like clear a sewer with that like dynamite or blow up a whale? That's what it's like. You ever see footage of them sticking a dynamite in a dead whale on the beach to try and blow it up? That's what it looks like. Do you still love me? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sing Mr. Blue Sky. Rebecca, do this. Sun is shining in the blue sky, Mr. Blue Sky, sky blue, blue sky blue. He's a blue sky, blue sky, sky blue, 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 blue sky, Mr. Sky. He's a blue, 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 blue sky, sky. That's it. Dan Crash, it'd be funny. I don't think it would. I think I would actually shut down. Don't think now. What you can't hear, because these are soundproof windows, is the sirens that have been chasing me for the last eight hours. <laughs> yeah, I've been on the run quite a while now. Just how I remembered it. That's it. If you crash, we get to hang out more. If I crash. You don't want to be on this bus. Last seven minutes have been the most fun and chaotic time I've had this entire drive, so I'm glad I stayed here for all of it. It's not chaotic. Stick your bum out the window and poop where you drive. I've tried that before, but if someone's got a window open further back, it's just, they're going to get a face full of it. You don't want that. <laughs> Dan, mate, call you daddy. No, I'm not a daddy. Baby. He's become unhinged. Become? How many twiddlies to crash the bus? A million billion twiddlies and I'll crash the bus. I'll make the bus really crash and put a dick on it or something. Damn, that bus is really fuel efficient. It's solar powered. On the roof there's solar things. It's electric vehicles. They're really good. Are you a fun uncle? No. I'm a grumpy twat. Ten minutes! Baby. Ah. Have you any regrets about naming yourself No Cubed? Are you still like I like the name, it's a good name. It's a good name, I like it. Maybe not the cube bit. The note bit's good. We'll work on the cube bit. Uh, 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 Raven Moonfall says we're almost there. We are almost there. You think we've seen Vegas by now? I'm not thinking about that. Dad, your Patreon video is private. Oh. Well, maybe it goes up at 9. And the Patreon post has gone up at 8. I just have a quick nap. Checking that would be okay. If you had to change your name, what would you pick? Uh, I'd call myself Free iPhone. <laughs> free app. I don't know. I've had 20 years watching this 8 hour stream. Same. Baby, I forgot there's something dear, baby, dear, baby, dear. What's the red button, dude? Turns on the radio. I want radio. I'm the radio. Six minutes. Hell yeah, nearly there. Hell yeah, nearly there. Hell yeah, nearly there. Dang, we have a prediction of the kind of poop you're going to have. You know the bit in The Simpsons where Bart shakes that can up? 
then jumps out home and goes, April Fool! And then the whole thing explodes and destroys the house. That's the kind of vibe. That's the kind of vibe. Ah! Fuck me. Rebecca? Yeah. Do you want to take over for a second? I'm going to have to poop. <laughs> I need you to. There's only five minutes left. I can't take over if there's only five minutes left. You have to because I'm about to shit my pants. <laughs> I had too much pizza. What? It's the spicy chili. I can't end your stream you for your birthday. You can. I love you. There was no. something. Look, oh, wait. Down. Is it still accelerating? It's not accelerating anymore. What's the accelerate button? Okay, it's that button. Oh god, I've got to keep... What, what speed am I supposed to be driving at? Do I just hold it down? It was clicked in before! Also, I don't know if I'm on the thing. Oh, there I am. Wait, where, where, where should I be? I should be there. Hello? Oh dear. What's he like? I can't... Well, I can, I can, I can do maximum speed. It won't be a problem, right? Oh, it's got a max speed. All right, okay, okay, that's good. You're all very lovely, chat, thank you. What's it? For goodness sake, I can't end his birthday stream, his channel birthday stream and his birthday stream. That's ridiculous, I can't end that. I can't believe Rex be driving for eight hours. Yeah, I don't know what he's whinging about, it's not that bad. He is a silly boy, he's a very silly boy. I'm not gonna crash it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I legitimately want to. And I could, cause I could just crash it and then just leave. But that's mean, it's his birthday and it's his birthday wish to finally finish this. But also, how funny would it be? <laughs> how many to at least to crash? I think it's poetic for you, but it's not. It's not poetic if I finish it. Right, little Grace. Don't you tell me to do it. Oh my goodness. I think let me move. Oh god, I wonder how long he's gonna be. Oh god. There we go. <laughs> do it for the fine. Oh, well if you say do it for the fine. <laughs> Uh, Farmer Beige says the most poetic thing would be if he crashed it, but genuinely as an accident. There is a good chance that that's going to happen. Oh, three minutes left. What if I just crash? <laughs> what if I just crash it at the last second? Like Daniel gets back in the room and I immediately just. Be <laughs> that would be pretty good. <laughs> Fair. I would really enjoy that. Come on, just nourish the sand a little bit. Stop t You're all that little devil on my shoulder. All of you. All of you. Every single one. Oh wait, no, we've got, we've got Felix on YouTube chat saying don't listen to them. Thank you for being on my other shoulder. I'm back. You're all right. I'm back, I'm fine. <laughs> Taking all the glory, is it? Oh, <laughs> that that um, pedal is unfortunate. Oh. It's yeah, it's been doing that. The way I've been trying to trick it down is, uh... Oh. Steady. <laughs> oh, if it went to shit now, I'd be annoyed. Hello! Guess who's back? Back again! Everyone's saying don't crash. Down there, we're trying to ruin your birthday. Well, it's fast as shit, huh? Well, you gotta... You can't every... No, every shit can be an experience. Sometimes you just gotta get the job done, you know? Rebecca wanted to crash the bus. <laughs> Come on, just nudge the sand a little bit with a thousand tiddlies from Rugby <laughs> Oakway. If a million tiddlies came in, I'd crash the bus right now. It's 7.59. Yeah, well, well, I wouldn't do that. Um, definitely didn't wipe. You don't need a wipe. It's a liberal myth. <laughs> There's eight of us on the bus. <laughs> it's like six of you, one fucking space. Are you ready? 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 
Do you know your Patreon vid is uh, Marcus Private? Oh yeah, I'll just check that out. <laughs> Eight hours! Fellas, is it gain away? Eight hours! But we need to go, it's sort of eight hours, two minutes. Three minutes, sorry. It's good. One month of the way through. Woo! Dakota Show with 10 twiddly pounds. How about the day I've been watching this channel since the original Sim series? I was told when it came out. 22 now. I'm trying to think about that. I'm going to try not to think about that. Uh, Sabrior 651 with 8 twiddly sub gift over Gemlios. Dappy with 10 twiddly, so they pretended it was a lot more. Boo. Boo. Romeo says that wasn't me, it was supposed to be a glitch or something. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm just moving around now, there's a little time left. Yeah! Party! Oh no, don't look that way. Because I might miss Las Vegas! Which I think is still about soon, a bit minutes away. Oh, one minute, okay, go, I give it it. And it was like near the end of two, so probably three. Ticking in about three. Jerry, got check the cost of twiddlies after that. Says Sam Tombot. Hey, if you want to give me a million twiddlies, you got a little bit of time left. Uh, Contact Center Girl has resubscribed for four months, almost a year. Uh, run me uh, over always. Three hundred twiddlies. Says woo hours. Woo. Viva Dan Vegas. Uh uh. Viva Dan Vegas. Uh uh. Viva. Viva Lynn Mac with six thousand twiddlies. Says congratulations. We haven't got there yet. We haven't got there yet, but we're getting there. We're getting, we're getting there. It's good. Crash with one second left, says Ashens. No! <laughs> As they subscribe, no, Ashens. I have to do it. I have never beaten it in one go before. I mean, technically, I had to do a shit in this one, so it doesn't really count either. So, you know, next time I do, I'll be like, I've never done it in one go before, but I have, you know. I took like a little break in the other one. And... Are we going to play Ballad at Vegas? Yeah. And we're going to see Penn and Tell. Every viewer gives 2,000 twiddlies, we could hit 1 million. Yeah, I mean, you can do that anyway, it's fine. Are we there yet? I don't know, not yet! Ah! Say happy birthday to me, Rebecca, in the style of uh, Skylar singing it to Oh, Ted. God! I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> That's the worst bit of television. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Come on, one more minute. One more minute. I wonder if you see a sign. It might just fade to black, like, you did it! <sighs> celebratory twiddlies from Blue Panda 397. 700 celebratory twiddlies, thank you very much. It's three, where is it? Why hasn't it stopped yet? Come on! Where is it? End! And <laughs> why is it still going? Is it because it kept stopping and I lost little bits of time all the time? Please end. But please end. Uh, 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 oh, what if my skidding was slowing me down? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Rebecca wins Vegas. <laughs> Rebecca wins from his Las Vegas. I can't see it! I can't see Las Vegas! I was promised Las Vegas! I, I was... We took a wrong turn! <laughs> so shit time. I don't fall, this is bullshit! I'll see you Las Vegas in another desert, Mario. It's a veggie snake. No! Yes, yeah, this is Ve Vegas was bombed before I... Uh... Mm. Yeah. Discount for daylight savings. That's not how miles work! I don't think so anyway. Oh no, there's no such thing as Vegas. It's eight hours at full speed. It's so. Simmons dude, I was doing full fucking speed. I had the thing held down with magnets. I really should have paid attention to what was on the counter, uh, uh, the mile counter in the bottom right there before we took off. Because it was 360 miles, and I don't know. What, what was it when we started? Go back! Someone check the footage! Let me know what number that needs to get to! This isn't even American. Wreck has wandered off. Shame. <laughs> Shame. Crashing will take you to Vegas. Oh, that makes sense. No. No. Uh, 
six. Zero point nine miles. Uh, any of these true? Rebecca said the bus right when you were in the toilet. <laughs> you dick. Uh, less that than a mile ago. Great prank if I could have done that. <laughs> <laughs> we wasted a lot of time when I said this. So I've not got a straight line then, I suppose. And also when they kept going do 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 do. Oh. Yeah, make it. Make it go. I'm gonna miss my friend Barry the Bog. He was a good boy. Congrats, maybe a premature. Ellie Selkie gifted three subs. <gasps> Is that sign? Is that Vegas? Oh my god, there's something up ahead! Oh my god, what's that? Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Las Vegas! We did it! Yeah! Alrighty then, we have made it to Las Vegas in Desert Bus. <laughs> shake hands, shake hands, shake hands. Uh, I watched from the beginning to the end, and I can't believe it's just Mr. Flayne. Happy birthday, Dad. Thank you. Viva Las Vegas, how to the king of Desert Bus, me bitches! I was here! All those acne traps are wasted, this is one of my jokes. Oh. Wait, the most important thing. I have a score of one! One score, one score, one score. Wow. We did it. We did it. Now back again, yay! So spoiler warning. <laughs> <laughs> Enigmatic Wraith gifted a hundred subs! Holy shit! Nobody cares. Holy fuck, thank you so much Enigmatic Wraith for a hundred subs! Let's fucking go again! Do -do -do -do. I'm being towed. <laughs> Leave me alone! Leave me alone! They'll tow me all the way back, it's fine. Uh, Bruce O'Reilly! 200 twiddlies! To Las Vegas! Whee! <laughs> oh dear. Oh, we're slowing down! Yay! Get time to play the start! Sing the achievement! Woo! Hello, thank you all for joining the program. Shut up! And Shut up! And okay. <laughs> we did it, everyone! Oh, yeah, everyone got off. That was our stop. Well, that was a horrifying nightmare of hatred that I hated doing, and I will never do again until I do it on another thing. You go quite far off the road. Yeah, it turns out you can. It's Las Vegas twice. Las Vegas looks empty. No, no, there's like a dot over there. That's cool. It's all fine. Oh, people are in. Tucson, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Gonna get a different fucking driver. Let me out. Let me out. Anyway. Same time again next year. Dear God, no. Uh, Retro Neon 353 official. This is like giving birth. I've got to forget about it first. You know, all the pain and shit. Um, oh, fuck. Camera's got for sight. Uh, well, we laughed a bit, we had an alright time, but now it is time to end the fucking stream. I forgot that the, they've made raiding really weird now for some fucking reason. Who's live and who's doing stuff? Who's live and who's doing stuff? Who's live and who's doing stuff? Do, do, do. Boofy! Fuck it, I'm raiding Boofy, there we go. Send your boofies away. They've raided us a whole bunch of fucking times. So, thank you all very much for coming out, for, for being here for the double birthday celebration extravaganza. You were here live. You made it happen. But for me and Rebecca, we're fucking out. Goodbye, everybody. Bye.
More dramatic. Come on, it's a fucking birthday stream. Bye. More. Bye. More. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Bye.